We're not gonna map pat into the lore, but we're gonna try to just enjoy as much as we can. Uh, following clips are raw footage excerpts from Alex Crawley, a college friend of mine. Is that like those corn mill things? In 2006, Alex was in the process of shooting his student film entitled Marble Hornets. Over the three months that this took place, his film crew complained of his increasing levels of stress and irritability. Is Alex? Was that the, was that the name? Yeah. <laughs> Alex, are you the main character in this? <laughs> thank you, thank you. I'm gonna pause this because it goes too fast. He told me it was due to the unworkable conditions on his set, which was less than a mile away from his house. That is very close. I asked what he planned to do with the countless number of tapes he had filmed. Burn them. Were these like VHS tapes? Were they filming on VHS? Being a film student myself, I hated to see all of his work go to waste? Go to waste. <laughs> Goes fast. And after some coercing, he agreed to give them to me. Under the condition that I never mention it to him again. This looks like a Florida road, doesn't it? It just looks like Florida to me. The flat. Oh wait, never mind. <laughs> Soon after, Alex transferred to another school and I haven't seen him since. At the time, I was too unnerved to look through the tapes and eventually forgot about them. A few days ago, I found them filed away in the back of my closet. Welcome to your tape. After three years and zero contact with Alex, I've decided to look through them. All the tapes are unnumbered and missing timestamps. Timestamps, other than okay, other than taking place in the summer of 2006, it is impossible to determine the exact order or date of each. Wow. Hmm. So are they like all out of order then? Like we're going to be watching the tapes, but they're like all out of order. Um, Joshi, the Walton Files. I, oh, I love the Walton Files. The problem is I've already seen them. So I can't give a genuine first time reaction, which honestly, just to watch someone watch it who's already knows it, like it's boring to me. I wish at the time when I was watching through, I didn't know that I'd be doing this kind of stuff. So um, I wish I would have done it because I love the Walton Files. I love the story and it's so interesting to me. Should I find anything in any of them, I will upload it to keep as a permanent record. Entry number one. Okay, I'm scared. Oh gosh, okay. Guys, it looks so brain here. I promise it's so dark. It's like raining outside too. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. After viewing a couple of tapes and finding nothing unusual, I came across a clip that doesn't fit in with the others. From what I can tell, the following footage takes place inside Alex's house, not on the set of Marble Hornets. The audio has been removed. Either the microphone was disabled at the time or it was taken out afterwards. There's no jump scares in this, is there? Oh no, sorry, I'm, I'm brave, I'm not gonna hide, I'm brave. No, 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 sorry, sorry, no. <laughs> Whoa, okay, okay, it's just a dude in a suit, it's fine, I'm not scared. This was the only thing that was out of the ordinary on this particular tape, just some dude in a suit, that's fine. After seeing this clip, I'll keep an eye out for occurrences similar to this one. Dude, there's something about that clip. Uh, that's the only clip I remember from seeing. We only, I only watched like two or three with my friend at the time when this came out. So once we get past like three, I know nothing of this story. Um, I didn't, I just remember that clip and like looking through a window and I remember thinking it was the most horrifying thing I've ever seen. So even though it looks so silly right there, now as an adult, I look at it, my like kid self is like, oh, the trauma. Entry number two. Entry number two. After a few more hours of tapes, I found this clip of Alex talking while driving. Oh. For now, I will assume that this probably took place before the en events of entry one. I got home late tonight and I was taking Rocky for his walk about uh, 20 minutes ago, so around midnight. This was near the set of Marble Hornets. Uh, 
a little bit farther down the road, we saw this really tall guy standing in the middle of the street, just completely still. For whatever reason, this really set off Rocky, and uh, he, just, he got really scared. He wouldn't move, and he kept on pulling out his leash to go back home. There was something about this guy that was just, it was strange. So uh, we headed back home. I have a little bit of time left on this tape, and uh, I'm going to go see if he's still hanging around. In fact, I think this is the light that he was standing under. So I'm going to have a look here. Okay, you can't really see it well on the camera, but I don't see anyone around here, so I guess he's right. moved on. Uh, I don't like this. <laughs> but yeah, there's just something about that. The tape ends there. Okay. Okay. They're not, they're like, they're building it up. From what he describes, I think he has seen something similar to that figure that appears in entry one. Entry three. Entry is such a weird word. I'm starting to like not. Yep. I'm starting to notice a vast majority. Good. Okay. Rude. I am starting to notice that a vast majority of the tapes are completely unrelated to Marble Hornets. At some point, it seems Alex began filming himself exclusively. The following clips are taken from roughly 12 tapes. like newspaper ASMR. What is the opening? What? I don't like that. I don't like just the camera moving over like trees. What was that? What the heck is that? What was that? Like tape or something? Is that Alex? You like ripping paper ASMR? <laughs> I like spray bottle. Okay. No, I don't like this bit. I don't like when it's just trees. I don't like the trees. Oh, if Tree was here right now, Tree sometimes joins my live streams. Tree, where are you? We have. Uh... Oh, that's Alex. That's Alex. He's becoming a daily vlogger. Used to be me. Oh. Is there... I can't see myself and look at this. Okay, sorry. I just realized I have like this stump all over my finger. Okay, sorry. Okay, wait, let me go back. This is so obscure. Why, why was he in like, he was in like, um, what is he in? Is this just a room? Why does it look like a storage closet? Sorry, I'm reading too much into it. Hi, Derwood. If I said that right. From what I have been seeing so far, many of these tapes could contain nothing substantial. Yeah, I mean, so far there's really not much anything other than the guy. Although it does seem that Alex wanted to have a camera on himself at all times. That is true, but that could be, like, I don't know. Like, this is before the whole, like, influencer era, so but I guess, I don't know. Okay, the clip from entry one is still the best lead I have so far. Okay. Phone ringtone makes you go into fight or flight? <laughs> What's the story? Um, try to watch the background. Is hidden oh oh like um haunting of hill house ah hello hello wait i didn't read <laughs> 
I found another tape containing strange footage and no audio track. When there's no audio, is that like a hint? That's something, okay, we're gonna watch the background. Oh, I'm nervous. Oh, I'm nervous. I'm not nervous. There's nothing to be scared. <laughs> okay. I didn't. I didn't. <laughs> Sorry. I'm fine. I that just I just wasn't expecting it to be like moving and in my brain's reaction was that it was coming at me and that's what scared me. We're fine. I'm that wasn't that that really wasn't scary and I'm ashamed that I reacted that way. We're going to continue. Yeah, see that movement. Just I wasn't expecting someone to be moving. Where'd he go? Oh gosh, put my tea down. I cannot trust my body. Gosh. Okay, so this and entry one are the only clips I have found that do not have sound. Okay, so when there's no sound. Okay, so they're like laying out the lore for us. My soul flew away. In this entry, to be honest, I'm so glad they use them better later on. Oh gosh, I am nervous about that. Entry five. Before Marble Hornets began production, I went to locations. I went location scouting with Alex. I filmed him talking about the locations he was interested in using. I came across one of the tapes containing this footage that has had its audio severely what distorted. All right, just recording. Okay. Uh, this is the gazebo where I want Brian to come back and reflect. Later in the movie, this will probably be about three-fourths of the way through. This will just be by himself, right? Yeah. Uh, I'm thinking about maybe putting in a... No. Not a fan. I don't like... No thanks. No. Stop. Stop. What? Am I supposed to see something? And we'll have him like reflect and decide to actually go back to Sarah, try to win her back. Ash! Ash! Welcome, Ash! Save me! <laughs> Ash from Game Theory is here. Yes, welcome. Um, and we got a good number of shots here. We have the stream down there. See, um, then he's so quiet. Included, I guess. All right. All right. This is going to be near Sarah's hunting camp. Um, over there is where we're going to do the bonfire scene. Yeah. Uh, I also want to have a shot <laughs> of the next day where uh, Sarah and Brian. Uh, I might also have Tim there at some point. Uh, are sitting around thinking about the past. This is like me in high yeah. school. When I was in high school, I used to, um, like mid and late high school, I used to gather a bunch of friends. Um, I wasn't a film student like this, but I used to gather friends after school and like film music videos to um, songs, not my own songs, but like other people's songs. We would make like fan music videos out of them. And uh, this just reminded me of that. of just like standing in a place and being like, yeah, I want this and I want it to go like this. I mean, that's basically all filmmaking is. Uh, it just depends how many people you have working on it. I really like this place. We have the tree line that basically blocks off our entire shooting. Area. I'm so nervous now because now I know at any point they can just bleh, bleh, bleh at me. <sighs> no, don't look up into the trees. What's that tall red thing over there? I thought he was going to say, what's that tall man? <laughs> long, long. It's like cursed land. Don't zoom in on it again because it's going to go bleh, bleh, bleh. 
be funny if every time we zoomed in, zoomed out, stopped, sure zoomed in, bleh. <laughs> in addition to the audio distortion, there have also been numerous instances of visual tearing. Tearing, crying visuals. Sorry. I've noticed these occurring in previous entries as well. How? I didn't notice anything. Oh. Now I notice it. <laughs> ah, thank you for pointing it out. Don't scare me with the same thing again. <laughs> it is possible that I missed other occurrences. It is possible that I missed other occurrences of this in tapes that I have already watched. I found the following clip at the beginning of a new tape. Okay. Entry six. This could be the continuation of entry one, which took place at the end of, what does it say? End of a tape. Was that eyes? Oh, doesn't that look like eyes? Oh gosh. No thanks. What am I looking at? Oh, no thanks. Oh, looking outside. Oh no, no thanks. No, <gasps> okay. Why does he keep coming to your door? He's like, hello, let me in. <gasps> okay, it's just a guy. It's just a dude. I mean, that's still terrifying, but at least it's not like a monster. I don't know, what's worse? <laughs> the tape I just watched consisted entirely of raw footage from Marble Hornets. Are we on the next one now? Yeah, seven. Other than Brian, <laughs> Brian is the voice I have for the alerts on here. Other than Brian, <laughs> I can't do it right. He has such a specific voice. Alex also seems to be talking to a girl off camera at one point. Okay, talking to a girl. Do we not know who this girl is? Is that Brian? Brian. Brian. Let's start again. Let's start again. Let's start again. To look at you. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. All right, I'm going and uh, just a second with me. <laughs> I thought you were talking to her. Oh. Crap, I just lost this script. <laughs> and I'm talking to Brian. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't, don't say anything that's because fine. the camera picks it up. All right, you ready? Yeah. Are you going to feed me Tim's lines? Uh, yeah, just a second. Okay. All right. Action. I don't know. This town just doesn't feel the same to me anymore. I missed it so much when I was in college. But now that I'm back, I just feel like a depressed teenager all over again. He's like Stuck almost laughing. Stuck in a loop of unhappiness. Maybe you've grown up? I don't know. Maybe this town has grown up. Maybe it has. Oscar. Oscar worthy. All right, good. The actor. So. Are we going to do it again? <gasps> I see it. Look at the background. I just noticed it. Was that there the whole time? Oh, no, he it wasn't. He leaned back. Are we? No, we're done. That's it? He saw it. Yeah, we're done. Yeah, good first take. Oscar worthy. Don't need any more. Oh, gosh. Jeez Louise. Okay, headphone warning from here on out. Just be careful, because the sound is absurd. Entry eight. Eight. They got in that Windows Movie Maker. I did not notice any visual tearing anywhere in this tape. However, the audio does cut out. Headphone warning. Headphone warning. Um, you're being followed, Alex. Um... Yeah, he's going crazy. That's what, that's what, is he saying help? Oh, no, this is what, this is what people in, in the midst of psychosis. The rest of the tape remains too dark to see and the audio never comes back. Let's see, grab a lock, what? <laughs> seemed really distant ever since he came back, you know? That stance she has. I mean, have you talked to him at all? It's like the stance every actor their first time in class has, like the... 
Yeah. <laughs> no. Well, uh, did he come back because of you? Because he never told me why he was here. He's it better. doesn't matter, does it? He left me when he went off to the city, and that's that. Yeah. He left me when he went off to the city. I don't know why I went country and English. He went off to that big old city, but I was stuck here on the farm. Honey, <sighs> so, I mean, what's, uh, what's... Windows Movie Maker, that's where I started this thing called... I'm not going to say the name because I don't want you guys to look it up. I started a web series when I was like 11, 12, 13, 14. Now for you, what's next? I thought that was Robert Pattinson. Yeah, this was him before he did that one movie where he had that really like, you know, that Anyway, I don't Moving on. <laughs> not really going to do anything. Let's see. Oh, yeah. We're going to do it again. The pacing still feels weird. It's, it doesn't sound like a conversation. You guys still sound like you're reading off of the script. Yeah. Let's just... Just have a conversation. Let's do it again. Let's do it. Okay, so... Interesting. I... Like... The acting, the actual acting within, like, the story of making Marble Hornets is actually kind of good. Like, Alex just being like... Or whoever plays Alex just being like, you guys sound like you're reading off a script. Like, just being like, but but uh but then the acting within the Marble Hornets movie is very bad. It's it's almost like that making of the room or in the room kind of thing. I don't know. This is very intriguing to me, though. I want to see when they're just genuinely being themselves. They're actually, it seems like they're actually quite good at acting. Um, yeah, and that's honestly, and this kind of whole, this whole video thing too, like is actually made by, I'm assuming, someone who made the whole idea of, of Marble Hornets as a series in general, like it's almost like a, it's a film project within a film project almost. It, it's so meta, <laughs> like my brain hurts. And also it's incredibly impressive and that's like such the beauty of YouTube. Like that you can even, like story matters more than anything. And that's what's so interesting to me. Um, so. Oh, when fire was invented. <laughs> yes. They nail the energy. Definitely, Ash. <laughs> Can we go yet? Action. Well, no. No, we can't. That's right. That's, yeah. Because kids are coming to play. Oh my gosh, I've been there. Good thing I didn't have anything to do later today, yeah, you know. know. Why would you have anything to do anyway? You knew you were coming on set. You knew this could take a while. Yeah, it was supposed to be an afternoon shoot, though. Yeah. You guys would do it right. First off, so afternoon shoot. I didn't even buy lunch. Let's, just do, Let's, just, do Let's just do it again. Let's just do it again. Just stop. All right. Action. This is so interesting. He seemed really distant ever since he came back. Cut yeah? from the beginning. Rolling. This is so interesting to me. It's so meta. <laughs> Rolling. What? Roll. Mm. Did you not have it recording during the break? I told you to keep the camera recording at all times. Oh, how long was it off? I love this. I forgot for a second. You forgot. I I gave you one job. All you're supposed to do is come in here, set up the camera, make sure it doesn't fall over, and press record once. You don't stop it at all. I made this extremely clear. If this hey, if this is gonna go on for a while, can I get a script again? You're Thank saving you. time on the tapes. Saving time. You oh, helped me person. load up the car. You know how many tapes we have. If we run out of time on this tape, we'll get another. It's not a problem. I mean- This is so good. I love this. This is so interesting to me. And also I love that like all the little problems they're having filming are stuff having filmed. Cause my first film I ever did was like, nobody got paid passion project. And the stuff I did in high school obviously was just with friends and then moved on to doing like more professional stuff. But like, I've had all these issues and this is amazing. Your lines. It's just a mistake. Memorize your lines. Maybe we'll get through this a little bit faster. Memorize yeah. your lines. Just don't, just don't read them right off the page. Oh, okay. You gotta be a little bit more human with it. Because don't I've be had so... the script in every scene. Exactly. Yeah, you know, act. How about that? Oh yeah, yeah, that's, 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 that's real nice. You know, considering how much you're paying us and everything. Why would I pay you for what you're giving me? I mean, Really? Oh, that's, yeah, that's real nice. Who else is going to work with you with this attitude? What? Yeah, you already spent so much money on tapes, you can't afford actors anyway. Let's just get it Looks done into with. camera. Alright? Let's just get it done. I'm sorry. Just don't stop recording. It's not a problem. Plenty of tapes. 
Okay, the fact that fine. she's not sweating. Sorry. So I just think of being outside <laughs> right now, and it's just, oh. Yes, Peter is the star of my life. <laughs> Uh, Peter's my dog, for anyone who's new here. <laughs> Alex seemed to- Alex seems to have been filming himself constantly, even before he stopped work- Wait. Brain compute. Alex seems to have been filming himself constantly, even before he stopped work on Marble Hornets. Okay, why would that matter? Who's, so he was vlogging himself even during filming? Paid in respect! They're being paid in exposure! <laughs> Whoever had been following Alex seems to have stressed him to the point of it's of it affecting him personally. Personality. Gosh. Okay. Brain reset. Whoever had been following Alex seems to have stressed him to the point of it affecting his personality. They're being paid in determination. Yes, JD Blue. Welcome. I don't think I said that yet. Oh, jeez, please. What does it? Closely. Closely. Look at it closely. Okay. Okay. Okay, now entry 10. <laughs> Goodness. Found another troubling clip. Whatever was following Alex was... Has him running now. Oh no. No thanks. I'm fine, 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 I'm fine. It's fine. Bang, dark shadows. Flashlight. Yes. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't like it. No. No. No, oh, he's going slow now because he's looking for it. He's like, okay, where's the buddy I told to stand out here in the grass to look? Oh, there it is. Oh, it looks tall. It actually looks tall. Right in front of him or something. No, 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 thanks, no, thanks. <laughs> Agreed, crispy. No, 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 I don't want it. What am I looking at? It was his face, it was his own face. <laughs> no. Oh, that looks cooler than the dude. The other thing that looks a little cooler. <laughs> okay, so the playlist that we're watching is a mix of Marble Hornets as well as this channel called To The Arc. I'm watching it in a playlist that goes in order of release. So these were kind of coming out on two separate channels. So that's why it seems to sort of take a, a different um, turn. <laughs> Take every life of the night. Oh, I hear Brian? <sighs> don't you do this to me, Brian. <laughs> Brian verse. Hello, Brian verse. I don't think we've actually met. Welcome. <laughs> I'm already yelling at you. <laughs> We're fine. Okay. Entry 11. Warm. I found another clip of a close encounter. However, I don't think Alex was aware of it. Oh, no, he wasn't aware of it? Ooh, okay. Oh, gosh. White. We're not playing this game. No, thanks. I'm already tearing up. I'm fine. I'm fine. I can look at my little, on my thing, on my little setup, I can look in the camera and I know there is nothing behind me. Hi Mary Mary, I've heard of that, but I also, I don't think I know anything of it. From Film Theory? Hmm. Mm. Is 
that a suit I saw in the corner? <laughs> I'm fine, sorry. I don't even realize that I'm making noises. So sorry about whatever kind of noise I make. Oh no, no thanks. Okay, we're fine. No, 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 no. What? No. Uh. So warm. I get warm when I'm scared. <sighs> oh, shadow, shadow. There was a so anxious. Yes. <laughs> Me too. What is he saying? Watching you. <laughs> Guys. Sweaty hands. Oh. Mm. Who or what is getting barked at? There was some dog barking at outside and then sorry peter was barking at the dog i don't know what the dog was barking at Oof. <laughs> sorry sorry peter can be very loud sometimes he yeah when he he he's in um he's a little nervous we had a lot of thunder and when he gets nervous he gets into like protective mode so he's in protection stance Okay, I found another clip with heavy distortion. Okay, I'm turning it down. We're gonna turn it down. When there's heavy distortion, when it when it warns us there will be heavy distortion, we're turning it down because it's very loud. In it, Alex is acting more like himself. Hmm, interesting. I saw this at 3 a.m. and all I heard was Alex. Is that what he was saying? Goodness. Uh, I don't know, he'll move. Uh, let's go ahead. See, now everything I look at, like any little bit of like white spot or anything, could be his face. This shot is so okay. hot. Uh, as long as we have the camera shot, just get set to control it. And I'm we'll be scared. Here. Are we doing live? Not in this part. <clears> I'm, just, uh, I'm not scared. Walking to the I'm not scared. Uh, that's when you guys start picking up. Okay. So, uh, just follow us as we cross into the frame. Alright. Bye, Alex. Have a wonderful rest of the time at work. <laughs> I hope so. And that's about as far as we're going to go. We don't want to That would be gross. Is that... I can't tell if that's just... Is there, like, something standing there? I can't... So it looks exactly like these little openings in the trees, but is that a face? <laughs> trying to convince myself, Michael. Let's <laughs> um, get him off the. Oh, I don't. Uh, I hope he's not There's someone standing hey. there for sure. Right. It's like he has his like head tilted too. It's like, oh, that's so creepy. Wait, do they refer to him? Let's uh, get him off the. Uh, I hope he's not angry at it. Hey, buddy. Yes, oh, so they okay. I want to hear what they're saying now, actually, because I wasn't listening. I hope so. And that's about as far as we're gonna go. We don't want to That would be gross. Oh. Here's him. Uh, let's get him off the. Okay. I hope he's not angry at it. Hey, buddy. They yes, see him. Do. They're not like, wow, that guy's like really freakishly tall. Is that what they, when he went, hey, buddy, it seems like he, they were referencing him. Um, <laughs> he went to the bathroom and came back to Slenderman. Oh. Okay. Begin. Oh. Oh. Ooh. It, uh, no. 
I was going to say is a binary, but it's just all O's. Impure. Right. I see what oh, hang on hang on hang. the ears <laughs> I don't know we're moving on yeah this one's kind of low um, do you have the extra one no I think I left it in the car uh, can you go get it yeah entry 13 okay. oh, wait, mm. uh, I think I left it in the trunk all right I'm gonna keep on going though, so just. Okay. I don't know why this part's reminding me of the part <laughs> where they find the little thing and lost. I don't know why that just made me think of that. Peter is doing the best job. <laughs> oh gosh. Like watching this with like full volume too in my ears right now. <laughs> oh. <gasps> okay. All right, that wasn't so bad. I mean, I saw him and that was spooky, but I'm <laughs> I'm leaving it on. They're on. Goodness. I know you can't relax because it's like, like it, it just, like it goes from really quiet talking to blah, blah, blah. like it's, ugh, it's like little jump scares without having actual jump scares. And Peter, dear, you have to sit in here. He's like got his face in the curtain. <laughs> you see the curtain moving? Exit. Oh, is that Alex? Someone's watching Alex. Someone's filming Alex. Is that Alex? Someone who's not, um, Slenderman. So there's actual people. It's not just like a monster versus boy. There's like somehow people filming him. Following him. Hmm. The tree looks weird. Looks like it's like the blacks have been like darkened like on the on the film. Like see how the like the dark looks? Okay, don't move that quickly. Wait, that said where is the park? Hi Terry, welcome, welcome. What the heck? Entry 14. I don't like when they don't talk to us at the beginning. Why do I see like little bits of No, thanks. No, thanks. No, thanks. No, thanks. Nope. Nope. No, 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 no. 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 Gosh, him moving. So warm.
Ah. About 32 minutes pass on the tape before Alex changes it. Why didn't he check it? <gasps> what happened? Are you bleeding from your head? You need to go to the hospital, my dude. Wow, he looks like so young in this like, speaking of like age and stuff, like, I don't know, he just looks like. Oh, that was creepy. The way he like, then like looks at the camera and he's like, oof. I need to find out where Alex has gone. I'm <laughs> poor Brian. <laughs> Brian Bruce, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> right, what are we looking at here? Some sort of house or building, or some numbers, like a little snake thing is dancing in the corner. Everything's turning kind of purpley and green. Bleed more. Thanks. Entry 15. I was able to find Tim, one of the actors in Marble Hornets, and arrange a meeting. In order to convince him to meet me, I told him I was going to finish the film if I if he could do a screen test. Oh my gosh, there are so many Bryans. Hey, uh, hey Tim. Oh, hey, uh, Jay, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, you ready to do your screen test for this? Get the gym gif. Here. So here's the uh, the script for the screen test. Okay. And I'll just be taking some notes. All right. Can I write on this or? Yeah, that's fine. Oh, okay. Since yours, you can have it. Uh, before we do the screen test, uh, I want to ask you a few things about the production before before this now. It's it like locations or something because uh, I think I remember there's a couple around here but more more specifically the director Alex uh, uh, Alex Crayley Ooh, um, he's pretending I don't really to do remember a, uh, much I mean he was a friend he's pretending to do a screen test but he's really trying to interrogate him about information about Alex to Brian I don't really remember much I mean he was a friend of Brian so I didn't really talk to him that much I mean he just kind of asked me to be part of the cast for the sake of convenience right okay uh, did you like you live near him um, yeah, yeah I mean, well, like, I, I, I'm, I live next to... speaking, I mean, he kind of lives in the, in the middle of nowhere, right? Well, I mean, I, I live next to Brian, so, I mean, I didn't really live near okay. Alex. He was just kind of off. Okay, uh, uh, in terms of his directing uh, at the time, how was he as a director? Uh, he was a pretty decent director. Uh, well, at first. At first. Yeah, I mean, after a while, he got to the point where, uh... Yeah, I mean, it seemed like after a while he got to the point where he would be yelling at us more than he'd be actually be filming the movie, so and he'd just be really paranoid, waving his camera around all over the place. I mean, I just couldn't really... His camera, other, other than the camera he was using to shoot the... Yeah, he had a handheld that he was carrying around with him all over the place. Mm, his <coughs> vlogging camera. Okay. Uh, and, and, and a yeah, ton he, of tapes. It was kind of funny. He, like, coughed and he was like, okay. It seemed like he was saying okay to the cough. <laughs> Okay. Uh, and, and, and a ton of tapes too. Like right, he had he had all bad. Okay, I'm sorry. I cannot tell the difference between both their voices. <laughs> like obviously, I know when someone's asking questions, that's like our narrator. But when one of them says like "okay" and and stuff like that, I can't tell the difference of who's saying what. Tapes, <laughs> tapes in the back of his car. How many? How many would you say you had? Um, way more than necessary. More than you would need to make a, a production like this. Yeah. Just for himself. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so like, like more than like fifteen or twenty. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, speaking of Alex, I mean, I don't, I don't know if you knew this or not, but, but he did move away after he ended the, this production. Uh, uh, do you know what might have caused him to do that, or, or even where he might have gone to? I didn't even know he moved away. I mean, obviously, like I said, Brian's the one that was really friends with him. I'm just kind of is he dead? Was along for the ride, but. Um, did you happen to know where Brian is? I haven't heard from Brian either okay I'm from not for quite a while actually okay. uh, so, so you wouldn't know what, what might have caused Alex to move away no. said that. Um, I know Brian did say something oh, about I like I think somebody was leaving dead animals in like his uh, like his front yard or something like, like 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 pets or you, don't, do you uh, really know 
What do you mean pets? Like, like like cats or dogs or anything? I don't think so. Because, I mean, uh, he, he did kind of live in a heavily wooded area. I don't think it was anything like that, but, I mean, you have to ask Brian. I'm okay. not really the... Okay. Uh, yeah, Jim. More about the set of Marble Hornets. Was there anything... I know that I know, that, you know most of the places that you filmed this, I mean, there were some indoor, some, like, interior scenes, but most of it was exterior, like, in the woods, right? Yeah. I mean, okay. it was, like, parks... And some was just kind of like off in the woods. Right. I mean, Alex did take me location scouting with him a few times. So yeah. I, I did see a few of the places he was thinking about. Uh, but but did you happen to notice? I know these are like public places and there were people there. But did you notice anything out of the ordinary about any 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 people? Any, anyone that you saw? No. I mean, it was just you know, families, kids. You know, just I mean, you just have to get people off the set on a regular basis. So okay. Uh, anything? Any anyone that you wouldn't assume would be in a, a place like that like a park or anything like I, like guy guy in a business suit like I, black business I suit don't remember i mean it was quite a while ago and then there may have been but i mean it's you know several years ago and you're asking me about a guy in a suit so okay so so you don't really remember no any specifics about anyone you had to move off the camera no i mean it just you know nothing out of the ordinary okay Dude, am uh, I well, doing a just, screen test or not? Since, you know, I have, I have the raw footage of the, of the tapes. And, but, yeah. Uh, um, I'm really sorry, but i, I got to get to lunch after this. Can we right, I mean, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, that's fine. I'm sorry. Uh, we can kind of do this real okay. quick. Okay, get the camera set up. Why did he kind of... Okay, okay. Oh my gosh, what the heck. Why did he kind of look like Kevin Jonas? <laughs> Like, hang on, let's go back for a second. He kind of looked like a, like a black haired, like darker haired, like, no, not that one. The other one. No, go back. This one. I'm sorry, uh, we can do this. Okay. I don't know why it looks like Kevin Jonas to me. It's like Joe Jonas's eyebrows, Kevin Jonas's like sideburns. Did he have sideburns? Why do I picture him with sideburns? He's like the long lost Joe bro. Actually been an hour in stream. We've been live for an hour. Actually, it's actually been live for an hour and a half. Um, uh, we're gonna take a little break here in a second and then we're gonna do some more stuff, but let's continue on for a little bit. I feel like we can do a little bit more of this. <laughs> Zero, zero, binary? What the heck? Peter's like touching my foot. That S, squiggly snake thing. Slender. Entry 16. Is this still season one? How many like entries per season? Is this our narrator or is this part of the tapes? Dude, it doesn't look like anyone's home. To entry 26, gotcha. No. No thanks. No thank you. Man, they must like live out in the country, no street lights. Walking, 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 walking. No, 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 no. 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 Stop it. Stop it. No. Huh. Dude, like, doesn't look like anyone's there. If they are, they're asleep. You are very much disturbing them. That is high disturbance levels. It's gonna open, isn't it? <gasps> no. 
sweet home of the railroad. Yes, this is our narrator, like you. Probably just go home. Agreed. Agreed. Hello? And that's true too, but like there to be no light, like it looks really dark out there. And you can Alice. Hear, like, Brian. Like my parents don't have any street lights, but they're next to a highway, so it's just in like a baseball field, so it's just like a lot of like light in the air, even though but this looks dark, dark. Like away from the city. I'm so nervous. <laughs> I'm so nervous, guys. Oh, I mean, this one's like, oh, okay. Uh, okay. <sighs> That's fine. I'm not scared. Stop it. Why is this? Oh gosh! Stop with the and then the camera movement. This reminds me of like the way he's like looking at everything is like the way my dad looks at a when we go to like a like when we were kids and we'd go to some like vacation cabin for the summer and he like films everything like uh. Dad say something. I bet it's some secret message, but I'm too scared to look. What moved? What moved? What made noise? What's in there? What's in the house? Oh no. Ugh. Kieran has to go. It's uh, his step stepmom's birthday and we're going to celebrate it. Hope you enjoy the rest of it. Bye. Happy birthday to your stepmom. Um, well, you could end up getting attacked by a homeless squatter, yeah, or a white animal, exactly. Like, there's a there's a lot more things than a, like than a supernatural monster that's like hunting you as well to like get you. So, um, also, is this gonna be like um, what's the word? Like the grudge? Like you enter the house, so now you're cursed too? Or is it because? Or is he gonna get cursed because like he's seen the tapes? Prediction. What's in the box? What's in the box? <laughs> also reminds me of Nicolas Cage. How did it get burned? How did it get burned? How did it get burned? Ugh. Dude's uh, nervous. Doing the hand dance. The hand dance calls, calms me down. And the hand dance is helpful because at any point I can go like this. <coughs> I don't like that noise. <laughs> hand dance, hand dance, hand dance, hand dance, hand dance, <laughs> hand dance, hand dance, hide. <laughs> dancing, dancing, hide. <laughs> dance, 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 dance. <laughs> Stop with the movement. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get pushed over? What happened? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? How, where are, are you on the floor? Are you in the ceiling? Are you in a wall? What are you doing? Do you just slide down on the floor? You didn't sound like you like fell. You sound like you went like. <laughs> No, someone didn't pay the power bill. Someone didn't pay the power bill. Someone didn't pay the power bill. <laughs> oh, doesn't he get teleported? Teleported. No spoilers. No spoilers. But welcome. Actually, I just said hi to you. Hi again. <laughs> oh, slither. Like a workout in my chest, the cardio of watching this. I'm gonna hold a tripod because it's a weapon, or it could be a weapon. He 
just heading up those stairs mighty quickly. Actually, if he was going slow, I'd probably... Dude. I'm going to get on my desk for comfort. Strawberry mug. Protection. Mm, other tripod. This one's got little magnetic feet. So I can, like, stick it on stuff. And, oh, blood. Blood! Not funny. Not funny. Blood. Ah, ah. Oh, that looks like, I thought it was like a giant eyeball filled with blood. But it looks like it's a dr drain. Oh, guys, I'm so stressed. Tripod, tripod with metal feet. That, do the thing. Oh, no, it's going to lead to something. It's going to lead to something. <laughs> okay, tripod of, tripod of, tripod. <laughs> Let me <Osa. laughs> I can't. Watch, there's gonna be like nothing that happens, but I'm so stressed. Oh, the stress is increasing. It's a pertubling. Oh, come on. Okay. Guys, I can't breathe. I can't breathe. The movements. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm fine. Uh, Avada Kedavra. <laughs> it's fine. I'm not scared. I'm not even scared. I'm not even scared. <coughs> what? <coughs> what? <coughs> what? <coughs> what? <coughs> Let's see. Forget what. See? Forget what. See? Did he fall again? I guess I do keep falling over. Ooh. appeared abandoned although I did hear strange noises. I left with two of Alex's drawings, some kind of pills, and a bullet casing. I may go back eventually. All right. Dude, everything I see like looks like him. Like that coloring. Like I thought that the dark with the white was Slenderman. What are we looking at? Oh, is that him when he fell in the house? Someone was filming him. Someone was there. See you. That's so intimidating. Like, just the, like, message to the viewer. Like, I found more footage of me helping Alex near the beginning of production. Okay. You found more footage. How many times are you going to find more footage? I had to do that about five footage? times. That's a good story. Mm. Jay, if you want to just stand where Brian's going to be and read his lines for me. Yeah, I got the script here. All right. Am I out of the frame? Yeah, you're good. Uh, you know where we're starting, Tim? The, 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 why do you come back? Yes. Please? All right. And uh, let's uh, just whenever you're ready. All right. Is this this? Yeah, this is the same guy who looks like Joe Jonas, right? So why'd you come back? I had to. Was it because of Sarah? I thought I'd be able to leave her behind along with the rest of the Dude, the acting! Ah! Uh Okay, so like his little bit, his little bit where he's like the why'd you come back part, you know, that seems so genuine and real and human. And then he goes into like actor mode and he's like, like, it's just, it seems like what everyone does in their acting class when they haven't like learned how to like act well yet. And they're like, so why'd you come back? <laughs> like there's literally films of mine you can watch where I have that exact type of acting. Every character is the same. You're just like, and what else do you think? Town, but I just can't seem to get her out of my Why are you giving eyes and scared face? Dead. I okay. thought you said you were over her. I thought so too. No, that's fine. Okay. Yeah, let's not do too much. Uh, who, uh, who wrote that dialogue with you, Alex? That was just me. Uh, oh, okay. I do all the script for this. Uh, so? uh, do you know where Brian is? Uh, I think he said he actually? was just running down to the store for some snacks or something. He should be back any minute. Okay. It glitched. Uh, <gasps> get some, uh... oh, 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 I see it. Oh, was that there? That's been there the whole time and I didn't even see it. What? Was that there the whole time? He was there the whole time and I didn't notice until there was a glitch. He's right there. Oh my gosh. Yeah, let's not do too I much. did not notice. Ah! Uh, who wrote that dialogue yeah. with you, Alex? 
That was just me. Uh, oh, okay. I do all the script for this. When it like did the little uh, bloop, I all of a sudden my eyes went there. Uh, I think you said he was just running down to the store for some snacks or something. So cool, the ways they can hide him. So cool. He should be back in a minute. Okay. Look at the uh, window. Can I get some, uh, get some water or something? Yeah. It's funny, you guys all started saying it right after I saw it, and I know there's like a little delay to the stream, so it's funny. I'm glad I caught it, though. Uh, is this one yours? Yeah. Okay, thanks. No problem. Why are you wearing a jacket? It's pretty cold in here. I'm uh, comfortable. Rude? I feel like you have the AC cranked up or something. Uh, you left the camera on. Oh, well, well, Don't we're judge if he's calm. Okay. Anyway, but... Oh, that's so creepy. His face was like all distorted. It went like... From that point until the end of the tape, the picture is frozen. Has Matt Pat done a reaction to this? I would love to see his like breakdown of all the lore. The usual audio and video problems are still present in this clip, but there's something else about it that really disturbs me. Yeah, the fact that there's like Slender Man in the background. I don't remember any of it ever happening. Oh, that gave me chills. I've decided to go back to the house. There has to be something in it that I missed. Marble Hornets in 2022, it's more likely than you think. Spy Guy 40, hello. I don't know if I said hi to you yet or if you or if you just joined. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> Slender Man, the monster with the fanciest fashion sense. I agree. <laughs> you know, he like I think he like murders children or whatever. He murders children, but like gotta stay classy, gotta suit up, you know? We're alone together. And I will tell you something new. Something old. Something sleepy. Something obscene. You see the colors, guys? You see the coloring in this video? Dark applier. <laughs> Alright, what's going on? This is horrifying. <laughs> something sleepy, something obscene, and beats them along like curve of space. Banish them, refuse to speak, leave them, go upstairs to your room. I will be waiting for you. I will surround your bed. Oh, I hate that. Come back. Find me. Entry 18. I went back to the house. Okay, well, they told you to come back. Oh, not this again. <laughs> I'm so stressed. <laughs> Why do you always go back at night? Go in the day. Why are you knocking? You know no one's there. <sighs> what the heck was that? Sorry, it's something in my house. <laughs> Try out of protection. I'm gonna make it look like a claw. <sighs> what? <No>. Hi, Jared. <laughs> Don't, oh, that's what they always say. Who's here? <laughs> oh, stressed. So stressed. I'm so stressed. Someone ripped up the couch. Do they have a dog? <laughs> Someone tipped over the couch? I don't agree with this. I don't like it. No. Every time he turns, ready to go. What? Why? Tall man, little doll thing, why? No, 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 Is he having a seizure? Call 911. I know he like attacked you and stuff, but call 911. Get him some help or something. Oh no. <laughs> I'm 
my eyebrows hurt from like furrowing. After I apparently stopped the camera, I don't remember anything else. Oh. Are you going to watch the full series? And if so, will you read the comics? Uh, maybe, possibly. Yeah, I'm gonna post this um, these reactions as a video on my channel, and if people like it, um, I'll probably continue it. I'm having a lot of fun watching them so far. I'm just also mortified. <laughs> Slenderman dropped his action figure. <laughs> ah, that's amazing, Jeff. <laughs> Oops, need that back. That's my favorite. Oh, trees. I woke up here the next morning, my car off the road. Did you get drugged? They keep forgetting things, though. The knife I had brought with me was also missing. Uh-oh. Was that Alex in a mask? At first, I thought I had been hallucinating, but I looked on the camera to see that it recorded whoever it was that attacked me. Wait, at first I thought I had been hallucinating, but I looked on the camera to see that it recorded whoever was attacked. Blech. Whoever attacked me. So yeah, you definitely got it, like, on camera and all that stuff. <laughs> Joey Reynoso donated $50 through Super Chat. I am alive. <laughs> Sorry I've been so inactive lately. I've been completely swamped with work. Hope this helps. Heart, heart. Heart, 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 heart. <laughs> Joey! Oh my gosh. Joey! Thank you! Oh my gosh, that's so kind. Oh gosh, thank you so much. That See, this is so nice. We get these nice little breaks in between the absolute torture that is this series. Um, thank you so much. That is so kind. Thank you guys, everyone. And thanks to everyone who's here. Um, I really appreciate it. Okay, we're going to continue. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> hot, hot. Okay. <laughs> Okay, at first I thought I'd been hallucinating, but I looked on the camera to see. Oh, yeah, it recorded who attacked him. So, Alex. Did I, like, lose my sound? Oh, gosh. Oh, yeah, it saved the picture. Ooh. Ah. These pictures are creepy. Ugh. Oh, gosh. Sorry. I thought the thing was... Wait, what? Sky Queen. Sky Queen donated $20 through Super Chat. Thank you, Brian. <laughs> Thank you, Sky Queen, as usual. <laughs> Sky Queen. Thank you so much for that. I need to add that because it doesn't get put in. Um, geez, Sky Queen. Thank you so much. That's incredibly kind. Um, I, I feel like, I don't know, like, thank you. You've been through so much and you are still giving to me. Uh, I... Something dangerous is going on, and I'm starting to regret ever getting involved with it now. We are now at 137 now, thanks to Sky Queen. Um, I'm starting to regret ever getting involved. Yeah, you shouldn't have gotten involved, my dude. Now you're in trouble. Now you're going to be cursed. Cursed by the tapes. Tell us. You have been keeping... A secret? Secrets. <laughs> Smile for the camera. I didn't know. And smiling. Oh, who is that? That was a like male's chin. I've seen to the arcs video response to entry eighteen. Oh my gosh! Is this back when YouTube still had replies? Like you could straight up respond to a video with a video. Yes. They're showing this to be like, hey guys, there's this other channel too that goes in line with this channel. There is something I have failed to mention and any other entries. I've been recording myself much in the same way Alex did for about a month now. Oh, so we're going to see his footage now. However, Yield did nothing worth mentioning, so I began only checking it weekly since it recorded to a hard drive and not tapes. Hmm. 
until I checked the footage at the end of last week. Ooh. All of the following clips take place two nights after a return from the house in Entry 18. No. No. His walls remind me of, of the walls at my old school. Those like cinder block walls. So institutional looking. What are you looking at? Oh, I'm looking out the window. Why is it open? Dude, I am so paranoid. You're sleeping with the window blinds open like that? I would never. I am so paranoid about that. I close the blinds and close curtains. Oof. <laughs> the crap out of me those walls look like the ones in my college dorm yeah it is kind of maybe it is like a college dorm or something is marble hornets the first example of analog horror i can't remember it's the or latest that i know i imagine on youtube this was like definitely one of the first of its kind i think that's why it blew up so much nobody had ever seen anything like it and i think that's really like revolutionary oh, he's gone oh good point i just noticed too <laughs> like he is gone did he get like taken that was horrifying. He was up on the dresser and then looking at us. Oh, wait, he's gone. If he's, this is from before and he's telling us, where did he go? What? My room is empty for about three hours after which I come back in and fall asleep instantly. What is the deal? I don't remember ever getting up for an extended amount of time. To the arc who I suspected as a person wearing the mask knows where I live. Sky Queen, yes. I feel like a lot of people of this generation of YouTube or like such haven't. Um, like it's not really talked about anymore because it's been so long. I feel like we should bring it back. We need a resurgence of everyone watching this. Since finding these clips, I have not left my house at all. I've kept all the doors and windows locked. Yeah, and close your blinds. I need to find somewhere else to go. It's not safe to stay here anymore. return so to the ark ah oh no stop oh gosh it said and you forever something like that okay and wait what is happening entry 19.5 <laughs> and a half really we're going halves now renaissance <laughs> yeah i have <laughs> i've decided to make a video record <laughs> of the items i took from the house in entry 16 in the process of doing so i've discovered a few things one the pills why are you looking under a blue light the bottle has had its label torn off. Oops, getting stuff all over my hands. You can still probably read some parts of it. it. Might give you something, but it's also completely empty. Well, I'm a millennial, but I didn't really have access to the internet until high school, and even then, I didn't look for stuff like this. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. I mean, I was somewhat similar, but um, I don't know. Most of the time, friends at school are just showing me stuff. After checking entry 16, I know it wasn't empty when I found it. It wasn't empty, so he's been taking them, or? <sighs> I don't remember ever taking any of the pills. Someone's been giving them to you? Then again, there's plenty of things I don't remember that still happened. All right, either you have some sort of your own psychosis going on early, early, early onset dementia, or someone's like drugging you. Why are you wearing a jacket? It's pretty cold in here. I see him in the background. To the bullet casing. Found you forever, gotcha. 
It's missing. It's possible I misplaced it. Or it was taken. Oh, that is such a creepy image. The papers. The papers! The papers. Forget what I see. Sees me. Forget what I see sees me. Oof. The symbol of the second sheet has been recurring. Yeah, you saw it on the ground. These are the symbols in the game, too. No? Maybe? Because it looks familiar. Other than that, I found nothing that could help me on them. Until I looked on the back. He didn't check the back. Face. I wear a mask with a smile. Sorry. What did it say? Is it the tower? Oh, the tower. Sorry. To me, it looks like smiley faces. Or maybe it is. Or like straight faces. <laughs> At the tower is... I thought it said AJ. I don't know. <laughs> it is written in the same style of writing that's on the front. Sees me at the tower. We gonna go tower hunting? Not sure what it could mean yet. I don't know. Gotta go find a tower. Do you have any towers near you? <sighs> Currently, I'm looking through the last tapes I took from Alex. Something important needs to come of it. Otherwise, the trail has gone cold. Ooh, like a good detective. He needs a lead. You do have a lead. Tower. Entry 20. I'm almost finished looking through the tapes. I found what could possibly be the final clue I get from them. Again, I don't remember any of this happening. Hello. All right. Uh, let's see. We'll do a little special featurette here for the DVD. Yeah, since we're waiting for Tim, who's running kind flip of late. The, flip the screen over for me. That looks awful. Where did that painting go? Uh, okay, there we go. It does look awful because it's such a blank so down, wall behind them. Back. They're gonna put up a painting. <laughs> yeah, we'll create a control here. Not even <laughs> just gonna put it, on the hook. put it up. Brian has excellent taste in art. Yeah. So we're here on the set of Marble Hornets here at Brian's <laughs> house. Brian is somewhere. I don't know where. I, I wasn't. Was I wasn't paying attention. Were you? No. Um. Uh, we've been doing some script revisions for. Uh, Coming up here. I've been supervising that because I'm the yes. script supervisor. Yes, Jay has been very now. helpful today. I'm very proud of him. Uh, we're just waiting on Tim to get here. Go and give him the new script, maybe run over some lines. This new <laughs> script. That's a whole Why? lot of power to get someone like him. Yeah. Uh, you know, pretty much everyone's at risk. It's a terrifying place. And there's Tim. So. Come on in. What are they in are the back okay? rooms? Just Sorry, like blank right. walls? No, okay. Sorry, I'm late. No problem. Yeah. Oh, he's the cause of the disturbance. Why is it so cold? He's the anomaly. June. Let's uh, go ahead and start over. He's talking about being cold again. Uh, I'm tired of this. That's yeah. The actual speaking of, yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. Speaking yeah. Of what, I'm warning. Really tired of this. I'm really. There's a lot of that in this series so far. There's a lot of just random <laughs> noises. So just be wary. <laughs> And let me know if my sound can be improved with it. Like if maybe like turning me up so you, I don't know, helps or something. Let me know. Need a break now. Oh. Uh, <laughs> uh, take five, I guess. Take five. Yeah. Everything highlighted for like him. growing up. I think so. I think I got it all. <laughs> wow. Seriously? I don't know. I know. <laughs> I'm nervous. You alright, Tim? Need anything? No, I'm okay. What's that? <laughs> Just some medicine I have to take. Uh, <laughs> do you need to go home? Should we cut? No, I'm fine. <laughs> alright. Stressed. So cold in June. The events seem to be out of order or missing parts altogether. Yeah, I agree. That is interesting. Um, hmm. 
Tim is also acting very strangely. The pill bottle he has looks similar to the one I found at the house. In regards to entry 19.5, I've concluded at the tower may be referring to the red structure seen in entry 5. Ah, yes, they saw that thing and it went bleh, 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 bleh. Excuse me. <laughs> Yeah, the red tower. Is it going to go blah, 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 blah again? Okay, I think they saved our ears. This is the only solid lead right now, so I've decided to go there soon. Whew. What? What did it say? Poison random endings centered excludes death encountering st stale state truth receives endangering it's like random word generator every section waiting for you Fun fact, if this were on Twitch, Becca would be going bleh, bleh. <laughs> would already be clipped. Pretty sure you can clip on here. <laughs> Entry 21. We're getting close to end of season one. The Red Tower. I'm like feeling calm and now I'm starting to feel nervous again. That's pretty though. It doesn't look like June. Why does it look like winter based on the trees? Maybe it's not June anymore? Why is there a hole? And sounds. Oi. I'm gonna look for him in the background. I love nature. <laughs> nature! Nature! Oy. Look, it's like all green over there. It's like dead here and then green there. Was there like a forest fire or something? I'm nervous. I don't like it. It is very pretty. I don't like it. No, thank you. I'm nervous. Oh, there it is. The marking. big opening. Don't go in there. Don't know. Oh, caution tape. No, thank you. No, 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 no. Oh, gosh, I'm so nervous. Dancing hands again. Dancing hands and shield. Dancing hands and shield. Stop. You've already looked up plenty of times. What do you got to keep looking up for? Stop. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? So are you starting some arts and crafts? Are you going to build? Are you climbing the tower? Why are you climbing the tower? 
I don't trust that wood structure. If it falls and you get impaled. My nose is running out of anxiety. Dude, that is so dangerous. Look at that. Oh. I heard a noise, like a door was opening or something, like a piece of wood or something. I'm nervous. I'm getting tension, headache. What is that? A little mint jar can thing? I keep hearing noises. I hear noises. Did he fall? <coughs> oh, if he puts his camera up and Slender Man's there. Tape. Welcome to your tape. Okay. I'll be watching the tape I found soon. <sighs> My body is dense. Ugh. Entry 22. The tape. Oh, Peter's not there anymore. I'll turn off Peter Cam. Your stream is behind. <laughs> we'll see how far behind it is, Sky Queen. I want you to type the word pineapple when you hear this. Wait, wait, wait. Don't type it yet. Don't type it yet. We're going to time it. We're going to see how far behind you are for fun. Uh, I'm going to go to my clock. I want you to, I'm going to change the word. I'm going to change the word. I want you to type the word blueberry when you hear this. And I'm going to see how long it takes you to type it. No, thanks. Ah, she typed it. All right. All right. This says 29 seconds. So, and I think I missed it by a couple of seconds. So 27 seconds. You are 27 se seconds behind my real life. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Everyone. Blueberry. <laughs> I am a blueberry. You are a blueberry. Banana. <laughs> Banana. <laughs> ah. Why are we doing this? Why are we here? Just to suffer through dark, blurry footage where you walk around in the darkness for a long time and then something scary happens but you don't know when it's going to happen so you're just tense the entire time. What do you think? I hear weird noises. I'm gripping. <laughs> Spam blueberry. Blue, blue, blue blood. <laughs> blue blood. Detroit become human. Blue blood. <laughs> yes, Agent Run is farther behind. <laughs> Potentially. Everyone's about 30 seconds to a minute. The blood back upstairs. It gives me a chance to see things so, on my own before people tell me. I am a calm person. I am relaxation. I am all in all the way that you feel when you want to. 
there are. What's all this stuff? What is that? What is? It? I don't like the blah, 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 getting louder. What? I'm brave. Because Becca be brave. Because Becca be scared. Because Becca be brave. Why? Tunnel. No. I do have to say their sound design is, is impressive. What is it? What is it? What was that? It's like something's moving in there. It seems like... Oof. Oof! That white mask thing that just happened was really scary. What? What did I miss? Did I miss it? Am I oblivious? Drinking my tea. It's cold now. It's still good. Make some more later. Ah, oh, tension in my forehead. Looks like an eye. <laughs> right? Look at this. What? I can't see. Blood. Blood. It's not funny. It's not funny. Has everyone seen that clip? The blood. Blood. Not funny. If you haven't, we're watching it after this. It's like four seconds long and it's hilarious. What time is it for me? It is 8.46 p.m. I am in Eastern time. What time is it for you guys? Curious. What time is everyone in? They put bodies in and they burn. Where, what is this? What is the purpose of the place there? What was that? What was that? Hang on, we're gonna pause. Oh, that's weird. Blood. <laughs> it's so funny. Such a funny clip. Quote it as you can tell all the time. Oh, we got some central, we got some Pacific. Any, any mountain timers? Was there something right there? Hang on. Okay. Did I just get scared over nothing or was that something? Hang on. Is that just Alex? Is that just Alex that I got scared over? Yeah, I think it's just Alex. I th or whoever we're watching. Not Alex. I forget their names. <laughs> There's a lot of Alex. <laughs> Jeez. What the heck? Oh. Seth is gone. We were the only two left. Yeah, I think in the chat right now it's all uh, at least like U.S. time zones. I do have a couple people who are in like um, like the U.K. and stuff like that, and they're always like, it's, it's way too late for them. <laughs> Blue blood, drugs, <laughs> drugs, drugs, <laughs> drugs. I don't know why I love characters like that, like Blid and like drugs. My favorite character in Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends was uh, Cheese of the I Like Chocolate Milk. I like cereal. <laughs> I like chocolate milk. I'm a lady. <laughs> I love cheese. Uh, sorry, serious moment happening here. Seth is gone. <laughs> I just got way off track. Uh, Seth. We were the only two left, and I left him. He's a pretty good actor. Brian is gone. Tim and Jay 
and Sarah. Everyone is gone. I just woke up in this house with the tape. Seth's camera is gone. All I can remember from the night is right here. Hmm. All I can remember at all is on a tape now. I'm leaving this house. I thought I would be safe right here. No, 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 no. But everything's just gotten worse. No! I'm going back to my home. <laughs> oh. And I'm burning these tapes. All of them. <sighs> Attention. Return to us. Admission. I like turtles. <laughs> oh. It's those head droopy droop. Please don't like go bleh at me. I can't take it anymore. doors unopened. Wow. Okay. Ooh. Oh, I think I heard about that, Haley. I'll have to look at it. The only choice I thought I had in return... Ugh. The only choice I thought I had was to return to the house again and see what I could find. <laughs> There's a gad. The house stresses me out, dude. It stresses me. Here we go. It's amazing. All right, at least you're there in the daytime for once. Goodness. If you went at night again, it's still really creepy, though, to be walking in this house. Like, how do you know Alex hasn't, like, I don't know. It's weird to just walk in the house. Because if he did move away. Yeah, that's where he got attacked. I don't know why the pil pillows ended up like that, though. It must have been a weird attack flipping pillows. What? Oh, the little breaky break. That means he's here. What is that? So warm. <laughs> this is three hour stream. This is a long time to be stressed. <laughs> Oh, he dropped his action figure again. Or he's baiting you. I think I have that door now. They're all locked. Oh, the one that's going to be open is going to be awful. Is he just sitting? Oh, it's like, it's like, it's like cross legs. Like, how you doing, bud? Oh. How's your day? Welcome to- Oh, scared me! <laughs> Welcome to my house. Wait, did he see something? <gasps> oh, I didn't even see that. Oh. Oh. Did you react to my comment about backrooms found footage? I disconnected after sending it. Um... Backroom sound footage. No, I didn't. I didn't see it. Um, what do you mean? <laughs> like, do you mean watch it? I have a couple videos on my channel watching through Backrooms. Um, I haven't seen the newest one, though. But I'm going to be making a video or streaming it. How do you lose a person? Uh, the pills. Those are giant. 
I'd have to cut those in half to swallow them. This is like a game of cat and mouse in a house. Cat and mouse in a house. I don't like it. I don't like the sound. Welcome to my house. Mm -hmm. Copyright. Copyrighted. Sorry. I'm still new to this channel. Yes. Welcome, by the way. But yes, I do. I just didn't know what you meant. But yes, I have videos on Backrooms on my channel. I just haven't seen the newest one. Um, so I want to watch it. I think there's one that like came out this week or something I saw. <sighs> Welcome to my house. I also have playlists on my channel that split up things between like reacts and like things I do and talks and stuff. So if you're interested in just reacts, you could go to like reacts playlist. And then I have specifically with Markiplier playlist. <laughs> There's a whole lot in there as well. I'm stress. Is he shivering? Why is it so cold? Oh, God, la, 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 la. Clip the door. Don't breathe like that. You're making me nervous. We're gonna do, oh, blah, blah, blah. Eh. What? What just happened? Hand dance, hand dance. Hand dance, hand dance. Welcome to my house. Is that thing moving? Like it's moving around? <laughs> Blood, not funny. <laughs> and the fake out almost made me lose it. Where are we? In a tiny closet? Are we in a closet? prefer the noises sometimes the quiet is a lot <gasps> oh, it's kind of nervous where are we is this what you guys are talking about teleporting is this like tell he's like teleporting where are you it's very dirty i mean the whole place is kind of dirty what what was that hang on i kind of want to go back and see that by frame by frame. What is that? Oh. Weird. Yeah. I kind of honestly, I wouldn't have understood the teleportation though. Because it's like the camera's so like all over the place. I can barely tell what room we're in most of the time. Especially on like a first watch through. What is that? Where are we? Oof. Was that yeah. laugh? It sounded like laughing. <gasps> I'm stressed. Stressed. Don't move like that, my dude. He's gonna go. Oh, I just almost jabbed myself in the eye. <laughs> Oh, gonna poke my eye out. You'll poke your eye out. Where are you? Darling, where are you? Oh, you're like in that place. You're not in the house anymore. What was that? 
No thanks. I would hate it. Is it saying Seth? I thought it was like saying like Seth. So. Yeah, Peter Stahl. Oh, we got to go back and look at that. Uh, Peter's still on the couch. Was that Sunday? It's hard to... <gasps> oh, that's so hard to see. What the heck's even going on? It, it's all, it just looks like... Oh, hello. It's like Slenderman meets Darkiplier. That's the last thing the camera ever recorded. Ever? It died? When I woke up back at my home the next day, I found out that it no longer works. Yeah. I'll grab Peter before we end the stream. I remember and show you guys the blood. <laughs> I remember nothing other than what the footage I got off of it shows. Hmm. Spooky. Why though? Why? Make it make sense. I have other cameras, but it doesn't even matter to me anymore. What? I'm never going back to the house again. Yeah, you say that. I don't believe you. I don't trust you. You love that house. Why is it not killing him? Why is it like playing this game? I'm done with this. I don't want to know the answers anymore. Why do other people like totally disappear and go pretty quickly where others, it like plays with them? Make it make sense. Warning. The following are raw footage excerpts from Alex Kelly. Hey, this is what the beginning said. It's like mocking them. Stay home. Stay home. I should have stay at home. I don't do it. I don't be alone. I am. And I am at home. White's gonna leave. Smile for the camera. I'm smiling. Bye, White. Thanks for joining the stream. I hope you have a good night. Regards. Thank you. That's very polite. Um, Have a good time. See you later on Wally's later, possibly. Um, okay, entry 24. The following is taken from the surveillance camera set up inside my home. Ooh, we're getting paranormal activity up in here. The timestamps and everything. Good point, Sky Queen. Your home looks... All the lights are off. Oh, you're going to hurt your eyes looking at a screen like that. <laughs> Do you hear that? Oh, whoops. Oh, we're going to see more of the thingies going to jump up in my face and make me scared. What is that? What? Looks like that TikTok filter. Yeah, blue eye filter glasses. Filter glasses. Dude, you're sleeping like with like no blanket on, light on. At least you have your blinds closed this time. <laughs> Two hours pass before I'm seen again. Where the heck did he go? 
It didn't, last time it showed his direct connection to each room, but then he's not there. Strange. Good night, JD Blue. Sleep well. Yeah, they are odd choices, I agree. Um, the only door outside is blocked. I couldn't have left. Where are you? Please don't go bleh at me again. It's that door, right? Like they already introduced to us that's like right there and he just walks to nothing. Hmm. Entry. We will wait for you now more. Control is being taken away from you. He's wearing a different shirt. The start has been a game for us. Not anymore. I'm coming for you. And you will lead me to the ark. <laughs> Entry 25. We got two more. We got 25, 26. And then we're done with season one. I've been out of my home ever since To the Ark. I keep wanting to read it as like Tooth Ark. <laughs> uh, to the Ark put the last video on this channel. I'm currently staying in a hotel. Yesterday I got a call from someone I know telling me to turn on the news. Mmm, long break. A firefighter, so on the scene of an apartment fire in Shanty County's Shannon has been covering it for us. She joins us now with the latest. Shannon? Angie, you can take a look behind me. This is the most relaxed we've seen this scene since we've been here. Uh, the original firefighters that were here have all left. Did they make this or did they take this from an actual news thing? Huh. And they've all been replaced by firefighters from all over. Uh, that's from as far away as we've seen some from... Whoa. Hey! <gasps> Mr. Narrowstone or Nar Nar Narrowstone, Narrowstone. Look behind me. This is the most relaxed we've seen this scene since we've been here. Uh, the original firefighters that were here have all left and they've all been replaced by firefighters from all over. Uh, that's from as far away as we've seen some from as well. But um, the firefighters do think that everyone got out okay except for, for some pets. A few disabled residents pets. were rescued by the... Pets didn't get out. And several other people who ran inside to pull them out. Um, Kim is the name of the police chief who uh, were told rescued about three people on his own. He ran inside this burning building to bring the people out. This is home video that was shot by a resident. At one point, you can see the flames coming out of a side bedroom, and it's believed that's where the fire started on the third floor. A woman heard fire crackling in her bedroom, and she tried to put it out with a towel, but it grew into this large fire. At one point, the roof collapsed, and that was a dangerous situation for firefighters. Once they started putting water on the flames, there was a lot of smoke, so you could definitely smell this fire before you could see it. Um, fire officials believe that this building is going to be a total loss. There were 12 apartments in this building, and the Red Cross is here to assist the people who have been displaced. Wow. That was my apartment. Yeah, that's what I figured. Now, was that... I don't know, just filming this series, I wonder, that looks very real. I don't know if they have the budget for that kind of thing. Makes me think that maybe they took a real fire and made it part of their story. I mean, I would. In my one video I did on my main channel, the first one with Miss Angel, where I did the thing where I ran up to the car and was like, I'm taking your car and your dog. First of all, it was my car and it was uh, my dog. <laughs> and But later that week, like when I was filming and stuff, my car actually needed to get towed. So I filmed my car getting towed and acted like it was part of the video of like, it. I just like took advantage of the opportunity. <laughs> 
No, guys, you guys are fine. You guys give me so much. Thank you. Entry 26, end of season one. Here we go. Since seeing the news report in entry 25, I've been changing my location frequently, trying to keep anyone from following me. Follow me on Instagram. Just kidding. <laughs> it was over these couple of weeks of going from hotel to hotel that I had a realization. In fact, I haven't thought about it in the past week, and frankly, I've been feeling a lot better. I memory's better, I'm not as paranoid, I'm not looking over my shoulder all the time like I used to be. So I think that Sound this sounds is for the good. Best. So Sounds like he got a mic. He got an upgrade in his setup. This is going to be the last entry that I'll be posting. Or a better camera. Both. Alex, welcome back. Did you just come back? Did you just get off work? We're actually at, this thing is wrong. We're actually at $142 total. But this thing only shows like donations through Streamlabs. Um, we've gotten a couple channel members and we've gotten a couple super chats and stuff. So we're at 142 right now. I decided to quit. Oh, he quit. I plan to move far out of state and stop thinking about it forever. Okay. Has no one talked to police about Alex? Like, does anyone know where he is? However, shortly after that, I received a text message from a strange number. Oh my gosh, that happened to me this week. I got a, I got a text message from someone and they were like, oh, are you Mr. So-and-so? And I was like, no, sorry, it must be a wrong number. And they were like, oh, you're not them either. I must keep putting in the wrong number or something. And I was like, oh, I was like, well, hope you find who you're looking for. And they were like, you sound like a nice person. <laughs> they were like, and then they were like, I'm from Japan and I just moved to California or whatever. And I was like, that's cool. <laughs> and I was like, I'm in Florida from Florida. And they were like, oh, I heard wonderful things. And then like our conversation ended there. So I had this random little text message with like a complete stranger. It was just like, oh, okay, well, welcome to the US. <laughs> However, shortly after, oh, oh yeah, strange number 41810. Zero. Sounds like they were trying to text one of those. Oh, that is a weird number. As soon as I share the picture, everyone agreed 41810 had to be a date. So 41810. Ooh, is it, are we in 2010 now? Or is it a future date? Hang on, let me check. Okay, this was posted on April 19th. So yeah, it was the day before 2010. So it was the day before. Um, wait, hang on, that's a mistake. Magnino Alex 2 donated $200 through Super Chat. No, no, no. Well, don't have the money, but... No, Alex, that's a mistake, right? You meant $20, right? You meant $20, right? Alex, <laughs> you meant $20, right? If so, I can, like, figure it out for you. <laughs> you meant $20, right? Wait. <laughs> Joey Reyna also donated $20 through Super Chat. All right, one more before we go. Also, sorry, I had to do it. Heart, 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 heart. Alex. <laughs> and Joey. <laughs> Joey, you already gave me 50. <laughs> then you get to me. <sighs> Alex. What? I'm sorry, my brain can't compute. <laughs> I'm stuck. My brain froze. Is frozen. Brain is frozen. I don't know where I am. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I just laugh. I don't know what else to do. <laughs> oh my gosh, Alex, <laughs> Alex, <laughs> don't <laughs> ah. <laughs> Unplug and plug it back in. <laughs> That's amazing. Alex <laughs> and Joey. Holy crap. Holy crap. <laughs> uh, um, I don't know how to say thank you to that. I'm feeling really lightheaded. That is incredible. I really was like, not even like had it in my mind to meet the goal. So to like go over that. That's. Ooh. <laughs> That's crazy. I don't know what to do. My brain is stuck. It's still stuck. Actually, it's, it's just going really slow. It's like booting up. So it's just crying. 
I literally was talking to my friend before this and was like, listen, like, I really want to be, like, helpful to anyone, like, to the souls that come and view my stream. Like, even if it's one or two people, I want to be helpful and I want to be encouraging to them. And I feel like I have, like... All, all I've got, all, all that's happened is you guys encouraging me. Like, like I wanted to come onto the stream and be able to like feed into you and encourage you. And then it's like the opposite. You guys have just done so much for me. Like, that's incredible. I wish I had 200 throw every week. Well, you know, Alex, when you become rich, you can fund my future films. You know, I've got like stuff I want to make. <laughs> Oh, you guys are unbelievable. I like can't even believe it. Uh, yeah. Okay. Let's finish watching this. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Thank you guys. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I can't. I can't. Okay. As soon as I show a picture of the day before April. Yeah, I got that. April 18th, 2010. We're there. <laughs> you totally paid her that one dollar. I will pay her that dollar. <laughs> today. Oh, it's today when they felt this. Okay. Sorry, that was loud. I have to like get back on my fluids from crying. <laughs> I like the staring. All right, what are we looking at? This is an interesting picture. It said, did it say boo on it? It says boo. Do you see that? <laughs> are you scared? Boo. <laughs> okay. Is that supposed to be birds? I forget the saying. Moths fly together, as they say. It's a good question. I don't know. Someone knows where I've been this entire time. Oh, yeah, because they've been filming you. They've been following you. And that part I don't get either. And they sent me this tape with the following footage. I wonder how far in advance they planned the story. Like, did they really, or did they just go with the flow? Oh, this is way blown out footage. This is, this is terrible footage. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, Joey. Four four twenty ten, almost four p.m. Four 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 p.m. Is this the same front area where the thing was? Dude, we were in such- oh, it's a girl. So when did this happen? Oh my gosh, that haircut. Why did- oh, like, bro. When did we get a camera? Justin Bieber Alex, haircut. come on. We don't have a camera. Yes, we do. <laughs> From that angle. Find that. It was in the closet. There's a tape already in it, but when I tried to watch it, it was messed up or something. I don't know. Um, that's probably just my old camera from college. Uh, Probably stuck it back in there when we moved. Uh, just gonna sell it. But I thought we didn't have a camera. Okay, so this is Look, him after? Doesn't matter. I'm gonna sell it. Just please put it back. Stop recording. He's okay. Fine, I'm not recording anymore. You can still see the Liar. Line. Are you okay, Alex? I'm fine. Just put it back, please. You're in a really odd mood right now. Fine. <laughs> Oh, I got goosebumps on my legs. Oof. Oof. Oh, that looks so creepy. Is it over? The footage is deeper. It did it. it. <laughs> The footage is dated April 4th, 2010. Yeah, two weeks ago. Yeah. So it came back to him. The package also had a return address. They did a lot better job instead of it just being a dude in a suit. Now it's like actually looks like a, I don't know how they made that. That looks really cool. Um, Alex is still alive and I'm going to find him. Ooh, this is a good cliffhanger into season two. Um, before everyone disappears though, uh, here you go.
<laughs> this is called Blood Not Funny. What, baby? Blood. What? Blood. What? Baby blood. Baby's got what? Blood. What does he have? Blood. Where? Blood. There. <laughs> Entry 27. The weird thumping. Strange repeated ticking. I wonder, is this from To the Art? Please stop with the thumping. <laughs> you just never know what to expect with these, so I get so nervous. It's okay, Crispy, neither am I. Right? Okay, can someone remind me of our like main character's name who's not Alex, the one who found the tapes in the first place? I can't remember who we are, like who our point of view is. Just open the blind. That's how most of these are, so just embrace the motion. Oh, gosh. I was like, why is there something like so dark? J, J is our guy. J is our guy. Okay. Sorry, that didn't scare me. I'm fine. <laughs> I just never know what to expect because sometimes it's like, oh, nothing happens at all. And then sometimes it's like, bah, in your face. I'm here. What? I know. I do need a blanket. I like to hide. I also don't like the clicking of the camera. What's that? It's weird. Motion? Was it like a hand or was it like a ceiling panel that fell? Entry 27. Okay. I feel like nothing happens when we're driving, so I feel safe. And watch, something's gonna happen when we're driving. It's been seven months since entry 26. Okay, so we're seven months later, it was posted. This morning, I woke up in a hotel. Did you check into that hotel? Why do you it's sound like, well, cause he's like, I woke up in a hotel. Like, I don't know. Did I, like, did he, there has been memory loss in this. So oh. that's where I'm like, I don't know how I how got there. So there we go. I guess. Past seven months are completely missing from my memory. Are we gonna have found footage now of his last seven months? Is that gonna be season two, where we piece together what he did? Car is passing. It's kind of pretty. I don't know the area I'm in at all. Ooh, this sounds like the beginning to like a Netflix comedy. Haruma. Hello, Jay. Hello. Did you see that? 
looked like a hair that moved on the left side, and I couldn't tell if it was just, like, a hair or if it was, like, something. Well, they do a lot of things in other places. Wait, sorry, I didn't read that. I don't know where the camera strap to me came from either. The camera. Oh. Is a camera strapped to him? Like a chest cam. It's like a police body cam. Weird place for like a fridge. There. <laughs> it doesn't even fit. I talked to the front desk and apparently my room was only booked for the night. Gotta check out. Long hallway. Oh, this looks like the shining. <laughs> like the yellow. I decided to extend the state while I get my bearings. Hello, you have a camera just already running in your room. Some poofy curtains. Mm. Mm. I need to get my calming slime. <laughs> I'm going to lay low for the next few days. Okay, lay low. I mean, pretty much you don't remember. Can't use the pool? Is it pool? Oh, no, cool. Like, oh. is it too cold? <laughs> Entry 28. I searched around the hotel room looking for anything to help me remember how I got here. Why not, like, look at the footage on your camera? The found footage that you will find. Oh, good point, Agent Ren. If he goes to sleep, you know the mask guy is coming back. That's the other thing, too. Who the heck was those people? Drawers sliding. Nothing in the fridge. Unless you're at like a really fancy place. Opens the bag, Slender Man's face is just bit. For the sake of it basically being Slender Man, I'm gonna call him Slender Man, even though I know that's not his name in this. But that's what I'm gonna call him. Ah, pills. Alex had pills or something before. Dropped one. Read the front. Show me the front. He is shaking. Ibuprofen. I love ibuprofen. Helpful oh, for the headaches. Key, ooh, a mysterious key. What could it be to? Things in the back, some clothes, flashlight, painkillers, key. <laughs> I love how it's all in caps, key. Yeah. Obviously, I'm keeping the key on my key ring. Keeping the key on his key ring. Keeping the key on his key ring. It's fun to say, to lock. There's also a safe under the bedside table. How nice of them. Is there something in there? It's locked, so it has to be for a reason. Did you lock it upon your first night there? 1985, is that when you were born? After four wrong tries, it locks after 15 minutes, so it's very... T Sorry. It's very time-consuming to try and open. Yesterday, I decided to leave my room and look around the area more. Do you know where you are? Have you, like, asked the hotel? <laughs> At least, like, where? I don't like that. <laughs> uh 
We've passed that lady twice. What's what? What's that under your jacket? Oh, this is uh, it's a camera. What's it for? Uh, you know, making videos of things. <laughs> it's for a documentary. I'm, I'm shooting, a, oh. shooting a documentary. What's it about? Uh, Z girl. Was... <laughs> Makes sense. Yeah. So. Well, uh, I'm Jessica. Nice to meet you. J. J. Uh, Mary. What? This sounds familiar. I don't know. Jay Leno? How so? Have you been in something I've seen? Unless, oh. you know, I've done something I don't know about. You know, so <laughs> she one of the girls that's been name. stalking him? Um, but yeah, I mean, I gotta, I gotta get going. Oh, so yeah, it was, sure. It was nice to meet oh, you, though. Nice you. Yeah. Prediction, she's part of the weird to the ARC people that has been secretly videotaping him. And she's like, oh, I'm just staying on a hotel near you. Who are you? You know, like trying to like, that's a prediction. Probably wrong. Continue on. What? He's like, what? This guy never gets hit on. He's just like, girl came up and talked to me. What? <laughs> this wouldn't have been noteworthy if Jessica hadn't said my name sounded familiar. Oh, okay. Well, I'm, I mean, sometimes people say that. I don't know. Unless he has a reason to be suspicious of that. She's also in the room next door to me, but I haven't seen anyone else in the hotel other than staff. Didn't you like pass her on your way in that other time though? Oh no, please no. My night security camera has also been capturing noises that may be coming from next door. Sounds like my old neighbors. <laughs> I'm going to stay here for a while longer and try to figure this out. <laughs> right, Crispy? <laughs> Entry 29. While looking through my security footage, I found something hidden on my hard drive. There's no date for it, and I don't know any of the locations shown. I only have the file name, no entry. Okay. So far, so good. <laughs> Entry 30. I left the hotel room yesterday to get some supplies. When I got back, my camera started acting strangely around Jessica. She's Slender Man. I don't know. It's gonna distort. Huh? Oh, there's a yeah, hold on. Uh, you can just stick them in the back. Thank you. A what? I mean, people don't normally bring groceries to this house. Well, you know, it's, I guess not. What are you doing here? You've been here for a while. Um, it's my house. A hotel? No, not like my house. It's being renovated. Oh. So like I'm staying here until it's fixed. So yeah. well, I mean, what what about you? Like, oh, you've been I here a while. Got kicked out. You got kicked out. Mhm. Mm uh, so I'm just like here till I find a new place. Oh okay. Um, why did you get kicked out? I don't want to talk about it. Uh, I mean that's that's fine. Yeah. Yeah. Um, work. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. I just don't like her. Last night I heard more noises that sounded like they were coming from next door. Oof. 
Yeah. I'm sorry, Same. I know, is he sleeping in jeans? No wonder this guy is disturbed. Coughing. She's possessed. Are you okay in there? Was there something? Yeah. Hang on, yeah, hang on. That was a blurred thing. There was like something. Oh, oh, what is that? Do you see it? Yeah, I, uh, I can't tell if I can't tell. Like I can't Bart tell. Simpson's mouth, but only it could be. It could be absolutely nothing, but something was like definitely a little. I don't know. I'm paranoid. <laughs> Loud noises out there coming from your room. I just woke up. Really. Yeah, why is there a camera in my face? Yeah, I'd oh, be kind of mad about a camera in my face. Shooting some stuff in here, and I, then I heard these voices coming from your room. I'm gonna go to bed. <laughs> no, they can be in the middle of the day, too. I just get nervous. I feel like Jessica is hiding something from me, so I'm going to try and talk to her again soon. I'm going to look around tomorrow for the area in entry 29. Where all the blood was. Yeah, I agree, Michael. I couldn't, I didn't see a mouth. I just saw blur, but I couldn't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm losing it. I'm losing it, guys. I'm next. I searched the area for anything that looked like Entry 29's location. All I could think to look for was the park since the beginning of 29 looked to be on a trail. That'd be so hard to find. It's just like trees. After looking for a week, I only found one big park. A week? Oh. It's called Rosswood and is split into two areas. The front seen here looks like a regular park. Um, Agent Ren, does the camera glitching out mean someone is nearby? Normally, so far in season one, the camera was only glitching when Slenderman slash the operator was nearby. Like anytime he was about to show up on camera, it started to glitch and distort. So it's interesting that it's glitching around a human, but obviously she wasn't the one making the noises. So is like Slenderman like, like a like a ghost that's like riding off the back of her. I I like piggybacking like eleven. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> but further back, there's a huge intricate set of trails. Trail. <laughs> Trail this way. <laughs> Sounds about right. Dude, that thing could get like easily like ooh, hello. That would freak me out. He's having someone walking, yeah. like but close nearby and is their hood up, of course, and I would be like, <laughs> No thanks. No thanks. The pepper spray. Ready to go. <laughs> Although if I was walking and someone started filming me too, I'd be <laughs> either way. See, I would almost, I would always right at What's that? Oh, I don't. Hello. Yeah, but they got a knife or something. Hmm. We're fine, guys. We're fine. <sighs> yeah, but Slender Man tends to blend in with the trees. He's tall. I mean, I'm afraid of that guy, but I'm also afraid that Slender Man is going to turn around and speak. In the trees. Anything can happen in these. It's very... Oh, 
Why did he have to find the most disturbing park I've ever seen? <laughs> most of the trails are old and poorly maintained. Yeah. What is this? this looks like garbage. A bunch of garbage. Garbage. Sorry. <laughs> you can probably hear it louder than they can because you're plugged right into the mic. Hi, Ig Ignis, Ignis. And good point. Excuse me. Hey. Mm. Mm. Excuse me. Excuse me. Okay, let's listen to music. Staring at a um, branch. <laughs> no. Sorry, I thought you were someone else. It's a very 2009 outfit. Slendy, you there in the forest? It, that's that's about that sums up the series. Oh, Nikki said that was a weird five minutes, and I said that that sums up the series. It was starting to rain, and I was getting paranoid, so I went back to the hotel. Yeah, right, Michael. It's strange. Walking back to walking back to my room on a whim. I tried talking to Jessica. Um, nothing. Well, okay, uh, this might sound weird, but do you know anything about the parks around here? Parks? Yeah. I mean, there's a few of them. Any in particular? Uh, the one, it's off of, uh, uh what's the road? It's called, uh, Rosswood Road, I think. I don't know. No, wait, it's actually called Rosswood Park. It's pretty big. Have you heard of it? I mean, I may have been there as a kid, but nothing comes to mind. Nothing at all? No, why are you asking? I'm, I'm just curious. I mean, I, I just got here, so I'm looking for a good area to start looking for an apartment or something. Just got here? Yeah, my job relocated me, and now I'm just looking for a No, to... you told me your house was being renovated. No, I didn't. Why would I say that? Yes, you did. No, I'm, you must have misheard me or something. No, I didn't. Never mind. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm obviously bothering you. I'm just going to go back to my room. Okay. What? Have you been feeling all right? Yeah. Why? Nothing's up. I mean, I haven't been sleeping that well, but I never sleep when I'm in hotels. You haven't been having any kind of, like, memory loss or anything, have you? 
Yeah. Higher. All right. It's funny because if someone randomly asked me, you haven't been having any like memory loss or anything, have you? I'd be like, why? What? What does that have to do with anything? I'd be like, why are you asking me that? What's going on that makes you think that would be the case? Well, and the fact that she's like talking to him like they're the bestest pals. Are you okay, Jenny? Even though she was already like acting out like a dick to him five seconds before. Well, I'm just saying like he's clearly lying because if someone was like, you're having a memory loss and you're just like, no. Like you wouldn't be like curious, you know? So he's clearly lying. doing? I'm just seeing who's at the door. With a camera? Well, I mean, I had it in my hand already. I Look, was doing Jay, some filming. I know you're lying. First you tell me some stupid thing about a hotel documentary, and then you tell me your house was being renovated, but then you told me your job was being relocated. What is going on? It's... it's complicated. You're not acting like a normal person. Well... What's the matter to you? You're just some stranger. I think something's going on. I know something's going on. Like what? I don't know how I got here. You're the only person I've seen in this hotel other than the staff, and we have adjoining rooms. I don't even know you. You said it yourself. I'm a stranger. Have I had any kind of memory loss at all? I think I'm going crazy. I'm losing huge chunks of time. I'm having pounding headaches and coffee fits and I can't sleep, but when I do sleep, I think I'm sleepwalking. And I keep having these dreams where I'm a little kid and something's watching me. Stop. Look, Jessica, I'll, I'll tell you everything, but just, just give me a few minutes to get it all straight in my head. I'll be in there soon. You should probably start packing some things, because I'm pretty sure we're going to have to leave tonight. Leave your door open. Yeah, same. Did our dog cry? I heard a dog crying noise. I'm uploading this before I go next... I'm uploading this before I go next door in case something happens to me. It's time to get out of here. I'm giving up on the safe. I did not. Entry Jessica, I'm coming in. Jessica. Jessica, like, dead or gone or something. Jessica. Jessica. Oof. Jessica.
Hey, it's your code, 1102. Try it on your safe. Your code. La, la. Oy. It's like a video game. <laughs> more tapes, more tapes. Oh. Jessica. Jessica. Oh, Jessica. Oh, no mask. part of this too well, i was I able to get no remember i said earlier there's people with the mask stuff you just have to take this in and embrace it as is because okay. you missed the whole first season okay. Okay. i was able to get out of the hotel with the external hard drive and all the tapes that were in the safe i'm now in a new location where i'm going to go through all the footage new footage New found footage. New found footage. Hopefully they'll help me figure out what to do next. I don't know what happened to Jessica, but I'm not going back to that hotel alone. Entry 34. I've begun to look through all the footage I took out of the safe back in the hotel. Yeah, true. All of the tapes seem to be roughly ordered, but a few are unlabeled. I'm starting with the very first tape and working my way through them all. I'll be uploading any significant things I find. In this case, everything's significant because y'all to see will show us five minutes of like a park and all right. <laughs> like it is Wednesday, April twenty first, two thousand ten. It's 3.56 p.m. Wait, I'm confused. In at the end of season one, it was April 18th, 2010. That was the date, and he was like, today. Mm -hmm. And then at the beginning of season two, they said, oh, now it's been seven months since that tape last in season one. Oh, oh. Never mind. I'm a dumb dumb. I just figured it out. <laughs> this is before season two began. This is the tapes he found that we're watching. I'm an idiot. So this is beginning his seven months of memory loss. So now we're watching what he did in those seven months. <laughs> right now, I'm on my way. We're finding out what happened that whole time he didn't remember how he got to the hotel. And there was like seven months of like time missing from his memory Fair. that we watch. Okay. We're now seeing what he did in those seven months. To the yes, thank you, Christina. Uh, return address here that was on the uh, package that was outside my door a couple of days ago. I've more or less been driving non stop since I got the package and uh, watched the tape that was in it. And I think getting fairly close uh, to the address, the return address. Probably say about 15 or 20 minutes away. I have no idea what's going to be there when I get there. So, it's looking a little rainy. And I don't know why I'm still talking. <laughs> looking a little rainy out there, Tim. <laughs> and back to the sports. Abandoned building. Very on par. 
Hello. Oh, that was spooky. Now it's like we're watching urban explorers. People put that kind of, um, yeah, people put that kind of stuff. Bars. Yeah. Clearly, the windows aren't the problem here. <laughs> it comes to breaking in. out filming today. Uh, no <sighs> sigh of relief, yeah, right. <laughs> Christina. <laughs> We're like 10 videos in to season two and we haven't even seen him yet. We saw him a lot in season one. They're like really building it up. Oh, wait, no, we did see him in that one clip they showed us where he was like far away. Blah, blah, blah. This must have been where the return address of the package from entry 26 led me. Oh, interesting. It looks like I was unable to find anything inside the building on this particular day, though. Interesting. Surely I went back again to search more thoroughly. I just have to say, I love all the, um, <laughs> the pink teacups. I, I know. Pink, 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 pink teacups in the chat. Fragments. Okay, so I should also say that some of these um, entries are from a different YouTube channel called To The Arc, that during the time of all these videos being uploaded to YouTube, both channels were uploading and they both deal with the same story. Fragments is usually very strange videos. Don't worry, if you didn't put your glasses on, it's blurry for everyone. Entry 35. On this particular day, what do you mean, Christina? Footsteps and rustling. Oh. So now we're here again. Yes, pink teacup gang. Hello. Why? <laughs> we, both, we both went, why? Why would you say that? <laughs> why would you expect anyone to be there? Like, I understand maybe saying that when you expect a human. Here. What are you wanting me to see? I'm not seeing anything. No. <laughs> okay. Huh? Alex. Hello. Jay and Alex were together? Okay, we're gonna find out. Oh, they injured his leg, I bet. We don't know. We don't know. Hello. Oh, it's him. What? Give me the knife. What? No, I'm not giving you the knife. What is him? What? No, hey, hey, hey. What are you doing? Did he? 
I'm. I like the sideburns. What does he have to do with this? So I mean, he was one of the. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, chat. He was one of the actors in the film, right? Right. Or he was helping Alex with the film. And did Alex just like bang his head in with a rock? I never thought I'd find something like this on the tapes. It changes everything. Yeah, because you might be an accessory to murder. I mean, he needs to die. No one should be jumping out at people from the darkness. He needs to kill. <laughs> <laughs> Michael, ah, uh, classic horror when objectively we just don't understand some of the protagonist's choices. I don't know what happened after the encounter with Tim. The footage goes straight to meat driving. You're just like, huh, we killed a man? Let's drive. Ah, uh, to the arc broadcast. Is there a uh, uh, captioning on these? Let's see. Music. Oh, he's not dead. We saw him at the hotel later. We did? Did I not see him? Or did I see no, him? he was the one limping. So we know he had a leg injury. But we didn't oh, know. true. I wasn't sure if maybe someone else. Because there the seems to be there seems cool. to be multiple people in masks. Or am I wrong? Um, Tim was an actor in the movie. And it was actually kind of hinted at in season one. And one of the entries, Tim is wearing the same jacket that mask he wears. And based on Tim's coughing, he isn't doing well. Interesting. <laughs> I didn't get it. I didn't get the, I was trying to get the, what they were saying. I, I thought I thought it'd be better at that than I was. After looking through the tape from entry 35, I didn't know what happened after finding Alex at the abandoned house. Please don't jump out at me again. I didn't like it the first time. I then noticed that the tape itself had time left on it, but wouldn't continue to play past this point. Hmm. But after trying for a few days, I was able to find some corrupt footage at the end of the tape. I've subtitled what I think is being said as best I can. Zoom in, zoom out. Alex must have been the one that sent me the package to my hotel room in entry 26. Why did why he did it is unclear, but I'm hoping one of the tapes I have includes him explaining it to me. Into the arcs, the audio into the arc, the audio says, "Enjoy watching, enjoying watching you suffer. Do you know me? I will always know you." Side tone. <laughs> Ooh, numbers. I saw nine, fifteen, twelve. I don't know. And and to tree. <laughs> and, to tree. and try thirty-seven. Nineteen ninety-one. I wasn't alive yet. <laughs> Neither was Christina, actually. Christina, you weren't even born yet. This is my favorite song. Hey, do you not 
Happy birthday to you. I don't like that they're all lowered in pitch. You're so old, Michael. <laughs> old. Remember, you were deemed the channel elder. Entry 38. I found the following footage from one of the unlabeled tapes I have. Yeah, maybe. Most of it is Alex and I walking along a trail. We almost say nothing to each other. This is the last few minutes. Sometimes you just need to walk and not talk with your bros. Ugh. It's getting dark, Alex. Also, I have no idea where we are. We're almost there. Do you want me to take the camera? Yeah. So where is there? How do I How feel much like do you know about this area? Nothing. I feel like Alex is gonna try to murder Jay. When I first moved here, I remember hearing a story that back in the 1800s they thought this place was blessed because everything would grow so fast. They would take their worst criminals, murderers and child molesters, and they would put them on trial before God out here. They would tie them up to the trees and. The idea was that they would get stretched out, kind of like a rack. They never fed or gave them water, though, so they would just die of dehydration. Why are you telling me this? Because that's what I'm going to do to you. They never cut down the bodies. They would just burn the whole tree with them still on it. They stopped doing it, though, after the kid went missing. And he finally turned up in the area where they would do the trials. He had been dismembered and strung up. So is this why we're out here? To uh, look at trees and tell spooky ghost stories? Come here. Uh. What? Okay, I'm sorry. If my friend, I don't even care if it's Nikki, took me out to the woods and was like, do you know this area? You don't know? You'd be lost if I left you here, if I strung you up to a tree and left you here. I don't care. I don't trust you. I'm getting out of there. <laughs> I feel like you've lost your mind. This is where you brought me to die. <laughs> like, no. <laughs> Just come here. Wait, hold on True a True agent, Ren. Uh, there's only about a minute left on this tape. I'm going to change it real quick. Since the tape was unlabeled, I don't know where it fits with the seven months that I don't remember. The way that Alex is acting, it makes me very uneasy. Why was he telling me all of that? And what happened to him? Is he missing again? <laughs> we just found him. I feel like it's I'm getting closer, but not fast enough. Dude, it seems like every time you get closer, you just lose your memory. So I feel like we're just going to keep going in loops. Every time you figure anything out, it's just going to be like, memory wipe. All right, we're back here again, but why? I did not post it. I don't know where this footage came from. Someone must have hijacked my account, probably whoever uploaded entry number. number, number, number. I've changed my password again, but I'm not going to delete the video. Crispy Christians, if anyone ever says, come here the way Alex just said it, I'd never trust them again. <laughs> come here. Come here. I'm not going to hurt you. Was it the shit? in your room with the darkness and you heard you crying. And you did that. Yeah, so um, <laughs> it makes me think of in The Shining when Jack's like, come here. Come here. I'm not going to hurt you. Yeah, I'm not going to hurt you. Ever. I'm just going to bash your brains out. Um... 
Entry 30 is not operator origin story since a lot of people think it is. I, oh. Yeah, hmm, hmm, interesting. You know you trust a person a lot when you go into the woods with them at dusk and don't worry constantly about your choice. It's true. Entry 39. About a week after finding Alex in the abandoned house. Or about a week after finding Alex in the abandoned house. Thud of phone being set down. It's actually kind of pretty. Alex. Meet me at Rosswood Park tomorrow. Why haven't you called? It's been over a week. Meet me at Rosswood no, Park. No, I, I heard you. Just, where have you been? Alex. Hang up on me. I don't think they're really, really like, frat. Oh. You've reached the voicemail of Alex Crayley. I'm not answering my phone right now. He more so got involved because he found the tapes of his film. I think they're just friends now because, uh, Pickament. Whooshing. <laughs> Thud. <laughs> oh, I don't like this view. <laughs> I don't like that. I don't like it, you know. Ah. <laughs> I don't like this. I just feel like like there's just going to be like a from underneath just like like raises up, you know, <laughs> a hand. Roughly 40 minutes pass on this tape. Something's just going to be like crawling. Oh, hello. Slendy? Is that you? <laughs> the footage is too blurry to see who was outside my car. From what I can tell, this was the only appearance the person made that night. <sighs> Forecast. Whoa. Why does it look like people on a plate that are just breathing? That's what I see. It's like a psychology test. Here's something I've wanted to show you. Ooh, someone filmed them sleeping in his car. I wouldn't sleep in my car and wait for someone. I would just leave, you know? This music's kind of nice. <laughs> Entry 40. The day after Alex called. I feel like in season one so far, they hid Slendy in the background a lot more times, and it was a lot more, like, obvious. Like, he was really close at some points, but, like, blending in with what they had. Oh. She just pointed to this bit on the screen. 
like it being a little weird that there's kind of like a little opening there. Like maybe like there's someone there. Interesting. But like in the season one, he was very close. It would be like sort of blended in with the Alex, colors, you know? Um, you didn't actually tell me what time you're going to meet me here. So, ah. uh, you said there's someone sitting next to the tree on the left. Okay, so we pointed out to the right, but you're saying on the left. Both are weird. Yeah, they're not naturally. It could be a very wide person. And there's one leg on one side and the other on the other. Oh, and they're just crab walking. <laughs> I'm here. Whenever you decide to come. Honestly, honestly, if there was a very, like, I know Slender Man is scary because he's very tall and long, but if there was a very wide person and they did just, like, crab walk at you in the night, I would be terrified. <laughs> like, yeah. I would be like, that's horrifying. <laughs> it's 3 a.m. I better get going. Oh, good night. Good night. Sleep well. Why did he like oh, zoom in? White. Why did he white. zoom in there? I, I saw white too, but it seemed too low. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Unless he's like crouched over. Hello. Okay. Peter's is Peter in his bed. <laughs> Peter's sleeping in Hershey's bed. Ooh. I don't know why, but if I was walking through there, I'd start singing, Let's get down to business. To defeat. I'd be like, dum, 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 dum. Is that a tower? Yeah, what happened to the tower in the first season? Ooh. Oh, yes. Mm. Hey. Did you just take him out of Hershey's bed? <laughs> no. Got up. Got See up. you. I know the tower won't be there, but it, I know we're in a whole different area, but like what we never uncovered the mysteries of the first area, you know, now we're in a whole new area with mysteries. Alex, um, I'm in the woods right now near where I'm I in park, the woods. so if you're, uh, if you're here, you're wondering where I am, uh, I'm here. <laughs> I'll probably be back out there in about 15 or 20 yeah. minutes. I'm not exactly sure where I am. So. In case you wanted to know what it's like to no, be an ant. Just a minute. <laughs> ant POV. <laughs> be like. this oh what it's like a tree fireplace that's probably not good for fires <laughs> you know <laughs> like <laughs> To, like duck in and he just stretches once 
<laughs> yeah. Ugh. Sleeps like this. <laughs> Slender man. Oh no. No thanks. Ooh. Oh, he's here. <laughs> Not tall enough. Oh! Gosh. That was close. It scared me. Very well dressed villain. Yes. As soon as there's any light on him. Peter. <laughs> yeah, he comes out all the time. Oh. What's this one called? Intermission. Ooh, hang on. I want to see that. Hang on. I was just trying to see. Look at that. Doesn't it look like it's like. Like it's like there's like arms. Yeah. Like arms. It's it's the wide person who crab walks at night. <laughs> like this is her. Imagine this with like wide legs. Just like, like coming at you in the forest. <laughs> that and then siren head just like. What's up? <laughs> and then Slender Man. Oof. Oof. I saw you. Because you have to keep in mind that when this was being made, it was literally being made by some random kid. Like, he was making this entire series. It wasn't like a production team, you know, or anything. 85912925. That's what I see. 815912825. That's I what see I see. Also, Where do you see the four? It's up to interpretation. It could be a four or a nine. Or a nine. That's true. I, I see nine, I but... Oh, oh. <laughs> write it down, write it down. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> we both... 1920-85185. We're both wrong. Little bug. Entry 41. There's about 15 minutes, oh, baby boy, of nothing on the tape from entry 40 before the picture comes back. Big sigh from the baby boy. Eight six seven five three Did Jay come back for his camera? Hello. Are you? Can you show us your face? You just picked up the camera. You're just walking with it. Pretty darling. Slight distortions.
Oh. Small cars. No one's car. We're upside down now. Hello. Who are you? Are you our sideburns friend? Oof. Indicate. Messages everywhere. Alrighty. Signs everywhere. Why are you waiting for tea? You will never be free. Ooh, binary. It's binary. It's binary. I know that. There's binary in one of my videos. Tyler says, I think the hooded person is to the Ark instead of Tim slash Maskey because remember the footage of to the Ark walking by Jay's car was a week after Tim got his leg messed up, so it makes sense to me. Hmm, good point. Oh, Crispy Christian's gonna have to leave since it's almost 2.30 a.m. Oh my goodness. Good night, Crispy Christians. Have wonderful, wonderful, peaceful sleep. Um, we're probably going to, um, I'd say we're gonna go for about 15 more minutes or so, see how far we can get, and then I plan to do more. I can't do as long tonight, but um, I plan to do more later. Okay, exit, uh, entry 42. I'm going through the videos on the external hard drive that I found in the hotel. After looking at the video's files, dates, I found that they begin at the same time as the events in entry 41. Oof, my brain can't keep up. We need Matt Pat on this. This is Alex, right? Yeah, we're with Alex now. Alex, um, I'm in the woods right now near where I park, so if you're, uh, if you're here, you're wondering where I am, I'm in here. Yeah, why didn't you meet him? You said you would meet him. Oh, he mad. Why are you so mad? Did you not call him? Was that someone... Rips the camera lens. Jay, I'm outside the woods. I don't know why you decided to go in there, but get out here. Now. Hmm. Oh, what? Jay! What the hell are you doing out here? Get out here, come on. What? what? Run? Okay, if someone says run, you run. Run. Oh. Good eye, Tyler. What was that all about? What are you running from? 
<laughs> that thing. That thing is in there. A couple of miles in, but yeah. What were you doing a couple of miles in the woods? I don't know, I was tired of waiting on you because you didn't tell me what time you were going to be here. And, you know, I thought I'd take a look around while I was waiting. And I got kind of lost, I guess. You got lost in woods you've never been in? <laughs> yes. Do you at least have the camera? No. No. <laughs> is the camera a couple of miles in the woods? Yes, it is, because I dropped it. <sighs> Why does he care? Let's go. He was going to sell his camera. Come on, let's go. Interesting. You saw what was on the video I sent you. And you have no clue where Amy is. No. Well, what do you want me to do about it? Help me, Jay. All right, look, we have a better chance of finding her together. Yeah, I'll, I'll help you, but... Today, I'm done. Why? Fine. Fine. Alex, I said I'd help you. I just, I can't today. Not after that. I'm just going to go to a hotel and mm. stay there because I don't want to sleep in my car tonight. Fine. Just follow me. I know a couple that are close by. I don't want any close to here. <laughs> just come on. What? It's in my car. Oh, he What's left it for it? him. I don't know, I guess the battery's dead. We'll check it when we get to the hotel. Let's go. Memories. Years wasted. Nothing. How much more than time has been taken? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Entry 43. Very aggressive vibration. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Peter <gasps> darling. Wait, what is he barking at? You want to close the blinds? One moment. Okay, we're back. <laughs> Sorry for the interruption. Going from the quiet to doom. What I was like. to the house. About five minutes. Is this it? Yeah. That window up there is the one we jumped out of. Um, oh, you when, go after that? when the girl and him were being chased in the first one we watched. The next thing I remember, I was waking up in my apartment with the camera.
Is everyone home? Can you tell? I don't think so. I don't see a roommate's car. Whose car is that up there? It's a divided house, so these cars belong to her neighbors. They live in the right side there. Oh, okay, and Amy lives on the left. Yep. Okay. Well, I mean, why don't you just go knock on the door? Can't hurt, we're here. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Yeah. I'm here for you from the car. <laughs> what? Who are you calling? Where am I? Hey Jessica, it's Alex. Uh, I was just calling to see if you had heard from Amy recently. Uh, just give me a call back whenever you get a chance. Thanks. Yeah. The bird is a paid actor. So where are we going now? We're gonna take you back to the hotel and then I'm heading back to my place. Do you want me to follow you? No. I think it's best that you don't know where I live. Amy's roommate's name is Jessica. Is that what he said? I totally missed that. Tyler's here to save us. <laughs> Cloudy. Kind of rainy. There's some aggressive footsteps. But then again, cameras back then didn't have the stabilizing that like our iPhones do now. So, a little bit rougher. This is an interesting area. Why are we here? Feel the bugs. Ooh! Yeah, the humidity and the bugs. Ooh, it's like a little humid cave. <laughs> Probably a mosquito. Oh. That's not what I was expecting to see. <laughs> no, it's just the woods. It's it's an entrance to the woods. Yeah, Slenderman has to duck real far down. Yeah, that he has a short door to his house. Oof, oh gosh. Inquiry. 
Look at you. Face. Is that them? Look at you. Brain. You are who you are. Fingerprints? Bloody fingerprints. I like this music, actually. You are you. This feels like affirmations. Everyone, say your affirmations. You are you. The power of oh, but who are you? But who am I? Ooh, ooh, it's giving me like Mandela catalog vibes before Mandela catalog. Hello, Len. Hello, hello. Welcome. I know this is a very different time than I normally stream, so hopefully other people get to join. Entry 44. Where are we? Ooh, it's so dark. Creaking of a door opening. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like the just door with the light darkness all around. Oh, this is his house, I think. Hey, Jessica, it's Alex. What? <laughs> That's scary. Uh, I just wanted to call and let you know that I got in touch with Amy, so just disregard my last it's message. Alex. Thanks. Hi, Alex. Alex, what happened? Did you leave Jade to die in the woods? Oh. Hi, and welcome to Chili's. <coughs> Oh, was it him coughing, or it wasn't Jay, or was it him? <coughs> Ew. <coughs> Ew. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Click of a flashlight turning on. Gonna read all of this like it's Shakespeare. Flashlight clicks off, continuous static. Oh, he's possessed. Only possessed people draw like that with a sharpie. Jimmy Chonka. That actually looks kind of satisfying to draw. Circle, circle. X. Operator. Say his name. What's the guy's name in that one movie? Say his name. Oh, wait, no. Say it. Vampire. <laughs> oh, no. Alex, Alex, what's going on? Oh. No. No, I don't like it. Quiet footsteps from a different angle. I'm so nervous. The shadow. Yeah. That shadow. Hi, Ryan. Oh, hello. Glad you're from high glasses. Squeaking. Well, that's a squeaky bed. Squeaky. Squeak. I don't like this. I don't like it. It's like, ooh, it's like paranormal. Oh, he's there. He's there. He's in the corner. Do you see that? Oh. Oh, it's like going away. Alex's bed is empty until the camera's batteries run out. I've looked back through the footage and found absolutely no evidence that Alex got in touch with Amy. That's interesting. He lied. He's a liar. Entry 45. 
we're going to get to 52 today, approximately three months after finding Alex, because that's where season two ends. So it's been another three months. Jay's dead, I bet. I don't like that. Thank you, Nikki. the masky guy or is that just another stalker what? oh oh it it was distorting eventually run out of breath. I've seen Mr. Beast tags. <laughs> oh, I don't like this. I don't like the dramatic camera movements. Oh, the trees, the trees, the trees, even the trees are on her side. Okay, that yell was a little bit weak, but the the sound of someone just running at you, there's two. Two maskies. We already discovered that is that tinfoil? What did he put on his face? We already discovered that one of the people was Tim, who was one of the actors. They took off his mask and it was Tim. Ooh, it's distorting. Did Slenderman save him? Like they he approached and they left? Crickets. Get back here! Ooh. Does he have two voices because he's possessed? What? Oh, I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it. <laughs> the next time I see you, I'll kill you! I don't like that. It's really whoosh. They were just feeling a little silly. <laughs> Darling, Peter, no. No, dear. Peters, come here. Hey, if you're a channel member, you can use your uh, Peter emoji. As well as, did you know that <laughs> you can gift memberships now to other people, similar to Twitch, how you can gift subs? You can, uh, when someone's live streaming, you can gift memberships so that way they get the cool emojis and perks too. So just sharing that. <laughs> Sounds like a really terrible self promo. I don't care. Uh, person. Okay. Who are we watching? And who are we? Is that, or is this, we're watching from Alex's perspective? No? Interesting. Jay's footsteps. Spoiler alert! The, uh, the, those things gave it away. The movements that make me unsettled. Boxes. I hate having boxes in the hallway. <laughs> yeah, they're griefing. <laughs> Stop with your movements. Flashlight. Wait, if we're Jay right now and we just went into Alex's house. Oh, because Alex left. So he's looking for something before Alex comes in. But what does he want? The tape? The book? He's back. 
hide. <laughs> I don't know who to be scared of. Actually, if I was Alex, I'd be terrified that someone's hiding in my house. The Slender Pages, yeah. So this series actually inspired, if I understand correctly, this found footage series in... That didn't seem like Alex's footsteps. This series inspired the Slender game, and that's why it has pages. Okay, maybe it was Alex, but those footsteps seemed weird. Like, very motiony, movement-y. Hey, oh, Jay, gosh. You your flashlight. What are you doing here? What is this? Shut, just shut up. Turn up the flashlight. I'll give it your window. Yes, this predates actually anything made about. This was like one of the first things actually made about Slender Man, other than the post on Creepypasta. I don't like it. <laughs> oh. My chest. <laughs> Peter, come here. Come. Thank you. Oh, too much. That's too much. Thank you there. He doesn't like when I yell. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Alex had plans. <laughs> why are you so cute Alex had plenty of time to follow me but didn't I don't know why he wouldn't run after seeing what was behind him that's because he's possessed by Slenderman by the operator I am cute I'm so cute he does he loves kisses he loves snuggles he loves everything to show love yes oh that that one really got me that hurt my chest when it oof <laughs> Also, the key I took as I ran out. Okay, so we're back from Jay's perspective again. Also, the key I took I, as I ran out looked exactly like the one I found in my bag back at the hotel. I still don't know what it goes to, though. Hmm. Classified. So this is from To the Ark. I know you're there. I saw it. Okay. Entry 47. About an hour after leaving Alex's apartment. Oh, oof. I have felt that. Just chin on horn, help, 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 head, forehead on thingy. Who is that? Who is that? Who is that? How could you not see that? <gasps> How would that not scare the crap out of you? Looks to the camera first. What? Looks to the camera. What? What is it? What is wrong Death. with you? Huh? Breaking into my apartment? What are you thinking? Let's calm down. I had a good reason. And what would that be, huh? I, I had a I had a hunch. A hunch? Yeah. Oh, a hunch. What did you expect to find, huh? This? You thought that some tape laying on my desk was going to be the answer to all of your questions? I don't know. Maybe. You don't even know what's on this tape, do you? It's okay. Cars jingling. I mean, car keys jingling. It'd be really funny if cars were jingling. What does he put in his car to keep his camera like that? Because I've tried and it's not that easy, unless it's a really chunky camera. Hello. How'd you get out of your apartment? You know, Jay, I brought you out here because I thought you could help, but you've done nothing but make everything worse. He should have tried gaming on YouTube. He has a nice voice. Well, you know what? You never really gave me a whole lot to go on. I've just been wandering around and waiting on you to call. It's not really a, a good way to speed up the process, is it? Is this a breakup call speech? <laughs> just kidding. Stop. Why? You're the, for I people who like. I come out here to help you find Amy, but the way you've been acting recently, it's 
They're thinking the exact opposite. You listen to don't me. Don't listen to me. I don't like it. It's Sorry, a little difficult to try to find someone when you have psychopaths wearing masks tracking you down and people are breaking into your apartment. <laughs> that did not happen Peter, no. you came around. I wanted to help you, Alex, but I've spent three months doing almost nothing. That is your fault, not mine. How am I supposed to trust you to do anything when you're pulling stunts like this? Exactly, Len. It's like a breakup and scene. <laughs> So much more than you have, Alex. Oh, you think you're making such a huge difference? <laughs> yeah, I do. Well, you can do it by yourself. Because I'm done helping you. Good. Great. Maybe now I can do something besides waiting on you constantly. <laughs> I'm done making you dinner. You make it for yourself. <laughs> and I was going to say, for people, for these students who are supposed to be film students, they're off let Give handling the camera. Number. No. I'm and done helping you. I'm not gonna help you. Yeah. Oh, he was gonna like pants him. Sorry, it's locked. Guess you can't get your keys. Unless you give me the phone number. Sustain. One one zero two. Making sure you gave me the right number. I'm just gonna take that and leave. Not that stupid. <laughs> okay. Hey, this is Jessica. I'm not here right now. Please be my All right. Move. There's your keys. I want to keep those in your pocket from now on. That's a weird comment. I'm done with you. Keep your keys in your pocket. <laughs> and thank you, Haley. Nightmind has a great series explaining the show season by season. It might be good to watch if you have any questions after you finish season three. Yeah, I'll have to take a look at that. Alex never told me how he got out of his apartment. Alex never told me how he got out of his apartment. Oh, hello. It's much more... Wow, in your face. Hello? Uh, Jessica. Um, this is, uh, this is Jay. I'm a friend of, uh, Alex Crayley's. Oh. Hi. Um, listen, I know Alex has probably already asked you this, uh, but have you seen Amy recently? No, she's still with him, isn't she? Still with him where? He left her original a few months ago, saying he'd gotten in touch with her. Well, where did they go? He did. I've been around Alex these past few months looking for her. He told me he had no idea where she was. What? Has he has he called you back since then? No, not since he left me that voicemail. Should I be worried? Where is Amy? I'm yes. not sure right now. I don't, I don't know why Alex would be telling different people, different stories like that. Now we need a missing person case. If Alex calls you back, just to be safe, uh, don't answer him. Um, I'm gonna go talk to him soon and, and get everything straight with him, okay? Okay. You're gonna die. Uh, and, and don't worry too much about it. He may have just misspoke or something. I mean, we'll find Amy. I mean, if he, if Alex hasn't found her already, no, that's concerning. Okay. She has a right to be concerned. I'll uh, I'll Should call you back when I know something. Make a missing persons case potentially. So, yeah, I'll uh, I'll talk to you later. Slenderman anywhere in the background? Hi. All right. Bye. I don't see him. Sometimes they hide him in the background.
So Jessica found out Alex was lying to her about finding Amy. Yeah. It sounds like I was trying to reassure her on the phone, even though I probably didn't plan to talk to Alex ever again after the previous night. Why would you do that? Why would you be like, yeah, I don't plan to talk to Alex, but I'm going to tell this other person that I'll talk to Alex to find out where Amy is. You're That's bad for Amy. If the, mm -hmm. In hindsight, I never should have called her. Why? If Amy is missing, people have a right to know. Why are you trying to... Starting to not like Jay if he doesn't handle this rightly, cor correctly. <laughs> Entry 48. Hey, it's okay. It's all right, honey. It's fine. Ooh, ew. All right, who are we now? I began following Alex after finding out about him lying to Jessica. You should be trying to find out where Amy is. File missing persons. Something. Someone help Amy. <laughs> From what I can tell, I never caught him doing anything out of the ordinary during the few months I was doing this. Yeah, but did you see Amy? Does no one care about Amy? Um, <laughs> the only thing I noticed is that he started carrying around a small satchel with him. I love that. <laughs> I don't carry purses. I carry small satchels. He also went into Rosswood Park on a regular basis wearing his chest-mounted camera. <laughs> I almost like looked at the camera there filming me bruh and i'm not sure bruh jay stalker arc yeah jay's in his i don't care about amy i just want to follow alex because i'm obsessed with alex <sighs> i thought you said you were done with him bro goodness rustling i mean this is just unwise but after a few more weeks, I must have decided that there was no other option. Okay, no other option other than filing a missing person case for Amy, right? That's what you mean? No other option? Satchel. Zoomed in. Satchel. <laughs> Looks like a nice day if it's not Florida. Florida. Summertime is the worst. I don't even know if it's summertime. It just kind of looks like summertime. The way he walks, too, is very... I mean, is that how that guy walks in real life? Goodness. Why are we running? Oh, it's like ASMR. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Okay, you were running at him that close and he didn't notice. He is going on a stroll into a bush. Just walking into the bush. Here I go. Bush walking. Okay, now you're just out in the open. snakes I'm nervous also the camera quality sucks okay now you don't know where he is and you're making a ton of noise Ooh, stop with the whipping around I lose Alex almost immediately. Oh, well, yeah. I really like the noise. I'm a 
like a bird. Crunchy, 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 crunchy. This makes me want to go on a hike. The buzzing. Hmm. Oh. Mm. <laughs> a cute day walking in the woods. <laughs> yes. You should really tell people in your life when you plan to do that kind of thing alone, though. Because, um, if you got hurt and you got stuck, no one would find you. That's very dangerous. Tiny bridge. A tiny bridge for hardly anything underneath it. When they put the camera down, it makes me nervous because it makes me think they are waiting for, like, one of their actor friends to get into position, like, ahead or something. Like, they move a camera in a way to, like, allow people to, like, who are going to be in the shot. Ooh, big tunnel. Ah, you found... How the heck did you find him? How'd you do that, bro? <laughs> him in his satchel. What you got in that satchel? What's going on in the satchel, bro? Why'd you just look in it and then look away? Hello. Oh gosh, making me motion sick. I don't know why. I left Rosswood without trying to approach Alex. Dude, your camera was not made for this kind of motion. It does not have a stabilizer on it. But rattling. I didn't know it at the time, but the tunnel Alex was in looks exactly like the one from No Entry video that I found in entry number 29. It does. Probably is the same. Since Alex was wearing his camera while I was following him, I'm going to check the footage of his that I have. I need to find out what he did in there. Side note. Peter, it's okay. <laughs> Be silent. Peter, be silent. Be silent. No, that's the opposite of what, honey? That was fun. <laughs> Entry 49. I've gone through all of the footage from Alex's camera on the day I followed him into Rosswood. I didn't want to upload it here, but now I feel like I need to in case anything happens to me or the footage. I don't know what disconnected to my computer. <laughs> ah! Oh, gosh. My own, my own external hard drive. <laughs> you think you remember what's coming up? That means something. No spoilers, but that probably means something crazy is about to come up, and that makes me nervous. We are planning to watch to the end of season two, so... I assume they'll go out with some sort of a bang. Into the unknown. Into the unknown. Hey, do any of you guys like Ryan Traham? <laughs> Random question. Let me know. <laughs> I know your name. I know your name. Ooh, they linked it up. That's nice. Yeah. 
Honey boo. Show us what's in the satchel. I want to know. Can you show me? Alex sits in the tunnel for about 15 minutes. Maybe he was doing mindful meditations. Not a great position. Hey, man. I told you not to follow me! Uh, Who is that? Ah! Yeah, pretty bigger guy and he's kind of a little high school dude you know or college kid oh poor guy alex you're a murderer now did you murder amy oh that's rough that's rough So he said, I told you not to follow me. Far away thump. Strengthening ringing noise. Oh. My dude. He's already dead. Removed. Alex throws the rock down on the person's head four separate times. Might have some blood on your clothing, my dude. What's that? Oh, your glasses. I can't see without my glasses. That'll be his defense in court. I didn't know I was killing the man. I didn't have my glasses on. <laughs> I watch all those true crime stuff. I'm sure someone said that before. I always have really dumb excuses. I don't like that we're staying here. He's left and we're... <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so, Slendy can teleport bodies. Maybe only if it's in the tunnel or anywhere. Oh. <laughs> I've never seen the person that approached Alex in the tunnel before now. Dude, you're not even like commenting on the facts that Alex just murdered them. I'm not sure Alex knew who it was. Um, Len says, moments like these makes me wonder why Jay didn't just call the police. Like, bro, just witnessed a murder and thought I could solve this. Like, for real. He's, like, is he not calling the police about this, too? He hasn't called the police about a missing person, Amy, who he knows Alex is lying about is with him, who's not with him. Uh, Jay is not a great, like, he's not a hero. He's, like, trying to be a hero, but in all the worst ways, not in ways that work. Goodness. Frustrating. And he even has tape of the murder. Like, just take that to the police. Oh, 
Look, it helps both of us. Dude, you know he's a murderer. And he's... If, I absolutely not. I'd be like, video call me. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. Extraction. Extraction. That's what firefighters do. Hello? Limping man. Limping man in face. I don't know why I can see it better on this screen than that screen. Oh. How? How much? $20. How much do you hate? It is not enough. <laughs> hey guys, however much you currently hate in your life, it's not enough. I expect more. Entry number 50. We're getting close. Masky. <laughs> Is that Tim? Is it still Tim? Itty bitty little pocket knife. My dude, that is not going to help you. You are doing nothing to help yourself or others. And that makes me mad. Peter's mad too. Peter says, ow! Ow, I hit my finger on the thing. Jessica, it's me. Uh, I am at Rosswood Park right now, waiting on Alex. Because, Peter's, uh, no. He's got stuff to show me in here, so I figured I'd give you a call, give you a quick update on what's going on. Uh, if you need anything, just, just call me, I guess. I'll talk to you later. I'm going to give you a quick update. My friend's a murderer. His girlfriend is missing. But, um, and that's all. And I'm making sure that nobody else knows about it. Or can do anything about it. <laughs> Dude was sitting there like he was like on the cover of the next Backstreet Boys album. You ready? I wouldn't get I that so. close to him. Why are you so comfortable with him? You, he's going to take you into the woods. You're going to allow this? What's that satchel thing in your passenger seat? <laughs> Yo, what's your Camera satchel? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. That's such a suspicious answer. It's a camera case. Don't worry about it. Like, just say it's a camera case. That's less suspicious than saying don't worry about it. His walk. I'm sorry. He like either walks like a robot or he's like, like he's got like a strut. I like it. How far in are we going? Pretty far. So if you're ready to walk. He didn't know it then. Well, I thought he knew it then. I don't really have much of a choice now, do I? Because he seemed to be like actively doing like we're watching in real time as he's discovering it. Hmm. So what is it you're going to show me? Hey, I'm only going to ask you this once. What? Did you take anything from my apartment other than the tape? What do you mean? Oh, he's going to kill you. Did you successfully steal something from me? No, I didn't. I didn't have enough time to look. Because it just so happens that I'm missing my spare front door key. It's not something I want to lose. No, I guess you wouldn't. If you know where it is, just give it back to me. Why? I don't know where it is. I thought you guys were done Can with each other. Why are we going on a date in the woods? It sounds like something's following us. Listen. How are things with Jessica? What? How are things with Jessica? Uh, they're fine. No, they're not. Is there anything I should know about? Yeah, Amy's missing. No, nothing comes to mind. Listen. Keep hearing footsteps. <sighs> okay, so 
like these tapes are old. So Len says like these tapes are old. So some parts are old, but these tapes now we've been like on an active journey with Jay. We're like at the end of the tape, Jay will be like, tomorrow I'm going to go back to this place. So it's like he uploaded it as he's going through them. So the way he's phrasing things now is it seems present, like the way when he puts in like the text and stuff. So I'm under the conclusion that when he's uploading these, he's watching them as he goes. And that's why he's like, yeah. Anyway. Um, At least they both know about the forest walking date this time. I know. At least they're both aware of it. Uh, It's very confusing to me. (laughs) But... (laughs) But if, if it's the case he hasn't yet seen at this point of filming the murder tape, that makes more sense. But it's, again, the way he seems to phrase things like we're in present time and he's doing this, this is very silly. Also, set alone the fact that he knows in the tapes in this present time that uh, Amy is, no one knows where Amy is and Alex lying about it. That alone is suspicious and I would not go into the woods with him. I don't care how close I am to these people. You already said you're done with them. You have a lot of problems. I wouldn't. It's, there's, so, ah, there's so many things. The rest of the tape is Alex and I walking through the woods without saying anything. That's nice. A little mindfulness walk together. This has to be the tape that came before the unlabeled one in entry 38. Oh, Len, I get what you're saying. Is this part of, this is part of the six or seven months that he forgot that now he's re-finding? That might be the case. That would make more sense. But still, even when he was not forgetful in the time, in the time he knew something was wrong with Amy or that something was weird there and did nothing about that and then forgot all of it. So, yeah. Okay, that makes more sense. But I'm still mad at him. (laughs) So is this while we're out here to uh, look at trees and tell spooky ghost stories? Come here. What? Just come here. No. Wait, hold on a second. Uh, there's only about a minute left on this tape. Oh, no, something's yeah. going to happen here. Change I can it feel quick. it. Or we, I think we saw this in 38 or something. Look, Alex, it's getting really dark in here. Oh, probably... gosh, I can't. <laughs> Sorry, I just got so stressed out <laughs> by the change of, like, just <laughs> leave and come back some other time when we have more daylight. Yeah. It's blurry. All right. Next time, bring Jessica. I want her to see it too. Yeah, sure. Is this the way out? Yeah. There's no way out. Come on. I'm gonna stay here a little bit. All right, whatever. I'm leaving. I don't like it. Chrissy, wake up. I don't like this. Chrissy, wake up. (laughs) Hello. (laughs) Oh, baby boy. Crunch a munch. Crunch a munch. Roo! Welcome, welcome. Roo, 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 roo. Tim? What about Tim? Tim was the guy who was wearing the mask in one of the videos. They took off his mask and it was Tim, the, the sideburns guy. Chrissy, wake up. That face. <gasps> hey, hey, hey! Oh, it said Tim? 
Maybe that's Tim, because Tim is the masky. I actually wasn't paying attention to the subtitles there. Ooh. Because at one point they took off the mask and it was Tim. Who has sideburns. <laughs> Oh, every time it does that, it is there. These guys run a lot. Oh, motion sick. What? Timmy. Hey. Tim, Timmy, 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 Timothy. Stop. No, not into the tunnel. No. No. It's a great shot of grass. <laughs> Crazy, wait, no. I don't like Stop! Crazy. Okay, hello. Gotta wake up, gotta wake up, gotta wake up. Come on, Chrissy. Stop running! He was like, oh, I sound cool in here. I'm gonna yell. <laughs> yes, here you go. What do you want? It's the eye of the tiger. Okay. Trying to see if I see anything in the backgrounds. The tape ends there with about 12 minutes left on it. It looks like Tim, Tim, yeah, led me to the tunnel that I had seen Alex in, but I didn't seem to notice any trace of what happened there. Yeah, because you saw your uh, operator make it disappear. Like a magic man. Also, why did Alex want to stay in the woods by himself when it was getting dark? Well, at this point, you know that it's weird. You writing this, having washed all it back. Since he wasn't wearing his camera, I have no footage that shows what he did after I left. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, uh, Len, I love that Jay always sets up such cinematic sh shots just to sit and do nothing. Right? Uh, it's like he's constantly, like, trying to pose. Like, he's like, this is my album. Welcome to the drum. The next tip begins with this. I'm assuming it's the following day. Sorry, I have Chrissy wake up now stuck in my head. It's just like playing over and over again. Disconnect again? Horrifying by yourself. Rue, yes. Yeah, I know a lot of people have worked now. I'll probably go back to doing night streams, not like late afternoon streams. So if that kind of thing works for you, then great. Because um, I have to go back to work next week too. I'm glad you got to be here though. Thank you. Okay. So Jay is back in Alex's house again. Is that what we're seeing? His house is a mess. Is he moving? I don't like this. 
Home invasion for Jay. I mean, everyone kind of seems to break in. You got the mask people watching people sleep. You got everything going on. You want to say hi? <laughs> Hello. Nikki has oh, formed no. from the chat to our very present. Uh, Jay has broken into Alex's house again. That's what's going on currently. Yeah, so I don't hear myself over and over again. Ooh, cave sounds in Minecraft are horrifying, Kieran. What is he looking for? Oh, is he looking to get the footage again off of his little chest camera? Yeah, a little tape. That's such a weird little table. It's like a rotation table of lore. Is that that bookshelf in front of a door? Or a closet? I'm scared. <laughs> I fear. Please tell me you drove home first or something before, like you're not just sitting in your car in front of his house. Ooh, expo. That's not going to stay, though. It, like, comes off so easily. Thank you, Hairbrine. Happy New Year 2023 to you, too. Wait, I, didn't, I was looking at Hairbrine. What do you say? 56 to 42. 56 dash 42. Very interesting. Hey! Unlimited rice pudding is here. How are you? <laughs> what? Nikki wants uh, pudding. Rice pudding? No. No, she doesn't want it. But it's okay. We love you. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Chocolate pudding. 56 42. Now that I know what the tape is labeled, I'll be able to find the one I got from Alex's apartment here. Wait, my brain didn't work on that sentence. Now that I know what the tape is labeled, I'll be able to find the one I got from Alex's apartment here. Now that I know, I don't understand that sentence. <laughs> I don't understand it. Hi, hey. I don't know if it will be anything significant, but I'm going to find it and watch it as soon as I can. I mean, you show us a lot of walking and silence, so I don't know what you consider to be significant. Entry 51. We're getting close. We're so close. After spending a few days changing my current location, I found the tape labeled 56-42. Yeah, that's the one you were holding. It contains footage from back when Alex was shooting Marble Hornets. Oh, we're going back again. Another time jumpy. He's just really, yeah. This this whole series, it's actually a hiking series. It's uh, like urban explorers. Yeah, I'm just getting some B-roll. Getting some B-roll of some weird Where's symbols. Uh, we came out here yesterday and it wasn't feeling too good. So he just stayed home today. All right. How is that B-roll? Uh, what I'm going to do for this is I'm just going to set up right here. Just a static shot. So you shot. can't see my shadow. Uh, and we'll have you walk along the frame. Okay, that's beautiful. Starting where you are. All right, are we ready? Yeah, just walk along. If you want to walk on the rail, that's fine. Just reflective. And uh, just keep on going. I'll tell you when you're out of the frame again. Oh, okay. Brian. Such an unnatural walk. Yeah, I'm just going to put music over it. 
na, 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 na. I'll be the music. Ba, na, 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 na. Just walking, walking down this road on my own journey. All right, that's good. Come on back. <laughs> I, uh, Herobrine, I used to like creepy pastas. I haven't really. There was like a phase, I think, for everyone, but I haven't looked at it in a long time. Anything like it. <laughs> that was a weird laugh. <laughs> So I'm shaky. just gonna stare off in the distance like I don't care. <laughs> the camera's so shaky. So what is this place? Uh, then I again, I should. Okay, so being a film person myself and having directed a couple uh, actual professional short films, I first started in high school making stuff with my friends after school. Very much this vibe of just like asking people to do random things. And uh, I should show you, I should do reactions to it because the footage is crap. So we should like watch it together and be like, look at this thing I made that I thought was amazing. And then maybe show you the difference in the stuff I've made now. Although I know some of you guys have already seen it like counter clock and stuff because it's on my Rebecca Donovan Films channel. It was like an old doctor's office or something. Uh, when Seth and I were out here yesterday, Ooh, we this found is so it much like an cool. So, so much like a urban explorers um, YouTube channel right now. Figured we could come here and get some shots. It's uh, kind of creepy. Yeah, it's got the whole burned out building feel to it. Probably because it's uh, a burned out building. We're gonna be shooting in this part. I uh, figured I'd just get some B-roll. We can just say that it's like Brian's old elementary school or something like that that burned down. So okay. Another little reflective spot. I wonder what Marble Hornets um, was sure about, like, like their the film. Internet. Yeah, I mean, like, it's a burned out building. Who cares? Burned <clears> out building, he keeps saying. Done, dude. We'll make it quick. Dude, you're like, that sounds right, dangerous. Right. You're crunching on some glass. Nikki right now. Am I supposed to be silent? That's what the guy said. I'm nervous. This like far away when there's like an open hallway that someone's walking into from far away. I just see like Slender Man like football smacking him across or something. That'd be actually really cool. Okay. All right, we good. <laughs> Me at the Met just standing in front of Art. Mean? part supposed to mean it means i'm staring at a wall so hair brian uh marble hornets is a found footage series the goal is to make it look it's also what is referred to as what is it um uh, nonfiction fiction, <laughs> where the goal is to make it seem real, but it's not. Uh, so this was actually one of the first series to do anything with what we know as Slender Man, as you know, with creepypastas. Um, before this, there was really nothing out, and then everyone took it. In this, he's not called Slender Man. He's called The Operator. Hope that helps. Ooh, he's nearby. When there's glitches, it means The Operator is nearby. All right. It's a cheap tripod. Uh, what I want you to do is just come up and lean against this door. All right. Like, like that. Sorry, yep. this just and, so uh, reminds just me of what I do to my friends. Head up against it <laughs> and uh, keep your head down. I'm going to do a few shots of this. Uh, zoom down. In the <laughs> yeah, keep the hands in the pocket. All right, just... <coughs> All right I'm rolling. <coughs> Ooh, he's coughing. The operator loves to choke people. We know this because the one time when the guy passed out and he was like coughing and like choking and stuff, and then Alex murdered that random hiker and he was choking him. The operator's got a got a thing for choking. <laughs> All right, I'm. Are you sure we should be here? It's fine, Brian. Hey, like, Brian, like, you're doing a great job, though. Uh, bueno. <laughs> walking and just getting, like, arrested or something. 
Well, the sooner we get this done, the sooner we can leave. Okay. So, bear with me. Oh, interesting, Karen. Ooh. Ooh, was there anything? Hang on, I just want to go back. Was there anything in there? I just want to see if there was anything notable. Nope, just a little glitch. <laughs> oh, Karen. <laughs> Jared, we'll look at the chat. Oh. <laughs> well, I don't know what it's pertaining to. It, you don't have to. Oh, okay. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> What's oh happening? Gecko. Oh, it's raining again. Alex! Alex, where are you? <coughs> Alex! Excuse me, sorry. What happened, Brian? For real. Tim? <coughs> Tim? Alex? Seriously, come on! <laughs> eh. sounded like a goat. <laughs> <laughs> she said I sounded like a goat. Oof. What's happening? What am I looking at here? Oh. Goodbye. Farewell. So long. That's nice. Is that Alex? Alex, you're the anti-chosen one. Chosen by Slenderman. Did he kill Brian? As usual, the tape has no date on it, so I don't know when this took place during the production. Did Alex lead everyone to a place like this and leave them there like he did with Brian and possibly Tim? <laughs> Nikki. Nikki. Ah. It's a little loud. It's like, gong, 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 gong. That's all oh, I can hear. So yeah, sorry. no, you're good. You're good. Oh, I remember this bit. Right. If that's the case, was Alex lying in the footage at the end of Entry 22, or does he really not remember? Bye, Herr Brian. Brian Have a nice day. Brian's gone. Down with Jay and Sarah. Everyone is gone. All right, here we are, guys. It's the last one. It's now. Yeah, that's interesting. Hmm. I'm here at Rossmith Park again. Waiting on Alex again. Why, my friend? Why? Last night, I, uh, I watched the tape that I took from his apartment. And it is abundantly clear that I should not be trusting him at all right now. I don't know what exactly happened to Brian. 
probably don't want to know exactly what happened to Brian. No, you probably do want to know. know. At least what I think I know is that Alex knew something was going to happen when he brought him there. And file a missing person case for Amy, somebody. For all I know, he wanted Brian out of the way. Um, Jessica's on her way to meet Alex and I here. She knew whatever it is Alex has to show us has something to do with Amy, so... Ugh. I guess she thinks falling a stranger into the woods is a good idea. She's gonna idea. die. Which yeah, you think it's... not really one to judge, because falling her. Alex into the woods is a terrible idea, period. Yeah, uh, he's so annoying. Yeah, I'm <laughs> so annoyed. It might be nothing. He might actually show us something. Oh my gosh. But if he does try anything... I'm going to make sure that Jessica gets out. Whatever it is that I have to do to make sure of that, I don't care. You can't make sure of that, my friend. So I guess that's, uh, He's so, like, I'm the hero of the story. Confession or whatever. And he doesn't, hasn't what done happened. anything helpful. What does happen to me. And then he films himself artistically, like, yes, I am the hero. I'm on my journey. She's gonna die because of you, and I bet Amy's dead too. Also, I love that he drives a convertible. Follow me. <laughs> like, who gets out of a convertible that angsty? You just can't. How far in is it? <laughs> Remember when everyone wore those long jeans? How much further Bunched is it? at the bottom. Right up here. Not much longer. Alex, why don't you just tell us where we're going? You're not doing a very good job of putting either of us at ease. Look, it's a little difficult to put into words. You're just gonna have to see it for yourself. Go. Hold on. Why don't you just I film it and show it to us him. later? I think I hear footsteps or something behind us. Yeah. Uh, I think someone's following us. Right, let's keep walking. Poor Jessica. She knows so little. Ooh, that looks like a new bridge. Fresh. Is that a wood chipper? You can't save her from the magic man. It's over there. What is it we're looking for? You wanted your answers, it's over there. I don't wanna see it again. I don't wanna see it again. What is it? Those look like breadsticks. Alex, just tell us what it I is. You stole that tape from me. It's like I'm holding Brian on it, and I know you've been following me too. What? I've had plenty of chances to do this. Yes, you're going to kill I'm the one get Jessica involved. That's why just, I told her I found Amy. That's your fault. Alex, please. Don't do this, Alex. I told you never to mention him again. Masky, Tim. I know that Tim. Not sharing with the world. I didn't know. I, I never showed this one. Tim Stealth. I should burn him alive. Fighting. Oh, someone shot. Where are you going? What do we do now? Uh, go back to your place. Pack something, pack lightly, and meet me at the hotel over on about an hour. Uh, we need to go somewhere where he's not going to think to look for us. We'll Jacked human. We can go to the police because we literally have video of Alex bashing a hiker over the head with a rock and killing him. You don't have to show all the supernatural, but you could just show that bit. And you could also be like, hey, my friend Amy is also missing. Like, you don't have to be like, oh, I think there's something supernatural. At least, you know, I don't know if it would help, but it might do something. Figure out what to do from there, I guess. Okay. Better than what he's currently been doing. That's what I think.
That was a lot. Dude, maybe don't hang around the car of the guy who just tried to shoot you in the face. He, like, struggled before there was even anything to struggle. He was like, eh. <laughs> Alex! Alex and everyone else who might be um, chiming in. Uh, I will be making an edited version of the stream, of course. Of course, you're always welcome to watch the full archived version, but I'll make a shortened version, too, without all the, you know. <laughs> yeah. Theft, theft, theft. <laughs> That's our song. Theft, 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 theft. <laughs> Jay loves to steal. <laughs> Gum? Oh, no. Charger. Something? No. Hard drive. You got everything you need? Yeah. And you could also uh, take this ta tape tape to the police and be like, hey, my friend like tried to put a like tried to shoot us with a with a with a gun. <laughs> Alex. Alex. Hey, Alex. Thank you so much. As always. I don't know how many times I have to say that in my life. Alex. <laughs> <laughs> Nikki, <laughs> Alex. Magnino Alex two donated five dollars through super chat. Have a wonderful day. Thank you. And look, it actually showed up on the thing. Sorry, Tyler. Hey, Tyler. Uh, first time I sleep in. The stream happens. <laughs> oh, Tyler. Sorry. Yeah, I'm gonna be uh, next week. I'm gonna be going back to like some later night streams. YouTube is doing this thing now where when um, people are live streaming, you can gift memberships and just for fun there's been a lot of people who've subscribed even today so there's one of them Frey you get a, a thing I think we should just stay in our hotel rooms for the rest of the day and then we'll figure out where we're going tomorrow okay. um, before you check in these right here these are all the tapes that I've been shooting on my camera mm -hmm. all of my interactions with Alex and everything are on all of these tapes uh, this one right here is really important is the one I took out of Alex's apartment that he didn't want me to see. Um, and one more thing, there's this hard drive that I just took from him. Um, I don't know what's on it, but I'm also pretty sure it's important. Right, so Lynn. I'm going to take all the stuff, just in case anything happens, I'm going to put it in the uh, safe that's in my room. So I need a four-digit combination that both of us can remember, just in case you need to get in it for any reason. Just use one, two, three, four. <laughs> no, that's, that's too easy. That's the first thing I try. Well, how about the last four digits of my phone number? That's 1022. Number. What is it? It's uh, 1102. Oh. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> uh, yeah, I can remember that. <laughs> All right, I'm going to go check in. My head's killing me. <laughs> All right. Oh, her head's killing her, and she coughed. She's doomed. She's doomed. nervous because we're coming to the end of season two here happy early birthday Alex <laughs> cinematic shots for no reason right so really to the arc is our hero <laughs> maybe our only hero in this story and Tim Masked man, Tim. Oh, thanks, Alex. I do too, Angelica.
Well, I gotta put on the chess cam. The cham. The cast. No, oh, gosh, the way he whipped that around. <laughs> I did not get this. <laughs> that one's yours. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, that was a good scream. Oh, that's solid. Ooh. Jessica! Jessica, open the door! <gasps> He's in the room. Whoa! Oh, he just gave him a big a big bear hug. <laughs> What's he gonna do? He just like ran into his arms. Like, yes. <laughs> is he dead? Or is this where it, when he forgot his memories? The final tape ends there. Entry number 27 must have been the next morning. Interesting. At some point, I had gotten back in the bed and put the camera back on the tripod. Interesting. So then he forgets. He he ran into Slender Man's open arms and then forgot everything. The chess camera also stopped recording around the same time and didn't start again until shortly before I woke up the next day. Ooh, that's pretty. In the months that I've been watching the tapes from the safe, I've seen how dangerous Alex really is. Yeah. Uh, yeah. He tried to vibe check the Slender Man. <laughs> oh, Kieran, you win all the laughs today. Looking back on it, he never intended to help me. He probably just wanted the opportunity to tie up another loose end like he did with the others. Yeah. I'm not going to sit around and let him get away with this anymore. Thank you. If he's still alive, I'm going to find... No. <laughs> I'm going to find him. No. Show all the realistic stuff to the police. I thought the tapes might show where he's gone, but they never show him leaving the town near Roswood Park. Okay, perfect. So he's not leaving. Go show the police him pointing a gun at you, him killing another person. Since there's no other choice, I've come back to look for either him or a clue as to where he may be now. Because at least then, he can't work for Slender Man if he's locked up in the loony bin, you know? Or what happened to Jessica. Or Amy. Does anyone care about Amy? <laughs> Where's Amy? <laughs> Nobody cares anymore. Yesterday, my first day back, I saw this in the downtown area. <laughs> Len says, sees Alex murder a man. Quote, he might be kind of dangerous. I don't know, though. <laughs> also must remember, this is months in the past, so even if he shows the cops, Alex is most likely hiding true. Plus, as he seems to be helping Slendy, Slendy can erase cops' minds and just teleport him. Can, can he erase the minds? But, like, if they erase the minds, he'll just show them the tapes again and again, like himself. I don't know. I don't know. Alex kind of sus. <laughs> Not gonna lie. The camera work, my dad. He's like, up, down, left, right. <laughs> like, it's, like, he's playing DDR with his camera motions. I did. Uh, who's that? Wait, who was that? Was that Tim? It was Tim. <laughs> and he seemed to be acting normal. <laughs> the timing of that. 
stalking, 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 theft, theft, theft. I kept my distance and ended up losing him shortly. I've just, that is true. He's done, okay. He's done a lot of illegal things like stalking and theft. So maybe he doesn't want to go to the police because of his own stuff. But why is no one talking about Amy? <laughs> I'm going to keep a low profile while I try to figure out what he's doing here. Stalking, 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 and theft. I'll upload more entries once something happens, but I don't know how long that will take. Probably years, my dude. I don't know why my dude is the night of my dude. Regardless, I'm going to see this through the end. Entry 53. Sip my tea. After seeing Tim in the downtown area a few months ago, I began to try and figure out why he was here and where I could find him again. Okay. This place is pretty far away from where we all lived when Alex was shooting Marble Hornets, so it's really strange coincidence that I've bo found both Alex and Tim here. Maybe you have more missing memories than you know. Oh, that's a gorgeous house. I want to live there. The building that I saw Tim come out of was an antique store. It's a store, but you know that was a house like one day, I bet, like, and became a store. It's so beautiful. Sounds good, Joey. But it was in the process of going out of business, so it was usually closed. I love listening to people while I just do work as well. Um, I had to wait a few weeks for the store to open before I could talk to anyone that worked there. I was just wondering if you have seen a guy come in here. He's probably about my age. He's got dark hair, side. Delaney says, fun fact, this lady he's going to talk to was just a random lady. I believe it. Like, I believe they shot most of this, like, kind of off the cuff, like, just as they were going. Fun fact, in high school, I shot a lot of random projects like that. I should do a reaction video to all my old stuff I made because it is very Marvel Hornets-esque, like, student film-esque kind of thing. Honestly, though, doing all that stuff, I made a lot of music videos on other people's songs kind of helped me learn all the editing and do all the stuff that I do now, like on my main channel when I create my own stuff. So, you know, have you seen anyone in here recently like that? Yeah, I see a guy that comes in here like that. He's sometimes he comes in when he's uh, looking for his, I guess he has a doctor's appointment. Okay. Um, do you know where he might be going? Um, well, I don't know. There's a doctor's office down the street, so he may be going Right down the street? Mm -hmm. Okay. I love that it gives such a small town vibe that she's like, well, you said he had a doctor's appointment and the doctor's on down the street. So, right, um, thank you. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Gonna go on down. The only doctor's office down the street from there turned out to be a mental health clinic. That's different from a doctor's office. I feel like I should keep this accent the whole time, although now it's starting to morph. What is going on? I love every time he films himself, it just looks like the cover of a 90s like album or something. He's like starting his angsty album covers. There's no way anyone inside would tell me if Tim had been there. Yeah, HIPAA. They're, they're not, they would not. That's actually good that they didn't. So all I could think to do was to wait outside to see if he might show up. That seems highly inappropriate like waiting outside a mental health clinic to see if someone you know shows up there i gotta say there's a lot of things that jay does and has done that i don't agree with like nobody still cares about where amy is it wasn't it amy who went missing who alex was with and no one's filed a police report nobody seems to care where she is also where's jessica i've been coming back every day for the past week he didn't care when he saw the... Has he done it? Okay. Now we're supposed to be post those six months, right? Alex had murdered someone on one of those tapes. And Jay saw the murder. Did he contact the police about that ever? He's about to do his ending track. He's writing the songs in his head. Hey, hey, Tim. 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 Hey, uh... You're, uh, Tim, right? You don't even know yeah. his last name. This isn't appropriate. Uh, it's, uh, it's Jay. Jay. Do you remember me at all? Wait, you what know? Okay, okay, well, uh, remember, uh, uh, I helped you, or, like, you helped, 
you and I both, like, we helped Alex Crayley with the student film Marble Hornets, like, a few years ago. You remember yeah, that? Yeah, kind of. That was kind of a long time ago, wasn't it? What are you doing around here? Uh, well, you know, I'm, I'm glad I ran into you because, remember, uh, I told you a while back that I wanted to finish it for him because, you know, I didn't want to work to go to waste. If you're, uh, you know, okay. if, you're, yeah, if, if um, you're still interested in it, we should, yeah, like... Yeah, sure. Um, can we talk about it some other time? Because I'm really late for my doctor's Oh, visit. yeah. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll talk to you some other time. Interesting, Delaney. Yeah, I'm not a J stan. <laughs> That was so awkward. I didn't want to lose track of Tim again, so I just waited outside for him to come back. You are gonna get a restraining order on you, my dude. Hey, this Tim. is so awkward. Dude, oh, you're- Oh, hey. Yeah. Some guy you barely know, barely remember, is hanging outside the clinic that you go to, starts filming you, starts talking to you, then has this really awkward conversation and leaves. Then when you are leaving the clinic, he's still there with the camera, filming you once again, this is so, that is such concerning behavior. Yeah, sorry, I didn't know you were gonna be waiting outside, otherwise I would've tried to like, pick up the pace in there a little bit. Oh no, I mean, I wasn't, wasn't like, uh, wasn't sitting outside waiting on you or anything, I was in the area anyway, Peter, so. Dear. I just figured I'd stop by here real quick and see if I could catch you on your way out. Okay, fair enough, I guess. Yeah, uh, uh, I didn't like ask you this before, but is, every, is everything okay with you? Like, you doing okay? Uh, that is yeah, so awkward. You know, just work, school, the usual. None of your like, business. I mean, I just saw you going into the that clinic, so... <laughs> yeah, none of your business. Is everything okay with you? Yeah, you're, I mean, you know, I'm okay? having some personal issues yeah, a few months ago, but, you me, know... Leave me alone. Everything seems to be going pretty good now. Okay, so you're doing fine? Yeah, yeah. Cool. Uh, well, you know, uh, about helping finish Alex's project, you know, if you want to... Sorry, still interested. Uh, oh, okay. Hello? So yeah, I'm sure, guessing this right is over. where they had lost okay, their memory, bye. but he hasn't watched the tape Sorry, yet. Sorry, I was work. I gotta go. But uh, you got my number, right? Uh, no, actually. Can you give it to me real yeah, quick? Yeah, yeah, sure. Or I'll just, just give me yours and I'll like, put hey, it in here. Hey, look at these tapes. Okay. Did you lose uh, your memory because you saved them from these tapes? Too or is this when he still hasn't watched the tapes yet? So. Got it? Uh. Yeah, I got it. Okay, cool. Well, uh. I guess I'll just give you a call whenever I get off work or something. Okay, yeah, I'll, so uh, I'll talk to you then. Guy yeah. stalks you, asks you about your mental health, is filming you, you give him his number, and you're like, yeah, I'll call you. <laughs> like, dude, do you have no boundaries? <laughs> we need to have a conversation on boundaries. <laughs> There's a fly on my webcam. Sorry, I got distracted by the fly in my webcam. He didn't seem to remember anything else about me, so I decided to keep acting like I needed his help to finish. Why, though? Why not be like, hey, did you have some memory loss? I have memory loss. I have some tapes. Jay, the way you go about things irritates me. <laughs> Jay is that creepy ex-boyfriend. Oof. He sounds like, honestly, the way he behaves would be like, like one of the worst like <laughs> exes to have. Since it's what I did when I met with him back in Entry 15, I figured I'd stick with that story. But you have proof to show him things. Why? Why do you do the things you do? Why are you the way that you are? <laughs> After Tim left, I stayed in the downtown area for a while longer to look around. To look around for what? Just feeling a little bit lonely, Jay. Where are we? What is it? Ooh, that's pretty. It's kind of cool. You don't see a lot of wood structures like that, at least not here. <laughs> Alex. Alex says he beat me with a 50. He came back to check in. Alex, it is not a competition. By the way, go back to the beginning of this archive. I thanked you a lot, as always. And um, that's hilarious. <laughs> Hello. Uh, hey, Jay. It's uh, Tim. Hey, what's up? Uh, you know, same old stuff, I guess. Listen, um, I just remembered this, but I, I remember Alex had me shoot, like, some 
you know, behind the scenes footage type stuff while we were making that movie, and um, I think I was supposed to give them back, but I don't think I ever did. So okay. I might still have them lying around somewhere. So if you want me to try and like find those, I'm more than Magnino Alex two donated two dollars through super chat. <laughs> Tim is the best actor of the show. Thank you, Alex. Thank you very much for your more two dollars. You don't have to keep adding money throughout to try to, um, you know, whatever. Stop, stop, Alex, stop it. But thank you, thank you very much. Um, and huh, okay, we'll have to see here because so far Tim's given me nothing, unless you mean that sarcastically. <laughs> Fine, though, I'd be more than happy to just give them to you or whatever. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you can, uh, if you can find them. I'll take them. I'm sure I can use them for uh, for some. Oh, I could see that, Alex. Honestly, yeah. Honestly, so far, that lady in the shop has been the best actor of the entire series so far. And But she only had a small part. They should have given her more of a part. But she did a great job. I liked her little, well, there's a doctor's office down the street. Um, he has his moments that are better than simply by comparison. True. True. Okay. I get that. I get that. And I'll get it. I'll get it. I'm scared to get it, Delaney. Something. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, like I said, I'm not entirely sure where they are right now, but um, if you'll give me a little bit to try and find them, then I'll let you know. Okay, yeah, just just let me know. Alright, cool. Um, I guess I'll uh, talk to you later. Uh, yeah, okay, yeah. Bye. More tapes. I thought I was finished with Marble Hornets tapes, but I guess Tim has a few more. It's probably why this season is so long. I don't know if they'll be of any use, but I'll take whatever might lead me to some answers. Oh, we're back to To the Ark, I think. Reminder. This is pretty. This feels like abstract art. Do you remember me? Don't you remember? Who's that? He's looking in the store. Oh, that's Jay looking in the store. Someone's filming him. The To the Ark people. Can't remember. Did we figure out who To the Ark was? I have not forgotten. I have not forgotten. All right, entry 54. We're going to start seeing the tapes. The old, old, old tapes. Old BTS tapes. Tim recently, oh, okay, sorry. <laughs> Tim recently called me saying that he had f found his old tapes. Okay, <laughs> sorry. He told me he come to meet him downtown during his break from work to get them. Hey. Hey, Jay. Here's, uh, here's those tapes I was telling you about. Okay. So what's the deal with all this stuff? What stuff? You know, the whole pointing your camera at everybody's face. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm real. just, you know, trying to, trying to dock Oh, look, I finally got the chat to work on screen. Yeah. Oh. This whole process of getting all of Alex's stuff back together and finishing this movie for him, you know? Okay. Uh, are you making some kind of behind-the-scenes feature or something? Something like that, behind yeah. Behind-the-scenes, okay. behind-the-scenes. Uh, what's, um, what are on those tapes? Oh, I don't know. Okay, if I was like, oh, you're making some behind-the-scenes feature, I'd be like, hey, can you um not include the clip of me walking into the mental health clinic? Because, like, that's really personal, so, yeah. I wasn't able to watch them, um, you know, I'm, I'm not the movie guy, so I don't have a camera that'll play those kind of tapes. Well, what'd you, what'd you shoot him on? Oh, uh, Alex lent me one of his cameras mm. to, you know, keep me out of his hair, I guess, so okay. I wouldn't bother him. I gave the camera back, but not the tapes for some reason, but I guess okay. they're yours now. All right, so, uh, yeah, well, uh, with them. thanks, uh, thanks again for, for helping me finish this. Well, I mean, I'll help however much I can, but I mean, if you couldn't already tell, my work schedule's kind of packed, but, I mean... If you really think this movie's worth finishing, then yeah, I guess just give me a call or something. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I, I think it's worth finishing, so I'll, right. I'll, I'll watch these. I'll, I'll call you. Yeah. All right. 
<laughs> he was like, don't care. Bye. <laughs> I like that brick walkway. I don't know why. I've already begun to watch the new tapes. So far, can, they consist mainly of behind-the-scenes style footage from when Marble Hornets was being shot. Yeah, isn't that the point? Like, it's behind-the-scenes footage of Marble Hornets, so isn't that, like, what it would be? Sometimes it's helpful to Jay, sometimes antagonistic. Only knows her shoes. Okay. Unsurprisingly, they're all unnumbered and without dates. Interesting. The following footage is taken from the first one I watched. Whoa. Yeah, I got it. And Alex, I'm reading all your things, but I'm just not commenting on well, was, all of them. Uh, I'm saying that's exciting, just so you don't I think guess, I'm ignoring you. That was fun. Oh, yeah. Pouring rain. Awesome. Mm -hmm. but thank Have you seen Alex? Go. Oh, um, he said he was going to run home and change shirts because no obviously spoilers. he's kind of soaking right now, but he said he was going to be back in a little bit. So. Uh, aren't you taking this car? Yeah, unless you want to wait for him, you should probably go. <laughs> all right. See you. See ya. Well, we don't really have a reason to be here anymore either, since we're, I guess we're done. All right. So, yeah, I think we're just uh, going to be like wrapping it up back yeah. here, so. I will. All right, see, see ya. ya. We're here in scenic Tim's apartment uh, in his music room, complete with box of thing. Box of thing. Keyboard. Making musical masterpiece things with our... Hands. Ukulele with Tim attachment. I just learned this song like two minutes ago. Another keyboard. Complete with beats. Complete with beats. I define song pretty loosely right now because this is this is. Oh my precious. god. Why am I holding the camera? Because you're the movie guy. Because you're the movie you guy. The behind the movie guy. A little bit more on topic. Uh, oh, there's Brian. What's up, dude? That's a nice towel you got there. Oh, there's Brian. That's, nice That's a nice hair you have. Oh, hi, Mark. My hair always looks good. Mm. That's why I'm the star. <laughs> um, but Seth and I have been going over the footage, and I think we have enough now to where we can start putting together our trailer. Trailer. And I've been thinking about music. I think I want to go more along the acoustic lines. So, do you want to help record some stuff, maybe with the ukulele? Or I could so. probably do that. I mean, I got this ukulele like a week ago, so I can't exactly promise that I'd be very good at it, but I can always try. Well, you have a, what I assume is some sort of guitar thing. You so can, is it going to be like, is it going to be like dark? Is it going to be like dark? Okay, well, I also ah. like to be able to see, so I'm going to go try and find the breaker box. I love how smoothly they're just like, it's gonna be like dark. <laughs> nope. Oh no. Please no. Please no. Please no. Oh. Well, never mind. <gasps> oh my gosh, I saw him. <laughs> never mind. <again. laughs> I hope it's over here. Oh gosh. Great. Power's just off. Mm. <laughs> Defense. No, 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 no. I don't like it. No. 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 Good news, guys. We have flashlight. Oh, Even lying. better news. Guess what's battery powered? Delaney. Oh. <laughs> this day just got so much better. Well, hey, about that acoustic soundtrack. I guess that's the only choice we have now, so, um... Jam session. Yeah.
I'm gonna get a good lighting on Alex here. It looks so dramatic. Ooh! Oh, that scared me. Oh, that scared me. Oh, that scared me. Hang on, I wanna go back. Frame by frame. Frame by frame. That. Someone like wa ran in. Look at that. Bleh. Oh, okay. I liked that a little bit. Guess what's battery powered? <laughs> All right, decay. Probably to the arc stuff. Lead me to death. Whoa. Lead me to the Ark. Oh, a bunch of numbers, which I'm sure someone already figured out. Always watching. <laughs> Yikes. Entry 55. The following footage is taken from another one of Tim's tapes. It looks like it takes place near the end of the day's shoot. So much footage of people just walking. So much. Hey, Alex, the footage. other day when you were talking about needing uh, abandoned locations for Brian's school, like in the movie, did you ever find anything? Not yet. Um, the only places around here that are abandoned looking aren't gonna let us shoot, so the pickings are kinda slum. Okay, well, the reason that I asked was because there's like this old burnout hospital looking kind of place back where I used to live. Um, that might pass as a school. Uh, if you wanna go check it out, we can, but it's kinda far away. Well, does it look like a hospital or do you really think that it could? Well, I think it could pass as a school. Okay, uh, well, I haven't found anything around here. How far away is kind of far away? Uh, pff, far enough that we probably need to split gas money. Fair enough. Um, well, like I said, since I haven't found anything, I'm willing to give it a shot. Can you do Friday? I'm free all day. I actually have a doctor's appointment Friday at like 2. Okay. But if you can do Saturday, that would be better. We uh, kind of have to make a weekend out of it anyway. I can do Saturday. Uh, Brian, since you're going to have to be there anyway, can you do Saturday too? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Well, uh, let's shoot for Saturday then, and uh, we'll give it a look. All right, sounds good to me. Uh, all you need to do is go stand by the, uh, that, that sign That's there, Brian, and right? And Have we seen Brian before? Because I feel like he's new. I'm just going to get a shot. All right, that'll be good. Yeah, where you're at is fine. Every time I see them do this, I just think of all the stuff I shot in high school with my little tripod and crappy camera. Point and shoot. Sorry. Hello? Anyway. Yep, Friday at 2. I'll be there. Uh, just headaches, paranoia, trouble sleeping. I haven't had a full night's sleep in weeks. It was Brian's house, but did we see well, Brian? Well, I've kind of had some history with this kind of thing before, but I'd rather not talk about that over the phone if that's okay. Hmm? All right, see you then. Interesting. Sorry. Hmm. Oh, OK. 
Okay. I just don't remember. To mention he had a history with his symptoms. They sound similar to what Alex seemed to be experiencing throughout shooting Marble Hornets. Hmm. It's possible that what he's, it's possible that it's what am, I, what am I saying? It's possible that what he's describing could be the early stages of what eventually led to this. Hmm. Oh, okay. There's only a few of Tim's tapes left. So I'm gonna finish going through them as soon as I can. Oh my gosh, my brain. <laughs> All right, entry 56. We are cruising. Cruising. I'm down to the last couple of Tim's tapes. The following footage is taken from next to the last one that I have. Hmm. I like that sound. I almost thought you'd given up on this place since it's Crunchy. been so long since I told you about it. Yeah, stuff came up. That happens. You actually going to be filming anything today? No, I'm not going to shoot anything without Brian here. Okay, when's uh, he supposed to get here? Oh. Well, he'll be here I remember tomorrow, them shooting and Seth will at be here later today. Like the hospital-ish place. All right, so we're just kind of doing preliminary location scouting. Yeah. Works for me. guess and say that this is it. Uh, yes, that would be a uh, correct guess. Um, it's cool. Let's see, if I remember correctly, I think it's three floors, a basement, might be able to get up on the roof, so we can just kind of go in and take a look around if you want to. Yeah, all right. He seems so, like... There's a lot of graffiti on the first floor, so I'm not sure I'm how much interested. of that you'd be able to use. Well, graffiti is fine. Stop filming his butt the whole As time, As you can please. see. I mean, as long as, you know, certain things, but like... Show me the place. I don't... Okay, there, finally. That's cool. That's such a cool place. Careful, my dude. Is there a building over there? Yeah, but it's just like an annex. Nothing special. This place is way better. No, let's go. I want to see it. <coughs> well, I'm kind of not sure if I feel like I'm up to going to another place. If you don't mind. I do mind, because there is no way this place could pass for a school. How do you know? It's so run Finally. down. I wouldn't even know what it is. And it's all well, you know, compared angle. to the rest of this place, this room doesn't really have a whole lot of graffiti in it. You could probably use it at some point. Don't you think? Yeah. I mean, unless you're okay with having like. Nancy Hart's Kevin on the wall or something. For being behind the scenes footage, you're really terrible. So are we going upstairs or downstairs? Let's go up. They always make me nauseous with the Okay, well, the stairs that go up are all the way over there, but we can do that. I mean, that looks great. You can use pretty much any of this, honestly. Maybe this room down here will be uh, more to your liking. So I'm not exactly sure what you're really looking for, but... This dude, maybe? Hope they both have know. their tetanus shots. Okay. Well, uh, 
There has to be some room in this place that you like somewhere. Yeah, there's so much good about, about this place. Because this place isn't exactly tiny. Oh, dude, stop I gotta take a leak. Hang on. Oh, gosh. Whoa. <laughs> Finally, stable camera. Oh, that scared me. I was like, why is he hitting him with a stick? It was such a weak stick, too. I couldn't tell if he was playing around or if he was gently trying to hurt him. Look at that. Such a weak little stick. Oh, it's a pipe. Oh, I thought it was like a stick. It looked like a little branch like stick. It was a pipe. Okay, that makes more sense. But huh? Huh? What? <clears throat> I'm so confused. Entry 57. Um, because this one seems longer, this might be the last one we'll do, but we'll see. Through a stroke of luck, it seems that the last one of Tim's tapes picks up after Alex attacked him. Okay. So what happened next? Are you still in the abandoned place? Like, hit you right on the head, knocked you out? Oh, more shaky ground camera. want to even like film there during the night dude you're breathe you're making me nervous my hands palm sweaty mom spaghetti and you're making me nauseous you're making me nervous you're nauseous you're making me nauseous and novice you're making me a novice Pretty high. Going on down on the stairs. Ooh. Oh, we running. In the dark of the night. <coughs> I'm looking at my other screen because it's making me a little less nauseous. Running through a bucket. <coughs> oh, gross. <laughs> Wonder if this guy was legitimately sick when they filmed because that sounded pretty 
real. <laughs> like. What are you doing? What's that in the corner? There's like lights. What is that? What's going on? It's like someone's putting flashlights on the trees or something. <laughs> Tim would not have seen the camera. Oh, no. Where are we? Peter, darling. Stop with the movements. Is this just eight minutes of, of this? <laughs> I mean, to be fair, this is kind of like what the whole series is in a way. trying to go. He even knows where he's going to go. Oh, hello. There's your buddy with a pipe. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I'm nervous. Oh. Mm. <laughs> I can't buzzing sound okay it's kind of like a stealth part of a video game you have to wait for the enemy to pass and then you go behind them and you run oh I have an itch in my eye stealth hard to be stealthy in a place that that's that's that quiet and also simultaneously noisy because every step you take makes a sound. Drink some water. Hydrate. You bleeding? <coughs> Hold it in, bro. Hold it in. Hold it in. Hold it. Hold it. That's the worst feeling ever. Oh, Slendy knows where you are now. I mean, the operator knows where you are now. The little glitch. Oh, frick. Oh, oh, I like pulled a little muscle in my hand or something. Is it over? Tim's last tape ends there. The building he went to looks like the same one Alex took Brian to in Entry 51. Right. I remember that bit. But why did Tim go there? It sounded like he really didn't want to in the previous tape. Hmm. Was he just trying to hide or was there some other reason? I don't know, man. You give me a lot of questions. I'm really hoping this season brings me answers. I assume Alex was there searching for Tim. It looks like he was carrying a pipe heavier than the one he used earlier that day. Huh. And why was he just walking around with a pipe? Now that I've gone through all the tapes he gave me, I'm going to get back in touch with Tim. Interesting. Interesting. Hopefully he still remembers where this place is and can show it to me himself. Let's 
session. Oh, hello. That's kind of cool looking. One day you will understand. Secrets everywhere. That's all of us in the classroom just watching footage of trees. <laughs> Liars everywhere. This is giving like backrooms vibes. Wait, hang on. I missed that. Look closely and you will know. I'm looking closely. Spider. Vecna. It's Vecna. That looks like a see you soon. Oh, that was kind of cool. We'll end with this one. This will be our last one. We're going to end with this one. Here we go. Entry 58. After finishing Tim's tapes, I went back downtown to talk with him. I decided to continue acting like I wanted his help finishing Alex's movie. But why? Why not just show him all the tapes? Why not just show him all the tapes? We shall watch this one, Delaney, and then um, and then we'll call it for today. But when I get time to stream again, we'll continue as well. I plan to finish it. We've gotten this far. Like I'm not going to leave it. I feel like everything's doing okay for once. Um, so I feel like unless we take the next appointment really necessary, I feel like I could go for another month or two. I need to stretch a bit. I'm a bit tense. Okay. Well, same time, same place, I guess. Alright. You could Bye. hide Slendy behind me. Sorry about that. That's my doctor. He calls up every few days to make sure I'm doing all right. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, are you? Well, I'm not dead yet, so <laughs> that's something, I guess. Okay. Did you uh, find anything good on those tapes, or was it, could you even play them anymore? Yeah, yeah. Um, I found a few things I could work with on them. A few things I could use. Yeah. Kind of surprised. I figured it would mostly just be us goofing around most of the time. Yeah. You there was a lot of that. Camera to the floor yeah. most of the time. Oh. It kind of figures because it's what the entire shoot was like. Yeah. <laughs> I like that reply to what I just said. It's you pointing the camera at the floor. Well, that figures because that's what the whole shoot was like. But what was he actually replying to? It would mostly just be us goofing around most of the time. There was a lot of that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it kind of figures because it's what the entire shoot was like. Yeah. Uh, I was gonna I was gonna ask you something about that footage. Um, you mentioned something to Alex about going out to see a abandoned hospital or something to go location scouting I think with him I th think I remember because he said he was looking for abandoned locations to shoot the movie in uh -huh. and because I'm from like I grew up here uh -huh. um, and I know there was an abandoned hospital off past Rosswood Park uh -huh. but we never went kind of looks like Markiplier you, a little bit you never went there with Alex mm -mm. why didn't you go did he just find something just else? Couldn't be bothered, I guess. I mean, you remember him. If it was ten minutes away from his house, that was too far <laughs> away. So I can only imagine trying to get him all the way out here. Yeah. Hmm. Well, uh, could you maybe show it to me while I'm out here? Because uh, you know, I, I gotta. Since I'm finishing it for him, I could use it. I can, but only if you're okay with a little bit of you know trespassing. Uh, well, you know, shooting this thing or. This movie, I've, I've had my fair share of it. You're so right I'm about the smoking. I'm surprised I didn't notice yeah, they, it before. I don't technically, really notice it's when trespassing, smoke. but they don't really enforce they it don't. during the day. So okay. if we wait while well, it's still light out, we shouldn't really have any problems. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't think there's any reason to go there at night. No. I, okay. I certainly wouldn't want to go there. But, um. Yeah. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what my work schedule is, but I think I'm off on Friday. Okay. So if you're free on Friday, I feel like we could probably yeah. do it then. Yeah, um, I'm not really doing much of anything right now, so <laughs> any, any day will work for me. Okay, well, let me run home and check and see what my work schedule is. Okay. And I can just give you a call, and we can meet up Friday morning somewhere. Sounds good. All right. Friday. Friday. It's Friday, Friday. Gotta get down on Friday. And that came out. Oh, you came ready to walk today. <laughs> what? 
I said, hope you came ready to walk today. How far is it in relation to here? Past those trees, past the railroad tracks, Why past the you field, you know. Can you not? A little bit of a walk. Um, is this as close as we could have parked? Yeah. Well, we could have driven right up to the front door if you want to, but, uh, you know, some guy in a pickup truck would have pointed a shotgun at you and told you to turn around, so I figured we could just kind of skip that oh, okay. step. Okay. Interesting. Wait. Why don't they look walkers? It's not like you come out here a lot. I've only been out here a couple of times, but this place kind of has a reputation around here. Who's the guy in the pickup truck? He sounds like an interesting character to add to this. It's a cornfield. Oh. Well, it's very pretty. What do you think? Not bad, huh? Uh, it's too much graffiti on it, I think. Yeah, the first floor's got a lot, but the upper floors aren't nearly as bad. Um, on those tapes you gave me, you mentioned, uh, another building around here. Where's that? Really? Yeah. Why would I brought that up? I don't know, but is there? Well, yeah, there is, but this one's way better. I mean, you got three floors, roof access, basement. I mean, there's really no reason to go over the basement? other one. This should have everything you need. Let's just go over there and look at it, because I don't think this one, I don't think this one's going to work. How do you know? You haven't even been inside it yet. Yeah. I can just tell that it's not going to work for the scene that needs to be shot in it. Let's go with the other one. We'll come back around and look at it if the other one's not as good. I don't get why we're with Okay, the fine. One. But JBJ you sometimes, really you know? JB, JBJ. JBJ you know I mean? is I mean, like... I don't even know this place is weird. It's the inside that matters anyway. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Look, I may be a little rough on the outside, but it's the inside that matters. Well, all right it's really in inside is hallways and broken glass, but if that's what you want. <laughs> all that's inside is... Guys, all that's inside me is hallways and broken Let's glass. Let's go this way. <laughs> hallways and broken glass. Yeah, that looks really great for school, too. Ew, why are you peeking over the corner like that? What's left of a courtyard over here if you want to use that? Looks like there's a fire here or something. Yeah, I think that's why they closed it down in the first place. So you can see up here, the paint's a whole lot darker up near the top. Wait, hold on. <coughs> you okay? Yeah, fine, just... What was that? This is a really old building. I'm sure there's junk that falls down around here on the floor. Oh. Alright, let's keep going. Scared. You're scared. Shut up. Uh, okay, come on. We're gonna go check out every little noise. We're gonna be here all day. I wonder how many times they filmed and accidentally filmed someone they weren't supposed to, like one of their buddies who oh. was making the noise and had to retake the shot. Hallways upon hallways upon hallways. Is this everything you hoped it could be? When they do a lot of these swooping shots, it makes me wonder, like, who they're trying to it's, hide. It's okay, it's usable, I think. So what do you need this place so bad for anyway? I mean, is there some kind of abandoned hospital scene or something? Um, there's an abandoned school scene, yeah. I think this could pass as a school. 
I'm gonna be completely honest with you here. I really don't understand why you're going through all this trouble just to finish up this movie, because as far as I remember, like even by student film standards, it wasn't particularly good. Yeah. I, I told you, I just wanted to finish what Alex started. I hate to see all of his work go to waste. Well, obviously he didn't care about much of the way he was Maybe something came up with him. What, like him turning into a completely unbearable person to work with? I don't know, I didn't really know him that well. Hey, hey, hey! Hey, who's that? Who's that? Alex? Probably out the windows. Come on, this way. Hey, stop! Peter. Do you see that person at the end of the hallway? Pretty bad, but people wander around us here all the time. You know, kind of like we're doing right now. Oh, I don't like that. What is this? Some kind of maintenance tunnel. I think he jumped Secret down there. Secret tunnel! Secret tunnel. I'm not going down there, so I say we get out of here. I'm not going down there. No, Jay! What are you the way that you are? Look, you know that guy that was wandering Sorry. around might have been a security guard, so he might have called the cops on us. So, if you don't mind, I'd rather get out of here before something happens. I don't have a flashlight. Mm. Well, I don't either, because we did kind of come out here in the morning, and I didn't really expect to have to need one. We'd be done now. Yeah. Okay. Which way's the front? That way. You still want to check out in here? No. Obviously, you don't want to be here anyway. Wait, and we can nice. still look in there if you want to. You seem to like it better. I just want to get out of here. All right. You can come back another day, but I don't know that I'll be joining you. Look, I don't know what you're up to, but I think I've had enough. What do you mean what I'm up to? Just trying to finish Alex's movie for him. Okay, well, I think I've helped out all that I can then, especially if it involves going out there. I've had enough of that place for a lifetime. What? I've had enough of that place for a lifetime. You said you've only been out there a few times. Yeah, well, that was enough. <laughs> well, at least I know where it is now. I can come out here and shoot some other time. Good luck with that. Tim didn't say anything else. We got back to our cars and left. He seemed really unnerved the entire time we were in the, build, uh, the other building, even though he didn't remember being out there with Alex. Yeah, he clearly did, because he said he didn't ever want to go back there. The hooded person I saw looked exactly like the one that appeared in the previous entries. Oh, yeah. Is that to the Ark? Ew. It seems like he was leading me to that maintenance tunnel. For what I'm not sure, there, sure there could be anything down there. Hmm. Asking Tim to go back with me probably isn't a good idea, so if I go back to look inside, I'll have to be by myself. What about Jessica? Is Jessica dead? Is Amy dead?
Tim called me a little while ago and told me to meet Hi, him Kieran. out here to talk about something. He didn't say what it was. But nope. I go and told me to meet him out Tim. here to talk about something. He didn't say what it was. But I assume it has something to do with what all happened at the abandoned hospital a few days ago. A voice crack? Which didn't really go as well as I hoped it would. Oh, hospital. It wasn't though, school. They wanted to use it as a school. It was like hospital. how I expected it to go. Or was it? I can't remember. I don't know what all Tim remembers and what he doesn't remember and what he's lying about remembering and not remembering, but regardless, I don't think Hi, he's going to be buying my cover story for much longer. And even if he did, it's not really doing much good by this point. So as nervous as it makes me to do this, I think when he gets here, I'm going to come clean with him and tell him the truth about what all has been going on these past few years. You should. It may make him mad it may get him on my side i don't know what's gonna or happen both. don't know till you maybe try. it'll lead to some answers if i'm lucky mm. i see car lights in the distance all right that's him tim Tim, oh, no. listen. He seems I aggressive. Don't. Why is he punching us? Student film, you like piece of. <laughs> so after our little field trip, I couldn't help but shake this feeling that there was something oh. funny about you. So I do a search for Marvel Hornets, and you want to know what I find? I was gonna tell you tonight, Tim. I oh, swear. tonight? Tonight? Not last week? Whenever you dragged me out to that oh. hospital to chase after whoever that guy was, huh? I like it. Three this. months ago, whenever you followed me outside my own doctor's office. I had to be sure I could trust you. If you've seen the entries, can you blame me? There's a lot of things I could blame you for right now, Jay. Yeah. I mean, honestly, I'm what on Tim's side. What was I supposed side. to do? Just walk up to you and ask you about it? Show him the... So much for the last few years makes so much sense now. I was doing fine. I was getting better. And then... Uh-oh. <coughs> Imagine waking up one morning in the back seat of your car, miles away from home, with blood in your hair, and you have no idea how that happened. I love this Imagine energy waking up one morning from Tim right now. With your leg like, broken and no memory whatsoever of that happening. Think about that. Imagine not being able to keep a job because you call into work one morning and they say, Oh, we're sorry. We had to fire you because we haven't heard from you for the last three weeks. Yeah, that's rough. <laughs> Tim. But then suddenly it stops. And I start getting better. And I can hold steady work and I can function like a normal human being for once in my life. And then suddenly you show up, putting a camera in my face, yeah. bringing back old memories like it couldn't possibly have any effect on anybody else. Mm. And you're not even trying to fix any of this. Yeah. All you do is point your camera at every little thing I that like happens. this, I, I agree. Help anybody. I in agree. case something happens, I want people to know. Like who? But you're who not telling anybody. Care? And things have happened. What are you to from all this? You caught I Alex killing somebody Alex on camera. Alex points a gun at you and your first instinct is to film it, you psychopath. I'm a I'm psychopath. Just like, I'm on you really want to call me a psychopath after all this video? Shut stuff. up! I'm not a psychopath. It's all Alex's fault. Him and whatever that is that follows him around. Somehow they're responsible for Tim me being this way. You knew about right it. Now. You knew about it for three years and you never said a thing. How was I supposed to know you wouldn't try to kill me at any minute? Ugh, I just came to you now because I need your help. All my help. My help with what? There's this girl, Jessica, okay, she's Jessica. disappeared, and I know Alex has something Nobody to do with it. Nobody cares about Amy that disappeared. How do you know that? I'm still Who mad exactly about is it. Jessica, huh? Somebody you met in a hotel once? Somebody you've spoken to for a grand total of twice? How do you have any proof <laughs> that Alex had anything to do with her disappearing? Because as far as I could tell, she was doing audience. just fine until she met you. Mm. Maybe Alex isn't even the problem. Maybe you're the problem. It's me. I don't just need your help Hi. with her. I need your help with all the of them. What makes you think I want to help Dave's you? The problem. It's him. What is it you want? Okay, obviously you're not very good at this, so <laughs> you can keep looking for whoever this Jessica is, but here's what's going to happen. We're going to get in our own separate cars, go our own separate ways, go to our own separate homes. I like I'm going to try and forget like I ever met you in the first place. Tim, wait, just listen to me. No, you listen to me. You can keep making your little detective videos all you want, but do me a favor and stay out of my life. I'm nervous, though, for Tim. The thing about these videos is they make me nervous because you never know at what point they're just going to, like, turn the camera and it's going to be, like, all, like, jump scary and bleh, and I don't like that. So my heart rate starts going...
Yeah, Jay. That's how I've felt. Everything Tim just released. That's <laughs> how I have felt. <laughs> Truth with light. Entry 60. I agree, Karen. His acting there was a lot better than what I've seen in the past, at least. Bird squawking. I decided to return to the abandoned hospital to look around some more. Why? Why? I would have preferred not to go alone, but after what happened with Tim, I didn't have much of a choice. Jay, you've so many other choices in life. <laughs> like... Oh, here comes the motion sickness again from how they handle the camera in this series. Now I have It's Me. Hi. I'm the problem. It's me. It's stuck my head. While looking, I think I found the room where the fire Tim mentioned started. Where it started? It's me. Come on. <laughs> it's my Trees. Why they always film like this way? I mean, I get it logistically because they have to. It creates the the sense of, ugh, sorry, motion sickness of, of unease because of the whoosh whoosh whoosh. But it's just like realistically, why would a human film this way? Like it's like. Before going to the tunnel, I went to check the room I saw the hooded person come out of. Ooh, I'm the hooded person. It's me. <laughs> and I'm just gonna hide it in my hood. I- stop with the fishy fish fish. The fish fish fish. It's me. Hi. I'm the problem, it's me. Tea. tea! I have tea. Tea time. Plot twist. I am the hood man. <laughs> I should get a mask. Don't have anything like a mask. He is a liar. He is a liar. Who? It's so fresh too, it's not even on. Follow me. Love how love how when he films, he films the ceiling before looking at the writing. <laughs> He's like, ah yes. The corners. <laughs> and guys, I do enjoy this series. I don't I rag on it because I get tense and it makes me feel better. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Satisfying peel. Although it could be unsatisfying too if it comes off in only itty bitty pieces constantly. Don't go in there. That just seems unsafe and unsanitary. Unlimited rice pudding power! Hi. <laughs> We're getting spooked. I do plan to stream. My plan right now is to stream early afternoon tomorrow. More Hogwarts. <laughs> because, because I'm obsessed. Tunnel. Breeds. <laughs> getting this POV is because someone's going to jump down behind him. Is that why we're getting this POV? Is that why we're getting this? Okay. When I get scared, guys, I don't even know what I say anymore, so I apologize. Yeah, it wouldn't be horror if the protagonist wasn't stupid. Although, I have enjoyed... Oh, so 
some of the more recent stuff coming out in horror. People have been smarter. Jordan Peele. And I just recently rewatched through all of the Scream movies. I have not seen the newest one. Don't, no spoilers. I'm not seeing the one that's in theaters right now. I plan to see it um, when it comes out for streaming. Can you see my face? If I'm like this. I just kind of want to hide. And what I was going to say is watching out through all the screams, you know, there's that element of making fun of the fact that they're stupid, like the meta, whole meta thing. It's really fun. Steps, oh no. Above you. Oh, frick. <laughs> I can imagine that this was nerve-wracking to film, Karen, because, like, you're actually in this tunnel thing, and you don't know if there's gonna be, like, rats or, I don't know, like, someone on drugs in there, you know? Like, or, like, they're going to these abandoned places. Sometimes there's squatters, and I don't know. Oh, gosh. And, wh I can't. What's gonna happen? I don't know. I can't do it. Gosh. It's all good, guys. Uh, how do you get through that? Over there, under that. Ow, careful. Ugh. Mm, frick, I'm so tense. <laughs> oh, it's a little doll. It's a little doll. That's interesting, Delaney. I would imagine, given liar, he's the liar. Don't turn around and have there be something there. <laughs> it's me. Come on, twelve twenty ninety five. Whoa, I was nine months old. <laughs> pediatric admission profile timothy for tim how old was he um respiratory treatment oxygen something high red shadow <laughs> It's the same doll from Brian's house in season one. Thank you for the reminder. I don't like the darkness. No, someone's going to be behind him. Uh, I'm, I can see completely, but I feel safe if I'm covered. <laughs> Uh, I like that pink hand thing you had with the waving red shadow. It's so fun looking. It's me. Hi. I'm the problem. It's me. At tea. Um, guys, seriously, when I get scared, anything just comes out of my mouth. I'm really terrified of needles, and when I go to get my like blood drawn... I just warn the people all the time that when I get scared, I just start saying anything. And I tell them, just tune me out. I'll just talk. Oh, my gosh. I just speak and I keep talking. No, 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 no. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, gosh. No, I don't like it. It's not over yet. I just want it to be over. I just want him to pass out or something. Just pass out. Just pass out. You know, whatever. Oh my gosh. I can't take it. I can't take it. I can't take it. Oh my gosh. Stop. Stop. I hate this. No. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh no. Run. Run. Please no more. Let it be over. Oh. Oh. 
pushes it over. my heart oh gosh <laughs> ow <laughs> I don't things hurt and I don't know why <laughs> I don't know what I did uh like my ear hurts okay <sighs> okay I don't know how I made it out of that tunnel alive everything after finding the medical documents is a complete blur to me <sighs> okay That's a good point, Kieran. I still don't understand how the operator was able to fit down there. That is an excellent point. It kind of makes me think of um, the first time that I uh, played Poppy Playtime. Uh, I was playing with my with my friend Nikki watching. And she was like, oh, you're in the little vent now. You're safe because Huggy's too big to fit in there. And then when he was crawling, we were like, what is going on? But yeah, it is funny to think of him and his longness, like, crouched down there. Someone else was in the building while I was down there. I kept hearing footsteps above me. Was it Alex? Not that Alex, Alex, but Alex. <laughs> or Tim? Fortunately, I managed to get out with the medical documents and the doll that were down there. I'm going to take some time to look through everything and try to figure out what to do next. <sighs> My chest. I never wanted to go back to that place ever again. I I wouldn't have wanted to go there in the first place. What? 60 and a half. I've carefully read through all the medical documents that were in the tunnel. my house right now I'm making this video as a record of the information I found on them <coughs> oh you're all dying I wonder how this ends no spoilers right. I'm very curious how this whole series ends uh, first of all some of the information on these forms uh, has been redacted um, I don't think that the hospital where these came from is responsible for this I think whoever left these forming the tunnel is the one responsible uh, because the marker that redacted it looks to be the same thickness as the one that wrote on the folder itself. Ah, Sherlock. Right, very smart. This form is a pediatric admission profile from 1995. And that's Source interesting, Delaney. I'll have to is listed as it. Tim's mother. Uh, reason for admission, she insomnia complained of in insomnia, headache, possible disorder. I have no idea what that means. Am I supposed to uh, pause on these pages? Here on an anticonvulsant as a seizure precaution. Right under it, it says for it has a history of falls, which and I'm assuming has something to do with seizures. Pain history assessment uh, on a scale of one to ten. How does your child express pain? Screaming. <laughs> says his pain is at a six um, from frequent headaches. There's also an I feel that emotional barrier to learning. I had a I'm major sure migraine. That could be. Mother. Filled out on the same day. It's a pediatric admission assessment. Uh, first two chief complaints are the same. Head it must be a little bit older than me. And the third I was one nine months old. Was it more that specific day. than possible disorder? I don't know. I guess I'll never know. It's been redacted. Redacted. Let's see here. Can read? Yes. Can write? Yes. In home in is home health involved in your care? No. Toileting goes to the bathroom alone. Independent. Liquid mother. Um Looks like single mother, no one else staying with the child. Has your mother or has your family had any recent changes? No. Do you feel safe in your home? No. Are you afraid of anyone? No. Looks like they scribbled out. Uh, down here it says, do you feel safe in your home and are you afraid of anyone? Apparently uh, answered yes at first and then changed it to no. Karen, I thought at first you said the operators nearby. I thought you meant, wait, where in this video and got so scared. And then you said in my webcam, which should make me more scared, but somehow not. <laughs> or maybe I should be. I don't know. Uh, 
My sister came by early and dropped off something right, that she picked up for me. But my front window was open. Not open, but like the blinds were open and it had just gotten dark outside. So it's normally when I close them because I don't like, you know, people sing in here. And Peter runs over and he's at the window and he's barking like crazy, like someone is right there. And I look over and my sister's just in the window like this. And it gave me a heart attack. And I'm so glad I wasn't streaming at that moment because it would have made it so much worse. Uh, comfort, rest and sleep. It says he's unable to fall asleep easily, averaging about four hours a night. Um, pain is still listed as a six out of ten. It says location is the head, duration two to four hours. Um, chronic, greater than six months. Aggravated by talking. I don't know hmm. what that could possibly be. Maybe by signify. hearing people talk. Or uh, the next to last page, <gasps> near the bottom, it makes note that Peter he ran away from you. home so cute. to some things ago. It could have been days, weeks, months, hours, minutes. I don't know. Uh, but it does say that he was found at Rosswood Park. Rosswood Last Park. Page is Interesting. A fall risk so this goes back to when he was a child. Chicks next to confused, disoriented, hallucinating, and combative. And also uh, medical history of syncope, seizures, and postural hypertension. Seizures underlined. Interesting. Next is a delayed therapy communication form from 2002 for a monthly session. Uh, only reason given here is patient or family uncooperative. Everything else that could possibly be of use to Why me would this be in a tunnel? Like other than plot. Next or within the plot. Brief operative progress note. Everything on it is entirely redacted except for the month and day, January 10th. And this symbol, which obviously I've seen many, many times before. Everything else gone, redacted. I don't, I'm trying to figure out why this one was in here. Was the person just trying to intimidate me with a symbol or trying to tell me something to attempt some kind of surgery? And if so, what was it for? I don't know. His voice right now is very <clears throat> ASMR esque, like the Last soft speaking is making me suicide sleepy. or self harm assessment tool. But uh, why did he put it 14, there? You know? Which was considered a uh, high risk. Yeah, unlimited risk putting power. Exactly what I was uh, just, yeah. Here, like I'm getting like ASMR. Unable to contract because of impaired reality testing. Hallucinations underlined. But it's very calm. Symptoms, hopelessness, anger, or rage, and anhedonia, which I looked up and is apparently the inability to experience uh, happiness or pleasure from things. Yikes. Uh, also, uh, replies were questionable, so... Who knows if he was lying about anything on here. And then under all those forms was this picture. It's kind of blurry, but it's of Tim and I. Yelling at each other. The night that Tim found out what all I've been doing without telling him. And it's written on the back. So the Ark isn't Tim, but Tim was in a mask. We're seeing anyone else out there that night, but... Right? Of course, I wasn't really super aware of my surroundings after being punched in the face. There's <laughs> nothing else written on the folder itself besides this on the Liar. front. And this on the back. Oh, that's kind of cute. Me. Me. That's the sound I think it nothing makes. On the inside Me. Here. <laughs> nothing really special worth noting about the doll that was down there either. Long legs. It's just a prototype Huggy Wuggy, don't worry. These forms and this picture. And that's all I get. It's all you deserve. Just kidding. Sorry. I have misplaced anger at Jay. After reading through everything, it looks like Tim was dealing with this stuff for most of his life. And I might have made it worse. Yeah. My dude. I'm still not sure what to do from here. I don't like being on my own again like this. But there's nothing I can do about it now. Hmm. Please no ads. Observation. Tim, why? 
watching you watching him? No, that's the mask. I don't like oh my About two hours ago, the following video was uploaded to my account. It's kind of pretty. Mm, maybe not. Why do I feel like I'm going to see like Siren Head in the background? Like not Slender Man, it's just going to be Siren Head. I wonder if you could see Slender Man. I know, we're all learning things. It's fun. Oh. Why? This is like what my sister did, walking up to somebody's window. Oh my gosh. I would feel that immediately. Like, you know that feeling? <laughs> Ta-da, magic. Blech. I know, so crap. So crappy. Don't you forget about me. <laughs> don't, 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 don't. That was so quiet. Holy crap. Good thing my windows can't open for many reasons. One, they've been sealed shut illegally because you're not supposed to do that because of fires. It wasn't me, someone else did. And then two, they all have alarm thingies on them. So even if you could get them open, an alarm would go off immediately. <laughs> I am very paranoid. Not paranoid. I'm very... Hacha. And yes, that's an adjective. Dude lives like he just moved in. Like, why does this look like... Like he does. Did he just move in? A wooden box that he only keeps pills in. Looks like a homemade box, too. Oh, I like that sound. Oh, I don't like that. I didn't like that. The little glitchy glitch. Bills. Unmarked, too. No label. I'm nervous. Hello. Are you the Ark, I'm guessing? Is that a gas mask? No. No, it's not. It looked like it at first, though. It's just a weird looking. Where'd he go? Oh, he's dying. You took his pills. <laughs> oh, that's very dramatic. That's sad. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like the distortion because it means the operator's coming. Oh, is he having a seizure? having a seizure. Where'd the guy go? Don't you forget about me. That's what Slender Man's singing right now. That's what he sl sings in his free time. He's just going around. Don't you forget about me. 
in the closet. But how is he not seen? Isn't the closet open? Oof. Well, it's not. I... It's what my sleep paralysis nightmare thing was about. Someone in my closet. Dude hangs out in the closet, watches other dude have seizure. Footsteps on asphalt. Where could he have gone? This is your only chance. Numbers, numbers, numbers. Binary. Whew, there was a storm earlier, so it's likely that this video was shot just a short while ago. I think I know where I can find him. Rosswood Park? Maybe. And I'm going there now. Avengers, assemble. <laughs> Entry 62. Sip of the tea? We should do a drinking game, but it's with tea. <laughs> Every time uh, Jay shakes the camera, take a sip of tea. <laughs> Proxies, assemble. <laughs> Is it Rosswood Park? Was I right? Am I full up on in the lore that I'm understanding? <laughs> Doors. Oh, we're shaking the camera. Take a sip. <laughs> Every time a cricket chirps, <laughs> sip of tea. <laughs> We're just like gulping the whole time. Oh, I can't breathe. What's up, Master Gordon? Master Gordon. I don't know why I said it that way. I was kind of going for like a Master Wang. Kind of thing. Every time Jay does something stupid, sip of tea. Yes. <laughs> so basically the entire series. Oh, that's good. Not drinking rules or symbol. Every time the camera shakes a lot, every time Jess, Jay says something or does something stupid. Yeah, exactly. Oh, we're in the trees again, everyone. We're in the trees. Which... Tim! Oh, no. Gosh, my chest. I can't. <sighs> Tim! Grasp your skull for comfort. It actually is kind of nice. Can we go back to looking through his medical documents? Because that was kind of soothing. <laughs> Tim! Dun, 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 dun. My dog looks so cute in his bed right now. <laughs> he just looked at me like me. Cute. <laughs> I'm not nervous, you are. Oh, frick. Don't. <laughs> Don't know. Duh. Breathe. Oh, frick! Oh. Tim. Tim. Run away! Tim. Run! He's gonna run right into Slender Man. <laughs> it's masky time! <laughs> Oh 
<laughs> He's gonna be like right next to him, like, what's up? So when Tim doesn't take his pills, he turns into Mask Boy. Ooh, Mask Boy in the bushes. Mask Boy's gonna find you. He's gonna see your camera light. I know it's the thing, but like the little red light that's on those old cameras. <sighs> Jim. <gasps> Rustling in the bushes. Oh. You're right there, Tim. Come on. <laughs> he was messing with him. He's like, where could he be? Arm. <laughs> Please don't run into Slender Man. Please don't. I don't like it. I don't like it because then... I don't like it because then everything goes... I want to hide, but I'm also getting warm. Get warm when I'm anxious. <laughs> Hold my skull. Hold it. Oh! <laughs> What's happening? Oh no! It's punching him. What are you doing? <laughs> Like, Jay might actually be in some trouble now. Who's this? Is this Tim? No, this is other masked man. Oh. Hello. Why are you alive? It seems to me that Masky is being controlled by Slenderman, kind of like a like a servant. <coughs> so Tim Master. <coughs> the other guy, I think, the one who's like sort of watching them, I think, is the Ark. He's like a third party in this. But Slender Man is known to create people to control them to kill people, like Alex. So, why didn't Tim kill Jack? Well, everyone take a sip, because Jay survived. Of your tea, of your whatever it is. Uh, Rab's tree. Where are we? Oh, hello? Tim? Timothy? Wakey dear. Tell us where we are. Tim? Tim? Timmy? Tim Tim Tree? Hi. What are you doing here? You brought us here. I don't know. Kinda looks like a Jonas brother. I just woke up Have in I there. Have I said that before? Where are we? I think we're still in Rosswood. But not a part that I've ever been in. Big park. Tim, Tim dear, where are you going?
Wait. Ooh, okay. There's a path you can follow. Probably one of those directions leads out. My, my camera was just in front of me. I woke up. Still working? Yeah, but... Battery's almost dead. <laughs> I really like that. I like that cut. Battery's almost dead. <laughs> Who is he? Isolation. Who is he? Where's Rachel? Where is she? Who are you? Who are you? Who am I? It felt peaceful until that. Ew. What? That's kind of cool. The layering they did there. Meet again soon. <laughs> and Jay, where is she? Where's Jessica? And then Becca's saying, where's Amy? <laughs> Amy was with Alex. No one had heard from her. No one cared to seem to check. Oh. Uh. Entry 63. I appreciate your help. I really do, but I'm good to walk from here. You're gonna walk from here? Yeah. That's like miles. Wouldn't be the first time. What? So you're just gonna walk away like nothing happened? You don't think you need any help I after all that? Problems I gotta deal with right now. Your okay, problems are kind of like I go all to our problems right now. And explain to them why I called them up last night like it was some kind of big emergency and then just didn't show up. So if you'll at least let me deal with that, then we can figure out where it is we're going from here. Oh. Here, but until then, just go back to wherever it is you hold up and just try not to say anything about this to anybody, all right? Okay. How long do you think it'll be? I got your number. Alex said the same thing. It's been a few weeks, but Tim finally called me yesterday wanting to meet up again downtown. Downtown. What am I looking at here? Oh, weird. This screen is brighter than that one. So I can kind of make out, yep, that. Disconnected. So we really couldn't have met during the day. We gotta be under a street light, make it all dramatic. Sorry, I just got off work. I've been working all day. But what took you so long? It took you weeks to go- Jay, that's one for you to say. You're always filming yourself like from a distance sitting, like you're posing for an album cover, saying things in the most dramatic sense, and you're calling out Tim for his dramatics. That's a lot, Jay. I see your doctor. <laughs> well, in between constant doctor's visits and trying to keep my job, I've been trying to figure out what kind of steps we need to take next. Steps we need to take? Yeah. What would those be? We could start by giving my medical records back. Yeah, I was going to do that. That's why I have them. You know, I'm really glad you decided to listen to me whenever I told you to leave me out of this. I didn't know those were going to be down there in that tunnel. Someone obviously took them from you and left them there for me to find. At least I'm giving them back you to you. You could have kept them to yourself? Sorry. Whatever, they're out there now and there's not a whole lot I can do about it. And well, I guess I got bigger things to worry about than the whole world knowing what kind of medicine I'm allergic to. And like, yeah, they did help stuff. me find you when you ran off into the woods that night, too. Don't forget. Oh, yeah? How'd that go? Could have been a lot worse. What do you think? I guess just sitting around arguing isn't going to get us anywhere. We need to figure out some kind of a plan. Otherwise, we're just going to keep running in circles like you've been doing for months. I haven't yeah. been running in circles. Well, you don't seem you... like you've had much of a plan. Yeah, exactly. I've got a plan. And what is that? What is it? Well, at first it was to find you, and now that I've done that, I need to find out what happened to Jessica. 
you have any idea how long it's been since you've seen Jessica? A while. It's been a year and a half. I know. How about Amy? It's a long time. Do you know, know where she is? Do you know if she's even still alive? I need to find Amy. out what happened to her. Maybe it can help still. us if I do, whether yeah, she's yeah, alive or dead. That. It's kind great, of my fault got a that she was in this deal mess in the first right place. Now. There's somebody out there that is an immediate threat to both of us. Someone who's probably watching us right now, now that you mention it. Probably. They know where I live. We need to deal with this right now, and if we can do that, then sure, I'll help you find Jessica. Whatever it is I gotta do. <laughs> deal? The lady. Yeah. If it'll get you to help me, fine. Well, I don't really have much of a choice, do I? Of how they just pace past each not. other. The tension, the tension. What's your plan? What do you want to do? Well, right now, the only lead we have is Rosswood, so we're going to have to go back there sometime soon. No. In the daytime this time. I've been there in the daytime. Nothing good ever happens when I'm there. Is that Rosswood or is that you? Either way, you shouldn't go at all, and you definitely shouldn't go by yourself. Well, yeah, I kind of figured that out. I've seen what happens whenever you try to go by yourself. That's why I'm trying to get you to go with me. Right. Been there plenty of times already. What's one more? Unless you got any better ideas. This doesn't just affect you anymore. This concerns both of us. We need I to mean, figure out what to like do it's otherwise. It affected Tim first. So not just you. It actually it, it affected Tim first. Then the, one of everybody. us could end up dead. Yep. End up okay. dead. Okay. Yeah. When do you want to go? I have to see what my work schedule's like, but hopefully sometime this week, I can. Give you a call whenever I know for sure, I guess. It's always, I'll call you. Listen, I don't know about you, but I really don't want to be out here in the open, so if there's nothing else you want to talk about, we should oh, probably go. Oh, because he thinks to watch. Guess not. Thanks for giving these back, I guess. For all the good that does. Okay, yeah, I'll see you there. Green, in the distance. Crunchy feet. Someone should make an unintentional ASMR com compilation from Marble Hornets. Oh, it's a long one, which makes me think something spooky's gonna happen. Uh, uh. Oh, has he got like a GoPro strapped to him? What's he got going on? What's this on his? Ooh, Frenchy. You have the camera on? Yeah. And it's recording, right? Uh, if blinking red light means recording, then yeah. Oh, the next two. Interesting, this one. Well, then we'll end on a really right, good one, it. and then we'll start with this a really good one next time. Alex took us. I'm hoping we'll get... Um, I'll have to see how much longer we have. I'm hoping, like, in the next stream or two, you we'll finish, but all, the last season happening, is right? so long. Nope. And you said this is so good, which I'm means something scary is going to happen. Can't say I do. Let me go back. Nothing right. I want to make sure I'm paying nope. attention. I'm guessing you don't remember being here. Can't say I do. Wasn't exactly in the right state of mind at the time. So you don't remember anything while you're like no. that? So can decide if that's a good thing or not. Do you remember anything about this? No, not other than what uh, was on the camera. So, Jessica and I were right there. Alex was right here at the top of the stairs. Yeah, and then you helped them. I came at him from behind here. And you can't, yeah, you came from behind. He was right here, holding back. Yeah, we ran out after that. And then we heard the gunshot right as we were getting out, too. So it would have been around here, I'm guessing. But I don't see... Obviously, I didn't get shot, yeah. otherwise I would, would kind of remember that. Yeah, I don't see any blood stains or anything right here on the wood. I, mean, bullet holes. Were, I don't know if they still be here, because it was, what, a year, year and a half ago? I don't like even remember anymore. Something like that. I don't see any bullet holes on the walls or on the floor. Him. Could that be it right there? You think? Hmm. Yeah, probably. Seems kind of large for a bullet hole. I can't quite tell. 
Yeah. Maybe. That's what it looks like. I mean, I'm no expert, but it looks like it would line up from here. So it's just convenient that the I'm place guessing had a hole in the roof. Alex didn't get shot either. It just went through the roof. Is right. that the last time? Let's get going. Because I know we did a lot of, like, oh, well, the previous six months and stuff like that. Was that the last time they were face-to-face -face with Alex? I think it was. Yeah, I can't think of anything else up here that would be of any use to us. I don't really like being up here anyway. Yeah. You think that shack is out this way? Should be. How do you know? I don't even think we're really on a trail anymore. Yeah. Ow. What? Just a guess. <sighs> Hope we can find our way back. <sighs> this is it up here, I think. Yeah. <coughs> you see it? No. I still so need back to catch up on your previous Marble Hornets reactions, but have you or are you no, going to react to the mock trailer they made for the original I was nervous was going to be? I didn't know that existed. Here. So we shall watch you that. Sure? Maybe we'll watch it at the end. You can see for yourself. Like when we're done with the whole series? I'm pretty sure this is um, where it was. When I do finish the series, I think I plan to take Let's just all of my edited anywhere. reactions, put Let's them into one file, on and upload we it on. so you can watch Keep straight going towards through. That tunnel. Maybe we'll stumble like across it on the way. Long. <laughs> because I have no idea where we where are. Else could it be? I don't know. What are we going to find when we go in there? But I do have all the live streams still up, as well as the edited Dropped reactions, so where I kind of cut out some of my... There. I try I to cut think. out some of my channel. There could be someone there waiting for us, too. There's always someone Let's waiting. just go back the way we came. I looked over there already. There's nothing. There's a sign right here, but I can't read it. Let's just go back before we get lost. Come on. I miss, are there still times where they hide Slenderman in the background? Because I miss that. Like, in the in the first season, there was, like, a lot of, like, you him okay? just being in the background yeah, and stuff. Fine. Where they wouldn't point it out. <coughs> and I feel like they haven't done that in a long time. You sure? Don't worry about me. Oh no, don't go to the tunnel. That's where like he lives. It's like his cave. <sighs> Here, you hold the camera for a while. Sure. Yeah, you hold the camera so something terrible can happen to me in this tunnel right now. Like why else would he be asking that? Got it? Yeah. Oh. Wow. Hmm. No. There he is posing. Was this where Alex killed somebody? Yeah. Do you know who that other guy was? No. Did Alex, do you think? I'm not sure. 
Yeah, I kind of. It's on the other side of this tunnel. I don't know. I don't know if there was. I was chasing you at the time. That's what I love Obviously, about I don't the remember haunting anything series, about that. Haunting Hill House, haunting Hill House. I don't believe it ever there was. I wasn't really paying that close attention. There's ghosties in the background. I guess now's as good a time as any to find out. Who is it? Is it Alex? I don't know. Something I've never seen before. Hello? Leave. Now. That sounds like Alex. That was Alex. What? I mean, you just hung up, but that was Alex. He said leave now, so you Is should probably here? leave because that's like Sunderman's cave. Hold on, I'm gonna try and call back. He's not gonna answer. He sure. said leave now, so you should He's do following that. Us? Probably. I mean, if you just call us to leave, then we're probably about to find something he doesn't want us to see, so let's keep going. Well, we need to get out of here right now, then, if he's been following us. <laughs> well, he did try to kill you, so why don't we try to save you now? No. Ah, there he is. Oh, that looks so cool. Oh, it looks so cool. Ah. Ah. Oh my god, we got to go there. Oh my gosh! So cool. That was the coolest one yet that I've seen of that. It was almost like he was just like floating toward them. He just kept getting like closer. Oh, did we lose Tim? Oh. Is Tim? Tim Timony? Timothy? Tim Tim Tory? like that. I wonder who they got to do, like, they obviously did some sort of effects. It doesn't look that bad. Yeah, right? Oh my god. Tim! Oh, buddy. What are you doing out here? Okay, how'd you get there? <coughs> Tim, wake up. Are you okay? Is he masking boy right now? He's like, Open the door. What happened? Tim, wait. What are you doing? Tim! Tim, wait! Tim! <coughs> Dude, just hold it still. <laughs> <laughs> Did he do the effect though? Like that effect? Timothy, Tim, Timothy, Tim, Tim, Tari. Stuck in my head. I tried to follow Tim, but he was already gone. Already gone. I have no idea how he was able to get to the parking lot before me. Maybe the big floating thing put him there. <laughs> Something seemed very wrong with him. I need to find out where he is now. Something seemed very wrong with him. Yeah, didn't you see Slenderman? <laughs> I'm not losing track of him again, especially with Alex still out there. This is my problem with Jay, is that he's like, oh, that moment we just had where I literally had to run away from Slender Man. Seems like Tim is acting odd. Like, what? <laughs> you're, you're acting odd. <laughs> all right, display from To The Ark. Let me know how sound is and all that. Oh. You abandoned him. This feels very analog horror. I know we've had a lot of that, but like this really... Oh gosh, I'm already nervous. I always forget that I get scared. Hello? Oh, that's that thing. Oh, I don't like it. No. I also have slime with me to help with my nerves. Which one should I start with? Emo girl? 
It was right here. Stress dough. Put them back. Or liquid fireworks. Well, like dirt and some trees, but that's all there is back here. Oh, I don't like all the distortions. That means he's near. <sighs> oh, he's coughing. Is that Tim? Got it? Yeah. Yeah, Jay and Tim. Why are you there? I hate it. Oh, I gotcha. This is Tim's POV. of all this, we're going back a second because it totally killed the vibe. Oh gosh, I'm, I don't know. Uh, sure. had him. It's Wendy. Why didn't he just kill him? Oh, no. I feel a false sense of safety. Oh. <laughs> oh, That's lovely. The operator prefers to play with his food. Is he gonna make it out? Is he gonna die in this entry? the operator doesn't really kill people it just it seems to just really like mentally messing with people until they're broken and then and but he makes other people kill other people oh interesting looks like a lovely day out Was 
was about to say, I think he's soaking up the fear from town. Interesting, Delaney and Tyler. You can see just a little bit of Peter right here. <laughs> Hello's. Why are we here? Why are we still here? says, yeah, the operator, se operator seems to just make other people do the actual work for him. Interesting. He hasn't really made, he hasn't really made them kill. He influences their emotions to make those on the flip <laughs> decisions. Oh. Dude, go home. Go home. Get a Starbucks on the way home. Just relax. Take a bath. Maybe not a bath after that. <laughs> That's my idea of a relaxing evening. Starbucks, bath. I just, I really like puzzles and stuff. And I just started actually doing, for the first time ever today, doing diamond art. Have you ever heard of that? Oh, it's, it's very <laughs> similar to puzzling. Dude, stop walking around this. Please. Where's it? Where's it? Would you no dramatic movements? Yeah. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. something wait did I miss something sorry I was adjusting something I could I just so you guys know when I'm looking over here I have the video on both sides but I was adjusting something so it kind of saw I just want to let this no 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 right there right there uh, the right there <laughs> What do you want? What do you want? This whole voice sounds different. Joey says, dang, looks like Super Chat is having issues again. Aw, Joey. Well, it's the thought that counts for the most part, except for, you know. <laughs> but thank you so much for trying. I appreciate it. <laughs> um, Delaney, no, you didn't miss anything. Tim's violently hallucinating. I like that. I want to, that's a good way of describing that. Not that I like it. I mean, I kind of like it. It's enter I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> it's entertaining. It's entertainment. At least they're giving us something instead of just trees all the time. Dude, don't take so much. Dude, chill out. No, 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 you don't want that. No, 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 put it down. I think Tim's gonna die. That or he needs his stomach pumped immediately. <laughs> <coughs> what is it? Tell me it's like vitamin C or something. Be great. I know it's just that. Uh, okay. Okay. Tim, 
can't, you can't die now. You're the most interesting person in this for me. <laughs> you can't die at the beginning of this stream. I don't, I don't like this. Is that why this got flagged? Maybe because overdose? Looks like two eyes, like a smile. Hello. Hello. You have oh. one unheard message sent today at three forty-four a.m. I know you're probably asleep right now, but it's me. I, I need you to meet me as soon as you get this. I'm sure you wouldn't be coming back. Are you okay? Huh? What happened? I don't remember. Had this with me the whole time, though. Okay, thanks. No, we huh? recording the whole time. We are at the park, but the batteries are dead now. How did you survive? Uh, it yeah, I figured they would be if it was on. I mean, I guess it depends what it was. But that was a lot of whatever there's it was. Some, there's some things we need to talk about. All right, well, now would be the time. Well, there's something I need to show you, too. Something around here? No. You're not gonna like this, but we need to go back to that hospital. Why? What? Why? No, why would I, we do that? Look, if we're gonna keep working together, it's just something we need to do. I guess you'll just have to trust me on this one. Not really a trusting person anymore, Tim. Yeah, know, Tim's acting did that, get like a billion times better. I wouldn't ask you to do this if it wasn't important. Are you sure it's gonna help? Yeah. You're positive. Mm -hmm. Why does he come? Alright, let's go Have over I there said now and get it out of the way. Reminds me of Markiplier. Wait, hang on. I. I can't just yet. I need to. Just slightly. I'll talk to my boss and see if I still have a job. Probably don't, but it's worth a shot, I guess. Okay. Yeah, go do that. I'll be around. Just call me whenever you're done. We'll head over there. Okay. Hmm. What's that noise? The Peter? <laughs> yeah, maybe a mix of Robert Pattinson and Mark Blair. Ew. Hoodie. Sorry, I couldn't tell, like, what sounds are in my house and what 
sounds or not. <laughs> That's nice. Permanence. It all goes back to Tim. showing up finally on this thing because we still have like three hours of stuff to watch where is this gonna go i feel like we're nearing an end but we still have like two whole movies left <laughs> you know um oh. why is the chat so big hang on let me make it smaller this is it sorry just adjusting this is what exactly I know you said you aren't going to be doing reactions as in much in an earlier video, but I was curious if that includes here, Ghost Files. No, be a patient here, sorry. But I guess you kind of sorry, I want to listen to him. Uh, I will be doing season two Ghost Files reactions. This was my room. Je Jessica's face? I used to Ooh. live here, or used to be a patient here, but I guess you kind of figured that out already. Wait, what? Wait, what? What? Uh, he was a patient here? I mean, the thought crossed my mind, but I never really knew for sure. Huh. Why were you here? Oh, come on, you see my medical history. Obviously, you know I have some issues. Seizures. And I've had them for Seems, a yeah. pretty long time. Hmm. How long are we talking? As long as I can remember. Well, my, my mom brought me here when I was really young, but she never told me exactly why. Ah. I'm going to go back a second, a little here, because uh, I got a lot distracted. I've had them for a... He's talking Pretty about his issues. Time. How long are we talking? As long as I can remember. Well, my, my mom brought me here when I was really young, but she never told me exactly why. You never asked her? She's never really around to ask. And the doctors would never tell me to my face either, but I'd always hear them say things like violent episodes or delusions, you know, stuff you can't just tell a little kid. And they ran all kinds of tests and and just about every disorder you could think of on me at some point or another. And they settled on schizophrenia eventually, but I don't even think they knew for sure. I was on a lot of medication most of the time I was here. I got used to it after a while. And it helped. But not enough. What do you mean? I had a lot of them. Part of me knew they weren't real, but that still didn't make them go away. I Maybe mean, I just didn't want them to at the time. At one point they got so bad I kept escaping from my room. I'd hide the in the maintenance, maintenance tunnel. tunnel or run off to Rosswood Park, which you know isn't that far away from here. I knew it, it seemed to have started with me, him. I would say that I was hiding from whatever it was I was seeing, so they'd bring me back and didn't have much of a choice except to lock me in here. That's when it was at its worst. I'd be clawing at the walls and screaming at all hours of the night. I had to up my doses just to calm me down to the point where I was almost numb. But these hallucinations, what did they look like? Well, that's the thing, I can't remember any of them. Probably because of the medication. It didn't cure me exactly, but it kind of leveled me out enough that I was able to you know, go to a normal school. I got transferred to another facility. Got into college. That's where I met Brian. The first real friend I remember having. That's where you met Alex too, right? Yeah. Huh. Well, I saw that footage that you got from him. And that person in the background, or whatever it was, I couldn't help but think, you know, what if that's what I was seeing when I was in here? You know, what if that wasn't a hallucination at all? Wait, what are you trying to say? I'm saying, what if this is my fault? Hmm. Alex could be a normal person, you could be living a normal life, so could Jessica, so could everybody else if it wasn't for me. I have no way of knowing that for sure, that's always going to be in the back of my mind. How am I supposed to handle that? Hmm. I I don't think shifting the blame is really going to help anyone right now. I blamed everybody else except for me, and I could be the one that started this. Oh, I'm nervous. Where are you going? 
I think you just need to relax because all the stress is probably making you really paranoid. Well, what if I'm right? Oh no. No, no, no. No. So what? The operator is like got him tagged or something? What if what happens to me is happening to Alex right now? What? I don't know. But I do know that you're not like him. Yeah, not Alex is like entirely him. anyway. <laughs> Alex is He's not bad. running around in the woods with a mask on at night. No, but you're not pointing a gun at me right now either. <laughs> and he just goes, What about now? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Uh... What's it? No. Stop with that. No more secrets. Tell me what you want to be. Something that I like the It's way. kind of a lot to take in at once. <laughs> Pull stream goes down because copyright. <laughs> Come on, we should... We should go. You're not gonna be able to just go. Unless Something's gonna happen. Anything else you want to show me? Believe yeah. me, I really want to go, but I feel like there's something else here that we're missing, and if there is, I don't want to have to come back here again looking for it. Like what? Well, you found those papers of mine. What if there's more somewhere? Like some kind of filing room, maybe. Do you know where something like that would be? Possibly. I can always go look. Will you know it if you see it? Probably. It's worth a shot. Yeah. It looks All like right, a little kid here. If you want to, you can, you can go look. It's like eyes looking up at him. <laughs> yeah, Delaney, not yet. <laughs> oh, why? Ugh. I don't know what I'm doing. I just sing when I'm nervous. <laughs> Should be right up here. I don't. I don't wanna. Is it behind this desk? Is it behind this desk? I think so. No, something is not good. Of course, there is nothing. Is there anything in this other room nothing. back here? Nothing. Mm. Ugh, footsteps. I disagree with them. Time to bust out the slime. <laughs> Liquid fireworks? <gasps> is that to the arc? So cold. We should stay back here. We should stay back here. Hiding isn't gonna get us anywhere. Okay, I definitely be able to hear that. No, no. Tim, no. Oh, Tim, Timmy. I mean, Timothy. Tim, Timothy. Tim, Tim, Timmy. Don't die. Actually, I'm not sure if you can die. Maybe you're just immortal. Ugh, stop with the whooshing. I gotta go eat supper. My family and I are going out. I'll hopefully be back in time to catch the end. Bye, Kieran. Yeah, hopefully. Eat fast. Just kidding. You're fine. <laughs> oh. Okay. If he like just turns around, he's just gonna see you. Like straight up. You're just out in the open. Is that to the arc? Is that He's mask, there's to the arc. There's the operator. But what does it all mean? What does it mean? Oh gosh, did you? What is that? What is that? A wrench? Why is there a wrench?
And why? How, what makes you? Why? Nice hoodie. So to the arc is hoodie. Tim is masky. Just in case. Tim, Timothy, Tim, Tim. Looks like there's a dog door in that door. <laughs> Tim, Tim, Terry. Really hoping the series ends in some sort of like really conclusive lore where you're like, it all makes sense, and then you can rewatch the series and be like, wow, it all makes sense. I feel like it has to, given that the people who have watched the whole series seem to be pretty big fans of it. Because if it left us very unsatisfied, I don't feel like people would be such big fans. Gotcha. Thanks, Tyler. Both are against Alex, who's currently wor working under the operator. So, Masky, Tim, and to the Ark hoodie are against Slenderman or the operator. Okay, now you're just making a bunch of noise. Ooh, a taste. This is Hannah Baker. sickness. My eyes. Are we gonna find out who 2D Arc is right, is right now? Man, they moved fast. Where'd he go? He was like walking and you guys were running. He was just running for the road. Sorry, I'm not even realizing that I'm talking out loud right now. I just have like a stream of thought coming out of my mouth. Oh, gosh. You guys are like not hidden at all. Don't throw your only weapon. So what now? This close. We were this close. How can you just disappear like that? No, I don't know. He probably hid in the woods and we walked right by him. Maybe he got ahead of us. Maybe he's on the other side of that hill somewhere. So. How? Or maybe he's anywhere. I mean, look around. So what are we supposed to do? Just go home and forget about it? Yeah. I mean, we have this. I know that makes me feel better. I feel a lot better. I'm going to just go back and wait for him to show up at my house again. <laughs> yeah, honestly, use yourself as bait. Like... He'll come to me, you know? What? Tim Timothy, Tim Timothy. That's what I'm gonna say. 67. <laughs> oh my gosh. The tape I found, ooh, it's been a while since we've had texts like this. Tape I found in the hospital must have been where there for a while it was scratched up and full of dirt. How did you know it was there? Did I miss something? It's just convenient plot. Oh, because he was doing that. I don't think the person had, had just placed it there either, but was checking to see if it had been found yet. Oh, okay, so he knew he was looking at something, and then it was just glued, and then he grabbed it. Mm -hmm. I gotcha. I'm following. I'm real good at this. I've tried my best to get it clean and working again, but most of the video still doesn't play. 
video. Interesting. I thought it was like a cassette, like an audio cassette. Here's what I was able to get off of it. Excuse me. Hello. Well, that's nice. High quality. Leaf. That's a high quality. Oh, high quality leaf right there. A little ant going by. our hoodie friend filming he's like I have the stuff now make sure that all of it makes sense to you rather than just one be just being confused true I get that but at the same time like I or maybe unless there's things I've forgotten but like I want to take it in as like a first time watch cook well because it is um, and there's a reason that you guys know that Maskey is against the operator, and I don't. So I don't know if that's going to be revealed later. And so I want to, like, take in the mystery. Because I feel like when you're watching it first time, there's bound to be so much confusion, right? Just oh, the type of thing it is. So I know you're not trying to spoil, and it's fine. And I appreciate some of the explanations, but um, I guess just be careful of any big things you know. Uh who, what, is that Alex? Looked like Alex. Um, yeah, looks like Alex. He walks like Alex. Alex walks with like a, you know? <laughs> um,. getting all distorted is it because Alex is near and he's like kind of being controlled by the operator or is it because the operator is actually near wonder if this place is still there hmm like the abandoned building He got bonked on the head. See, now I know that he's against Alex. <laughs> Although it's kind of like, is anyone really not, I don't know, it seems like they're all, whoa, 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 whoa. What? Oh, if only I could read lips. Eggs and breaky. What? I do appreciate that so much is happening. <coughs> that scared us nothing. Oh, he had a gun. Hello. <gasps> you wanna kill him? <coughs> Oh, that 
a spooky. Is he protecting him? The operator's protecting him. Let's see. Everything after this point is unplayable with the exception of the last few minutes on the tape. Hmm. Crunchy. I do like all the footprint ASMR in the series. What am I looking at here? Oh, it's so... see that. Looked interesting. Let's go. Frame, 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 frame. Huh. Maybe, oh, maybe, oh, maybe it's not as interesting, but, oh, okay. It's interesting, but, hmm. Poor Tim. <coughs> mask boy. Mask boy forgot his mask. Oh. Retching. Retching. That's not a word I've used often. Tim Retching. Interesting. Here's the secret to never sending uh, an email with typos ever. Blah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, okay. You know what? Okay. I can't be too mad at the ads. Because <laughs> I have ads on my videos. So, I get it. But, you know. 67 and a half. Ooh, we're back at like a hotel. The laptop, a cup of water, got the TV on. Oh, my arm slid off the desk. Looks like it's a motel outdoor <laughs> deal. <laughs> Hi, Jay. Oh, we're back at his, are we at his place? He was at an indoor one though. Must be a different one. Hi, Jay. Haven't seen your face in a while. Screen, screen. <laughs> uh. I kind of like how the camera's fuzziness moves in the dark. There's something calming about it. It's like waves of static. That looks so uncomfortable. I keep hearing stuff. Stares at TV. Phone. Yes. Uh, 159. Alright, don't go anywhere. I won't. Hmm. 
Is everyone gonna die? That's don't tell me, but that's my prediction. <laughs> everyone but Tim. It's, uh, it's around back. Headed one in front of my room. Got everything? Yeah, I don't have much. Here, take this. So I'm just gonna follow you then? And I think that's the safest thing to do, right? Yeah. Right, let's get out of here. They're gearing up for battle. I don't know what kind of battle, but battle just seems like it. You ready to go? Click. Hey, Jay? Tim? Huh? You know, if Alex is still out there, he's gonna find us sooner or later. He, like, jumps out from behind the car. I'm here! <laughs> to the car, I don't know why my brain just like went into like video game mode where I was like, oh, I have to click so I can enter the car. <laughs> uh... Oh, I didn't see what people answered on my poll. I want to see. Tim and I have left. It's too dangerous to stay in this area with Alex following so closely behind us. I can't say where we're going because I know he's watching this too. Hmm. 70% of people have said they're marvelous. I'm so happy. That's so lovely. And okay, nobody's terrible. Entry 68. Sip of tea. About an hour ago, uh, the following video was uploaded by someone other than me. It'd be really funny if it was the next one. <laughs> okay, birds chirping. <laughs> I like the big open field. They should really take up bird watching, you know? While well, they're always going to the park. Even the tree, even some of the trees are on her side. What is that from? Does anyone remember? Trivia time. Even some of the trees are on her side. Hello. Oops. Broken windows. A bed. Oh, hi, hoodie. Glad you got your water and your bed. Those are necessary. Who are you, hoodie? Show us your face. I feel like that scene in the original Spider Man's where he's like James Franco with the knife. I love how they took all the brand names off the water. <laughs> Show me your face. Hmm. Peekaboo. Hello. Mm, hello. It'd be so funny if he turns the camera and all of a sudden Slendy's just like, hi. <laughs> Into the unknown. <laughs> that was so bad. Foliage rustling. Foliage? Foliage. <laughs> Guys, I'm not even halfway through and I'm already gone. Done did. Diddly done did. -de -de. <gasps> oh, 
out. Where do they go? Where are Jay and Tim? Wipe that stupid smile off your face. Oh, he's still there. Not expecting that. You are afraid. Yeah, of the maintenance tunnel? I am. I don't like that area. No. Oh. It scared me. Orange. Oh, ooh, ah, no. <laughs> no. Don't like that. No. No thanks. Why? Don't turn it off. Oh. <laughs> you are trapped. That was pretty cool, not gonna lie. Oh, it said you, and then it said we. Alex doesn't know where Tim and I have gone, and I plan on keeping it that way for as long as possible. Where have you gone? Decline. Everything is normal. Everything is normal. self-affirmations. I worry about nothing. Everyone, let's do our affirmations. I worry about nothing. Okay, I worry about nothing. I worry about nothing. I worry I, because nothing's on my mind. Because, because Becca, nothing's on my mind. Numbers. Pretty. Entry 69. Park. More parks, more trees. This one looks nicer though. Looks different. Sure you don't want anything? Oh, because huh? they have not anything. Sure you don't want anything. Oh, yeah, I'm fine. Even when you guys have I'm left there anyway. to somewhere else, you're still hanging out. How much further we got? Oh. Uh, I don't trip. know. Maybe 30 off. minutes tops. Does it still not kind of feel like we're running away from something important? I mean, we should have come out here at some point anyway. Might as well do what we know. Alex is somewhere else, right? What if Jessica's still there? And what is about she kind Amy? Of the reason you're still doing this in the first place? Yeah, but what good would it do her if Alex found us first? Thank you, Satan. <laughs> we were doing pretty good at avoiding him. Just um, needed some more time or better strategy or something. By the way, my so eye twitches because I uh, had a head injury a long time ago. <laughs> this is weird to talk about. Maybe I'll make a video on it. Hey, if that interests anyone, they want to hear about my brain injury 10 years ago, uh, we can talk about it in a video. <laughs> to me, like he was one step behind us. I don't think our luck could have lasted forever. Do you? No. Guess we can always go back if we need to. Yeah. Okay, but if the operator is tagged to Tim, I don't think anywhere Tim <laughs> zooms in on still hills. helping. Yep. Anywhere Tim I goes. Every few hours. The operator safe. Can go, right? Is that how many you're supposed to take? For now. For now. All right. I guess I've just been kind of paranoid after you know seeing what happened with them before. No, it won't happen again. He has it's really tough, friendly man. eyes. Everything is awesome. Ready to go? 
Are you ready yeah, for it? Yeah, you are. It's either that or hang out here. So it's hard to be driving. This slime yeah. is called de-stressed dough. Makes two of us. It smells like lavender. Blip. So they're going on a road trip somewhere. Somewhere exciting. Uh, road trip footage. Is it one o'clock in the morning for you? Oh gosh. <laughs> Sorry, Zine. After a few days of driving, Tim and I finally arrived back in the area where we used to live. I think I got a second wind of energy. Smelling the lavender woke me up into the opposite. The same area where Alex originally gave me the raw footage from Marble Hornets. Oh. Interesting. That's kind of cool. We spent most of the time here backtracking through the locations that we remember how to get to and looking for anything that could help us. He's like, my shoe. Look at the grass. Look at the tree. Here's a deck. Oh, yeah, that's where they filmed. We didn't find anything until a few days ago while looking at the local in the local park that Alex used as his set for Marble Hornets. Yeah, I remember that. It's not a final season unless you have to backtrack to your original season stuff. Speaking of which, so excited Whoa. for Stranger Things Season Whoa. 5. Stuff holes everywhere out here. Nice timing. What is it? Oh, I just thought I saw something. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. What'd you see? I thought I saw something moving over there for a second, but it was nothing. Mm. Pretty positive. Probably. I mean, nowadays, not nothing. even just thinking we saw something's enough to be worried. Yeah. I know, but uh, it was just a bird flying between the trees. Was it? Was it? You say so. If you say so. Ah, yes, the tower. And the creepy, creepy tower. That I'm not really sure this is where you what found that tape, right? Is. Yep. Tower, define your purpose. Where was it exactly? It was inside, wasn't it? Imagine you just did that to people. Yeah, you just the, go up and you go, define your purpose. That's right. See that little ledge up there on the right? Uh, yeah. Sitting right on top of that. Like a right, we'll trophy in a video game. Came out all this way. Might as well check. Maybe we missed something. Don't fall. All right, well, careful. be careful because the last time I was out here, I slipped off. Yeah, careful. I'll be all right. Be careful. Tim, oh. Timothy, Tim, Timothy, Tim, Tim, Terry. This next rung is broken, but I don't see anything up here. Careful. Yeah, I think there would be. Oh, what I expected to oh no. What is it? Audio distortion. Did he see something? Did I miss it? Did he see something? Did we see something? Did I miss it? There's someone out there. I think somebody followed us. It has to be Alex then, because there was audio know. distortion. Outside there. It's just a person sitting there staring at me. Oh, hang on. I want to go back. Did we see that? Hang on. Did we see it? Yeah, I think there would be. I didn't get to see it. Okay, just one check. Is anybody following us? How could anybody know where I I don't know. I just looked outside there. It's just a person sitting there staring at me. Where? Right outside. There's nobody there now. Tim, Timothy, Tim. Tim! I don't see anybody. Uh. They're right there. Oh well, no, but they were just here. They vanished. Did you point the camera at them at all? No. 
Yeah, I think so. No, I didn't see it. Here, rewind it. Let's check. Oh, yeah. All right, that's it. We've unpacked enough. Aw, unpacking game looks so cute. Bloop. I'm positive there's someone standing outside when you were up there. I just didn't point the camera directly at him like I thought I did. It must have been like off to the side of the frame or something. Well, that's why we're leaving right now. We should have left the first time you said you saw something. Sorry. It's fine. Let's just go. Oh. You all right? Yeah. You good to walk? Give me a second. There's holes. Yeah, watch out for those holes. Man, you got lucky. This one was deep. Don't stay in it. What is that? Is that a tape? Sure as hell looks like it. There's it's more. Melted. They're all melted. Didn't Alex say he was gonna burn those Marble Hornets tapes before he gave them to you? Yeah, but I got them from him before he did that. Are you sure you got all of them? Well, no, but... Well, what if these are his? Go, uh, check the other holes around here, see if there's any more. I'll keep looking through this one. Okay. Nothing in this one. Any more holes anywhere? Not that I can see. I think this one might still play. The case is melted, but I don't think the tape itself is. Seriously? Yeah, same for this one. Let me see. Let's just take them all with us. Better safe than sorry. Yeah. You okay? Yeah, I'm good. Let's go. So crunchy. While I eat a sandwich. So far, I've gotten one of the tapes we found to work. Tim was right, it contains more of Alex's raw footage from when he was shooting Marble Hornets. I took a bad time to take a big bite. <laughs> Here's what I was able to get all of it. <laughs> Dull roar of car. Dull roar of car. <laughs> Dull roar of car. <laughs> Sorry. Woo! this other day. I found out that one of the guys in the movie is actually from that area around your school. Really? Yeah, it's someone that got to play one of the smaller parts. We were talking about filming locations and he mentioned a few up there that you might know of. Yeah. When I found out, I told him, that's weird. Amy is actually going to school there. Um, basically just good luck not being bored. Nice to hear from Amy. Nobody else seems to come visit you soon, okay? Nobody else seems to care. Yeah. I care about While I'm up Amy. there, we might actually film a few things for Marble Hornets. Actually, uh, I've been thinking. I might try to transfer there after I'm done shooting all of this. Yeah, I mean, the film program up there is better than the one I'm at now, so... Well, that's what I've heard, at least. 
also I just don't like being this far away from you. Aww. Really? Because where is she? Uh, anyway, I'm really tired from shooting today, so I'm just going to go to bed. Uh, yeah, I got back a few minutes ago. No, I'm at home. Uh, my reception gets a little spotty out here sometimes, so maybe you're hearing static or something. Yeah, like I said, though, I'm just going to go to bed, okay? I'll talk to you later. to lie about driving like why would she care if you're driving that is strange sound something about that sound really does not sit well in my chest <laughs> peter his butt <laughs> we are so cute, babe. i don't like that sound please don't do that sound again oh, now i'm on the east i'm pretty sure isn't this where last time at this spot i got super jump scared it was right around the playground i got super jump scared by slendy Oh gosh, <laughs> I'm so nervous. Ooh. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, no, I'm scared. <gasps> oh, yep. See, he's always over hey. there. Playground Alex wants to looks like the same. Yeah, entry four, entry four. I got super jump scared when Slendy popped up there. He like turned around and he was right there. But why did he choose to burn this tape and give the other ones to me? That's a good question. I think it might have something to do with Amy. She was never mentioned in any of the footage that Alex originally gave me. And no one seems to care that she's missing. <laughs> Sorry, I'm still, I feel, I feel invested in the Amy lore. Oh, this is nice, but I don't know if it's copyright. <laughs> uh, it's five more seconds. Entry 71. We are cooking, you know? I've gotten another... Why do I always take a bite right before the video? <laughs> I've gotten another one of the tapes we found to work. Oh my gosh, what the hell? The door, and it scared the crap out of me. And Peter was barking at it. I don't know what it was. I have no idea. I'm assuming the wind. <laughs> like a true Shaniac. <laughs> aggressive with all the tapes. <sighs> Guys. <laughs> Hi, Peters. Yes, you sweet boy. 
What are you doing? Just looking out the window? Dude, you need some curtains. <laughs> oh my gosh. Now I'm so on edge. <laughs> hey, hey, come on. left and now I can't afford the rent so that sucks yeah uh you have any more packing left to do I can help you out if you want me to yeah uh come on where are you moving to somewhere cheaper that's such an answer somewhere cheaper about 35 minutes passed with the camera still recording Or something you should I just do. don't want to deal with it anymore, okay? It wasn't that good to begin with, and I just want to start with something new. If you don't want it, just... I'll take it. It's better than the alternative, being all dramatic and burning them. Is that okay? Can you do that? Fine. Doing that. As, as long as it's okay. It's okay! Alright. This is like the prequel. Yeah, you probably shouldn't keep tapes within an attic with a blind control. I mean, <laughs> humidity can ruin that kind of stuff if you're not careful. Oh. Oh. Ah. What is that? What is that? What are you? Show me your secrets. I'm going fra- I don't want to know your secrets. <laughs> I know you had this many of them, but uh, thanks for giving them to me. You got uh, the light outside like, is off. Lots of shots of wooded areas and stuff on here. Yeah, right. probably. All right. Okay, look, I don't want to talk about probably, this again. Yeah, right? ton of wooded areas. Sure, it's not that bad. Jay, I'm not oh, it's kidding. Not exactly. Don't ever bring this up around me again. Okay. Okay. I'll see you around. Bye. He has a hood. <laughs> Maybe he's hooded and he attacked himself. <laughs> no. <sighs> hey, Jay, hold on. What? I'm sorry. I'm so confused. Jay was attacked. Like, way at the beginning. This was when I originally got Alex's tapes from him, which was almost seven years ago. Yeah. But it's not right. It isn't what I remember happening at all. Alex never attacked me. He gave me his tapes. I left and that was it. Yeah. If 
If I don't remember this correctly, what else could be wrong? What else has Alex caused me to forget? <laughs> Guardians. <laughs> oh. Interesting. I'm very intrigued, and my mind is full of ideas, but I do not know what is plausible. Entry 72. I'm not going to take a big bite till I read all the text. There is no text. Are we going to get inside? Guess we'll find out. I can always break a window, but hopefully it won't come to that. Well, that for rent sign over there looks like it's been here for quite a while, so I don't know if anybody would even notice. This is weird. I remember this area being a lot more wooded than this. But of course, apparently my memory of here is very spotty already. I know that's kind of a difficult thing to deal with, but just remember you're not the only one. That helps. I guess. Fingers crossed. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Is it that easy? Shh, don't jinx it. It will never happen again. Nice place. Why would whoever owns this place just leave it unlocked like that? You probably didn't expect people like us to just wander in here. I don't know if anybody else has lived here after Alex did, but if so, I don't know if we're going to find much of anything. It's worth a shot, though. Well, hopefully we find something that'll help us get to Alex before he gets to us. I don't know what that would be, though. He jumps out of the closet. I'm already here. Well, I think we're a little closer now. <laughs> I mean, you finally know how you got roped into He does love to jump scare. For real. It's better than nothing, I guess. I guess, but it... Still doesn't make sense to me. Like, why did he give me the tapes in the first place? Are there more in the attic? Well, honestly, I think he got mixed up in things that he couldn't control. And he gave you the tapes that made him look like the victim rather than the cause. It's an interesting yeah. point. Maybe. Why did he just attack me like that after he gave them to me? Moving the camera so we can see more people. You heard him talking to Amy on the phone on that tape. That doesn't sound like a killer to me. Or a liar, maybe. Now, whenever he attacked you, that didn't look planned. I think he panicked. That's why he took off. Yeah. Maybe he tried to burn that tape of him talking to Amy because he didn't want anyone else but her to know where he was going. That's entirely possible. It's the only way we can know for sure is to ask him. Can't exactly do that. Yeah. I don't think and there's he's anything like, in here. But you can, because I'm right here. Like closet. <laughs> oh, basement. Did you, uh. Oh, did you bring the flashlights by any chance? Basement. Yeah, but uh, they're still in your car. Oh. Nice. We can come back after we look at the rest of the house. Alright. I'll check in there, I'll check this room. Alright. I think this is the closet in here that Alex hid that box of tapes in. Yeah, there's nothing in here. Oh, wait, hold on. Come here. Yeah, I think so. Dread. Or these. Gum. Yeah. Sees me, Tim. Same thing. Sarah. See a bunch of crossed off names. No. Go, go. What? Shh. <coughs> it's outside. It's outside. Did we see it? Hang on. Did we?
No. I wonder if they had Slendy in the background more. What? Where'd my captions go? They're there. Stay down. Where? It's out there on the tall grass. I see it. No. Okay. It's right out there on that tall grass. There's nothing out here now. What are the camera at it? Here, hold on. Jay, look, no. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna rewind it, just a second. I'm gonna get you to a doctor soon. But I'm fine, I'm not stupid, I know what I saw. I never here. said you were stupid, but this is the second time this has happened, and Dude. in case you've forgotten, I have some experience with hallucinations. I don't think I was hallucinating. I just haven't had a full night's sleep in, what, two or three years because of all this? And also, it's all well, everything so else. Here, There's no reason to do this plot this line. Not go away. Trust I me. don't I need like help. This is how it started with me. You is that how you want to end up? You already know you're dealing with the supernatural okay. deal, Leo. Look, we just got a couple more rooms left to look at, and then we can figure out after that. Let's get the flashlights out of the car so we can check the attic. Put these in there, too. Where's the attic? Oh, right there. Right there. I can put the flashlights in the trunk. Is there something in, in the trunk? Bag, I guess. All right. No, no, top pocket, top pocket. Okay. Yeah, just, just get back. Yeah, there's the flashlights right there. Uh, here you go. Thanks. Mm, those are the really long ones that you can bonk people over the head with it. You should go check those other two bedrooms because I only looked in the one. Okay. All right, it's basement time. It's basement time. We've had maintenance time. I don't think we'll be in, but we We've might as well. We've had time. We've not had, we've had plenty of woods. We've had abandoned hospital time, lots of that too. But now it's time for basement. Oh, yeah. Honestly, it is kind of nice to just be in a new location, sort of. Can you come in here with this real quick? Oh, is it jammed? Yeah. Uh, Aww. Is it the camera? Good night, Satan. Ah! That was cool. Anything? But good night. Sweet nope. dreams, if you dream. Or do you just have nightmares? Just kidding. Well, that was a waste of time. Sleep well. Yep. So, Slendy is watching. The operator is near. Yeah, sorry, I know it's like middle of night for you. So, sleep well. This will be available later to finish. And uh, I plan to make a whole thing of it. Like, when we got the attic in here. Video wise. We can look in. We're going to need a ladder to get up there. Attic. Yeah. Oh, you think there might be one in the basement? I mean, we got to go down there anyway. Yeah. Might as well look. Whew. So Slendy's watching, or the operator's watching, is he going to be in the basement? Don't it's like. darker than I thought it would be. Well, yeah, there's no light. It's just a hole in Jay? the ground. You're what just in a hole in the ground. Huh? What time is it? I don't know why. Oh. Look at the window. Come here. 
there's windows? Oh, it must be one of those ones that's like on a hill. Is that outside? Yeah. Come on, we gotta get out of here. We gotta get out of here. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. No! Chest, oh, that hurt. Oh, that hurt my whole body. Oh, my muscles, my poor aching muscles. Here, take the camera. Come on. That was. Out this way. Very cool. But Come out. on, hurry up. Jay? Jay? Uh, Jay! No, 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 stay with me, stay with me, come on. Wake up. Can you hear me? Come on. Stay with me, buddy. Yeah. Come on. Come on. We gotta get to the car. Let's get to the car. And then we can get out of here. Come on. <coughs> Come on. Hold on. Where's where are we going? We're going to the car. That was right very behind. cool. How they get on the basement and it's instantly yeah. night time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I got it. You're gonna be alright.
Oh, that was fun. Blah. This is where Maskey lives. I mean, not Maskey. Hoodie. Are we? Oh, are we from the perspective of three again? Uh oh. We're gonna lose Hoodie? If Hoodie is someone we've... It, it, unless Hoodie to the Ark is someone totally random that, like, we've never been introduced to before, I'm wondering if there, it's going to be someone we have been. And there haven't been that many characters that we have been introduced to. So it makes me wonder... More walking. It's a fun time. walking. Walking. Oh, 
people are walking. Walking forever. This reminds me of that one part in X-Men Origins Wolverine where the girl grabs the guy and she goes, walk into your feet, bleed, and then keep walking. I don't know why I just thought of that, but it's like the unending walking. Uh, whose house is this? It seems familiar. I don't remember. Is it Jay's house? This is why I have motion sensors on all my way. Where are we? I kind of like the sound of pill bottles. Kind of a nice ASMR. Them just being like blah 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 blah. Sound. It's nice. Floor creaking. I don't like that. I don't like that. I really didn't like the way that sounded. It was so subtle and spooky. gotta get out of there you run you get out of there there's movement and you gotta get out and peter looks so cute over here oh my goodness he's so cute get out of there <gasps> I do the opposite. I always turn off the lights if I'm going to look out the window because I don't want everyone to see me. Looking out the window. Is it Alex? It had to be Alex because I'm even destroying the noises. 374. I bet this was just a real cashier. This wasn't even part of the thing. Oh, there's 
I get dizzy sometimes with all the you know. Times. The last one that really spooked me hurt my chest. It was a lot. Oh, hello. What? Hey, God. What was that? He's like, he like the hello. <laughs> he was like, hi. <laughs> oh. Because he's out of it. There, he really looks like Markiplier there. Like that little run and grab. Alright, so where are we on the timeline now? I woke up and I thought it was stolen or something. I was kind of freaking out. We agreed before we left, remember? You said you wanted me to keep recording everything in case something happened and you couldn't. Did something happen? Yeah. You've been... Pretty out of it since we went back to right. Alex's old house. Okay, so we're at the most current time. You remember anything about that? Yeah, I do. Yeah, I remember going there and searching through those those we bedrooms. Went down to the basement, and it became night. Went down in the basement. I don't know. It gets kind of it's kind of hazy now that I'm trying to remember it after that. Well, we ran into some trouble. You had some kind of seizure, and I had to drag you out of there. And honestly, this is the most coherent you've been since we got back. When you say trouble, do you mean? Yeah. Although something weird happened this time. What? After I found you, I managed to get close to it, and then it just disappeared. What do you mean? What'd you do? I didn't do anything. I. The only thing I can think of is that it had something to do with the medication I've been taking. I don't know. Some tiny pills are enough to stop something like this. Well, I managed to keep my composure and not black out, and had <laughs> He's like, probably the worst headache I've ever had after Rob? that. But. But the only explanation I can think of is the medication, which is why I've been sharing them with you since we got back, just to be safe, because I wanted to... You gave them to me when I was, like, unconscious or out of it or whatever? Yeah, I wanted to make sure that you would be, you know, safe, because... No, no, of... no, don't, don't, no, don't, I don't want your medication. Don't, don't give it to me just thinking it'll magically fix everything, because I don't think it will. We well, didn't have any idea who you were, where you were, anything that had happened. I didn't know what else to do. And for all I know, it might be why you're able to talk to me right now. Well, I'm fine now, so stop sharing. Interesting. Has anything else happened since we got back from there? They're in my house. Who? Yeah. There was a video that person in the hoodie was breaking into my house and stealing my medication. And they knew exactly where to go, so it looks like it wasn't the first time either. Have you noticed stuff like that missing before? A few times, but I never really thought anything of it. That's not good. Well, it gets worse. <laughs> Sums up the series. That's not good. Looks like Alex has been hiding out in my attic waiting for us to get back. Well, I'm not going to do that. That's my house. And we know we could be there now. Well, and we can go in prepared this time. House. We don't have much of a choice either because I'm running low on medication since I've been sharing with you. I'm out of refills. But 
There's some extras at the house. How many do you have left? Not a whole lot. Are you sure those extras are still even going to be there? I hope so. We need to head that way whenever you're feeling up to it. Because you need help too. Don't forget that. I think I'm fine. <laughs> Everything is fine. Leave whenever you're ready. I'll leave tonight again. We'll see something first and then we'll go. Yeah, what you get? Peanuts, beef jerky, nothing fancy. Thanks. I know I heard that too, Peter. Conversion. <laughs> Why did I say it like that? Conversion. Entry. Face. Entry 75. <sighs> Had those, I love, I love those little pulley things in the back seat. Did they get you scheduled? Yeah. Or they said they'll try to work me in as soon as they can, but they'll call me. I'm good. The sooner the better. Uh -huh. um, hold on to that or else it'll slide around on the dash. Okay. Ready to head over there? I guess we have to. Alex is still there. I guess it's us versus him. I guess he doesn't have that gun anymore. He could have got another one, right? <laughs> we saw what happened when someone tried to turn that on him. We can't just turn around and quit either. He'll find us eventually. Honestly, I'd rather go down fighting anyway. It is going to be really weird if it comes to that. We come out on top, though, because... I don't remember what all I did before all this happened. It wasn't that long ago. No. Well, I do remember that I was living in a crappy apartment by myself doing nothing. And now... So at least now I guess I'm... doing something. <laughs> what? I just wish it wasn't this. This is close enough. We're just gonna walk the rest of the way? Yeah. Hopefully that the tape is still there when we get inside. You got the next what? The uh, the tape that was in your living room. Whoever's in the hood found it in that video. Remember? I'm a little more worried about Alex right now. 
You sure you've never seen it before? Yes. Even though it's in your house? Every tape I had, I gave to you. All right. If you ever want to learn what the ARC entries mean, the Marble Hornets wiki has all the translations and stuff. Ooh, I'll have to look at that. I also, on my recommended, had the guy a couple years ago doing a 10-year anniversary live stream. That looked pretty cool. Spooky. Close them up in there. I just suddenly like got the urge to fight and hide at the same time. Basements and Attics. This series should be called Trees, Basements, here? and Attics. Oh my gosh, Peter is so I wanted to wait until I got so back and get a drop on me while I was asleep or something. Yeah. What is that? What? Who is it? Who is that? Is that Amy? Is it Amy? I think so. Amy. There's something on the back. I have him. It's got to be talking about Alex, right? Either him or whoever's in the hoodie. You know that address? No, but it shouldn't be hard to find. You keep looking around up here. I need to go check the living room. Wait, where are you going? Tim. I'm nervous. If he goes down the ladder, he's gonna mm. Looks like there's some kind of struggle in here. I know I sure didn't leave it like this. Did you check over there? That's where that tape was, remember? Oh, yeah. I'm not seeing anything. So my door's open. Huh? Yeah. Lock it. My medicine. Hmm? I hit extra bottle back here just in case uh, still here Knee shot. sure you didn't see that tape over here no but um you keep looking, I'm gonna go check the rest of the house. Come 
packages, packages. Karen's back. Welcome back, Karen. How was dinner? What did you have? Was it delicious? Did you find it? No. You done looking already? Uh, yeah, for now. I'm gonna go check the bathroom. Why do you keep zooming in on his jean oh. pocket? I guess I still got these. Should we get it for another refill? It's a bit strange, yeah. Jay. Um, I'm sure we're fine now, but just in case, I'm gonna go check the two rooms on the end. Will you check this one for me? Ooh, yeah. Denny's. I don't think there's any Denny's. What? <laughs> Jay, what are you doing? Give me the tape. What tape? I don't no, know. No, you haven't. Give it to me. Off. It. I don't know what's going on, but you need to calm down. I assumed it was a oh, Jay, stop! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> what is this? What have you been hiding from me? It's something you need to see, but not yet. If you watch that now, it's gonna ruin everything we've been working on. I'm leaving. Jay, come back! Don't follow me! Jay! Uh-oh. Something you need to see, but not yet. <laughs> yeah, Karen. Um, yeah, I was going to say that there was a Denny's about 20 minutes from me, but it closed, and I don't think any have opened. A lot of them have closed, so it's pretty cool that you found a Denny's. This is what was on the tape Tim had kept from me. Lore time. I feel like it's going to be an important one. Nighttime ambiance. 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 I'm Beyonce. Okay, hotel room. This is where Jay's staying. Ow. Just filming as he filming and he's just like chilling. Put Jessica in the woods against a tree. That's not a safe place for you, the person. Innocent person.
Jessica. Jessica, calm down. It's me, Alex. I'm Amy's boyfriend. Do you remember? Uh, yeah, I remember Amy. Okay, good. I know everything is really confusing right now, but I'm going to get you out here. Just follow me. Okay. No, huh? this way. What? Deeper into the woods? I know a shortcut. Come on. What are you doing? The person that woke me up had this. It might have whatever's going on somewhere on it. All right. We'll look through it later, but for now we need to go. I'm so confuzzled. This is hoodie filming. No, it's hoodie masky. This is back during the time of entry 32 and 33. Yeah, I remember this is back, like, you know, when she first went missing. But I don't like being out here. Trust me, neither do I. We're almost there. What were you doing in the hotel anyway? Why didn't you just go home? I can't remember. Don't remember what? I can't remember where I live. I know what the house looked like. I just... Don't remember how to get there. Yeah. That's okay. That can be fixed. Once you get out of here, I'm going to tell you everything. Okay, I'm so confused. Me too, Jessica. Who was that back there? The person in the brown hoodie? Yeah, I didn't get a good look at him. All you need to know is that somebody that wants to hurt both you and me. Mm. He's sacrificing her to the operator. Hold on. What is it? I think I hear something. What? Like footsteps? I don't know, maybe. Keep going. Going on the other side of this tunnel. You're not gonna make it, Jessica. Rest in peace. Oh my goodness, I love when Peter lays like that. To be honest, I love when he does anything. <laughs> I made a little TikTok of all the things I love most about him. My TikTok is called Because Becca Talks, but talk is in like T O K S. <laughs> Here, take the flashlight and keep going ahead. I'm going to make sure nobody's following us. But, uh, what? Just go ahead. I'm going to catch up to you on the other side. Go. Goodbye, Jessica. You are going to die. She's walking so slow. Do you see anything? What are you doing? It's all Jay's fault, Jessica. I'm sorry. No, Alex, stop! It has to be done! No! Oh. 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 Ooh, nice. She disarmed him. No, shut up! Stay right there! What's that? Distortion. That's cool. Hey! Over here! No, you don't. 
<laughs> don't run into his big long arms. You don't want it. You don't want it. Should I turn around? He's gonna be right there. And she's gone. I see like it almost looks like he's back there. Like watching. Watching us. Watching you. <laughs> this camera's been through a lot. <laughs> Hoodie or a mask? Kinda walks like masky. No, it's hoodie. No, it's masky. Jessica is gone and has been ever since I left that hotel. So has Amy. What happened to her looks like the same thing that happened to the man that approached Alex in Entry 49. The fact that they're both laying down and then they're gone. And Tim had something to do with it. He's been lying to me the whole time. Has he though? He's 77. an itty bitty little knife. Who is it? It's me. Uh oh. Come on, open up. It's me. Bye. It's open. an itty bitty knife. Tim? It's like a butter knife. I just want to talk. <laughs> I just want to talk. <laughs> Drop it! What else do you have? Zip ties! <laughs> Just want to talk? What were you going to do? How disappointed he sounds. Zip Sit ties! <laughs> Sit down. Jay. Get off! Get off! Now Jay's no. getting zip tied. You're a liar. You had that tape for how long and you never it was told me? It in my me. jacket pocket the day we both woke up next to that shack in Rosswood. <clears throat> I've had it ever since. And this, this right here is exactly why I haven't shown it to you yet. What are you talking about? 
about. I knew if you saw it now, you'd blame me for Jessica disappearing, and then that would make finding Alex even harder. Just tell me where she is. I don't know any more than you do. I don't even remember the parts that were on that tape. You should know that. Yeah, Jay, come on. Get with the program. You. Well, you're going to have to, okay? Because the way I see it, there's two possibilities. <laughs> One, she is dead, in which case there is nothing we can it do. It wouldn't be my fault. Two, she is still alive, and if she is, we cannot go anywhere near her, especially not you. You could be followed, or you could show where she is on your camera or something like that, and then she would get dragged back into this all over again. True. But if she's alive out there, she could need our help. Well, she has to be dead to us regardless, Jay. We need to be focusing on finding Alex because he's the one who's actually responsible for all of this. Blaming me isn't going to do anything. I looked at that address that was on the back of that picture we found in my attic. It's a nearby college. Probably the one that Alex went to to be with Amy. I'm going there and I'm not taking you with me. Not like this. Wait, Ted, just leave my camera. No. Leave my camera, I need it! Get it to me, Ted! That was a good yell from Jay. Just The way Jay has been acting over the last few months is causing him to be a danger to both me and himself. I did what I had to do to keep him from putting us at risk. He needs help, but I don't know what else I can do. I know what I've said is the truth, whether he believes me or not. He's out. Here we go. Oh, did he stretch? You cute baby. Love what we just picked back up. What are you up. doing here? Was it a hoodie? Hey! I didn't pay attention to the hands. Yeah. What are you doing? Oh. What are you Where's doing? Scissors. You could just use the scissors. Or are you gonna stab him? What are you gonna do? No. It looks like a fish. Don't. Hey, hey, wait! Wait! Interesting. Yeah. Animalistic. <laughs> I'm going to find Tim.
Then I'm going to find Alex and end this. Entry 79. Oh gosh, I was like, wait, is my sound messed up? Or is it just quiet? Ooh, we're getting rainy trees, guys. <laughs> the day after getting away from Tim's house, I drove to school he said he was leaving for. Oh, Timothy, I hope he has a happy ending. It's located in a relatively secluded area surrounded by woods. I wonder if anyone will die. Let's see, we got Jay, Alex, and Tim, our main three. Nobody cares where Amy is. Some people care where Jessica, if I'm remembering her name right, is. I don't know why I always forget the second girl's name, even though Amy was literally only seen in one video and Jessica was like seen in more. It's a small campus. There didn't seem to be many people around. That's pretty. It's so always interesting to see like a fire escape that high. Some of the building looks like they're not even being used. Some of the buildings look like they're not even being used. Like just a singular staircase from the outside going straight down. He's running. He's filming. Hi, Christina. <laughs> ah, scared me. Goodness. Oh, that's his little chest camera. <laughs> it's his chamera. the wrong side first. So, oh. interesting door. More abandonedness. Please no jump scares in this first one. Not the first one, but like first one of tonight. I don't see any like glitching. It's an interesting place. I feel like this whole series is like urban explorers gone wrong. Oh. Hey, hey. Okay, hoodie. Wait. Hoodie, hoodie, hoodie. Hoodie, which I think is to the art. Where's Alex? Where are you keeping him? Let me know if it's too quiet. Looks like long legs. What? Like you saw slendy legs somewhere? Or the operator? That sounds like Tim coughing. Withers 79, welcome. When he was first in the building, you thought you saw the operator's legs? Oh, hoodie. Hoodie's coughing. Hey. Oh. Hey, wait, wait, no. Wait, wait. Whoa, whoa. Stop. Interesting. Pick that thing up, taking it with you as a weapon. Hmm. Hello, Tim, Tim, Timothy. Tim, Timothy, Tim, Timothy, Tim, Tim, Toby. I just all of a sudden felt like dancing. It's because I'm standing today. I'm standing on the street. Oh, my hair kind of hurts. I'm adjusting.
Captain Timothy, what are you doing? So we got Jay, we got Tim, and we got Hoodie Man just sort of running about this area. <laughs> I'd be a great news reporter. <laughs> Tim, Timothy, the one known as Tim. He's very lucky that people often don't look behind them. Hi, Ryan. Thank you. I hope you're well as well. Hope you're well as well. Hope you're well as well. Mm -hmm. Benedict Cumberbatch. It'd be sick if he had a cameo in this. Busy at the moment, but wanted to drop by. Ah, oh, well, thanks for dropping by, Ryan. Hope things get less busy for you. And that you get to chill. That is an interesting car covering. Like, isn't that, is that a, what I'm thinking it is? Like, it's a, you park underneath it, but it has holes in it. So what is the point? Or am I not seeing it correctly? Look around, look around. I'm not getting motion sick yet. It always happens once. <laughs> He's going down. Down, down, down. Ew. Ew. Where are you going, Tim? I would love it if Tim just like, in that moment, was just like, why are you following me? <laughs> I can't figure out what's on everything, it's like, dirt but it almost looks like like spider webs that have just been like cemented onto everything which might be what it is honestly If I had any extra money right now, I would just sign up for YouTube Premium right now so we wouldn't have to deal with this. Hmm. 
Uh-oh. You in trouble now, dude. Hmm? Why is this light off? They're just both in the dark. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Rest. <laughs> What's that? It's pictures of them. Pictures of Alex. Alex tied up to a chair. Assess it. Benedict Hall, find Alex, find the Ark. Huh. Okay. Oh, I'm so nervous. Scalpel. Oh. Yeah, agreed, old man withers. Yeah, definitely. What is happening? Oh, goodness. The room I found in that be basement. Be oh my gosh. The room I found in that basement must have been what Tim was looking for down there. He must know more about this place than I do. Then how would you find it first? Well, you were just following him, but. Intriguing. Oh, hello. I went to Benedict Hall, but all the doors were locked. The being run at. Huh. So, like, the... Di didn't, like, the Conjuring series do a lot of that? Like, the nun just, like, running at the camera sort of stuff? <laughs> Sorry, I just thought of a... that kind of mimicked that in a funny way. For now, I'm keeping an eye on it from nearby. Go get some snacks and water, dude. You look tired. I feel like this is the kind of thing you get your snacks, you get your water, a little steak out, you know? Some cameras pointed at what you're looking at rather than at you, so that way you can catch anything, you know? Alex is in there somewhere. I finally caught up to him. Alex. We're going to get another ad here in a second. I can feel it. I never saw it either, but I feel like I've seen like clips from those movies. Um, oh. Quadrant. Looks like Dark Applier is nearby. Oh. oh. He is a liar. Oh, Dark Applier. Are we, we going to combine Mark Blair's cinematic universe with um with marble hearts, can you imagine? It's like one of the universes they pop into. That would be a cool little thing. Who am I? I'll do you one better. Why am I? Names That's how I read that. <laughs> He's still watching. Did he get any sleep? Probably not. That's my song. Tim's on a run, on a morning jog.
Is it open? Mm. The hard thing with this series is there's so much walking around, but you never know when something's going to happen. So even though I'm pretty sure for the next five minutes we're just going to be walking around, <laughs> I don't want to miss anything. Bathroom. Photographic studio and dark room. That's cool. That's really cool. A dresser. <coughs> uh oh. Is it Tim? <coughs> Is it Tim Timothy? Neldon Geller, that's the best I'm going <laughs> to probably say on that. Hi, ma'am, I don't think we've interacted before. We'll try not to be a nuisance. Hello, welcome. Now we've interacted. Oh, frick. Alex? <laughs> no, whoa, whoa. Alex? Did you sh actually get him? <gasps> Dang. Run, dude. <laughs> Sorry, no <Nelbon. laughs> Welcome. We've interacted now. Welcome to the finale of the Marble Hornet series. Reaction. Oh gosh. <gasps> no, 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 no. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh. That was very cool. Blood. Blood. Not funny. <laughs> oh, gosh. oh, gosh. I was watching through Matt Pat's GT Live's playthrough, Amanda the Adventurer, and he did he said the blood thing, and I was like, yes. It's so good. Blood. Blood. That was a great scene. No, no. Jay! Jay! And no bond, it's pretty hard to be a nuisance here. It is possible, but you? it's pretty hard to do it, so feel free to hang out. Jay, come on! Oh, I did not you. like that. That like you lean. Set this up. Oh, I don't like it. I'm hearing the glitchies. He has his ear. No! Has he been? You're not getting away again! Oh, I'm nervous. You get ads on my channel, Christina? Do admins like not get ads? I left Jay at my house so something like this wouldn't happen. I left Jay at my house so something like this wouldn't happen. This wasn't supposed to happen. Members still get ads, <laughs> unfortunately. I'm sorry. I don't know what to do. But you get the other perks for being a member. 
I don't have control over not giving you ads. But on all my members only videos, like the ones that I release that are specifically members only, those do not have ads, if that makes sense. Because, and I could actually give me the option to set ads on members only videos. And I was like, that seems a little ridiculous. Uh, entry 81. The following footage begins from when I arrived at the school, the afternoon before Jay followed me there. All right, hang on one second. I'll be right back one sec. I just need to, okay, here we go. Following footage oh. <laughs> begins from when I arrived at the school the afternoon before Jay followed me there. Before Jay followed me there. All right, so now I get so confused like what perspective we're from sometimes. Oh. Okay, so like, okay, dumb question. It was Jay who got shot, right? That's who I thought got shot by Alex. Or did I just totally like blank out for a second? having a good conversation scene hey. so it could oh. remind me what everyone is currently doing. Oh, I found somebody. Um, I was wondering if you could help me with something. Okay, good. I'll here we go. Good. Um, <laughs> like, a doing? friend of mine used to go here several years ago and um, could you tell me where the where I could find like the film department if there is one? Well, there used to be one in Benedict Hall over there, but it flooded, the basement flooded there a few years ago when everything was ruined and uh, they, they quit doing everything over there. Uh, okay, well, the reason I was wondering is because me and him are working on putting one of his old projects together and he says he thinks he might have left some of his materials back there. Yeah, and yeah. I'd be surprised if there's anything left in there. You'd have to check with Jacob. He's the one that's got the keys. I do the groundskeeping here. Uh, is, is he here? Okay, so as far as I know, and that I think, is Jay got shot and taken by the operator, right? Jay! No, he's already gone home for the day, but he'll be back tomorrow. That was a very quick check. Is, is he the only one that can let me in? Is there no other way? Well, there is a maintenance entrance over at that big building over there. Uh huh. And, uh,. I don't think you should go over there. They, they don't want anybody crawling around in that area, so. Mm. Okay, so tomorrow then? Yeah, he'll be there tomorrow in that building. Just go on to the other side, the far side, mm -hmm. the side door. Just go in there. Okay, well, thanks. All I tried to find another way into Benedict Hall, but all of the windows were nailed shut. I'm gonna guess at least Tim lives because he seems to be editing all of this in post. <laughs> It was about to start getting dark and I didn't want to be around there alone at night, so I decided to come back the next day. Jay started following me once I was back. I was going to where the head of maintenance was supposed to be, but the door was lock locked. Oh, okay. This is showing us what already happened. I found an entrance into the basement around the back. 
Oh, that was him dropping the thing. After Jay ran out, I tried to get the manhole cover off. I thought it might lead to the maintenance entrance the groundskeeper mentioned the day before. Are we going to hear Jay get shot? Crunchy, crunchy, crunchy. By the time I found a crowbar, it was dark again. I waited through the night while Jay watched Benedict Hall. Benedict. Sucks. Oh my gosh, I don't like that. That looks awful. Awful. I can't believe they actually even filmed in this. Oh, no, why? I don't like the tunnels because then he's there and he's gonna like huggy wuggy his long limbs. <sighs> Peter. <laughs> Tis not the time, dear. Christina, I swear. If that's you causing him to bark, I know. I, I don't. Hmm. Don't do this. <laughs> it's you. <laughs> looks pretty clean for a sewer drain. Right? It does look pretty clean, but it still makes me very claustrophobic. And I'm not actually claustrophobic, but it makes me feel like I'm claustrophobic. Does that make sense? And, uh, what's that? No entry unless authorized. Yeah, you shouldn't be there. Oh, I don't like the glitchies. I hear them. And I don't want his long libs coming at me down a tunnel. Uh. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, good, thank you, Christina. I just didn't know if you were gonna be like, try to freak me out on the last one. No, 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 what is it? Alex? Alex, is that you? He was kind of acting like an aggro, like, NPC. Like, who's there? Blah, 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 blah. <laughs>
Did he make it to the maintenance area? Good old hoodie. Oh, it was hoodie. Thank you, Tyler. That's a good point. I should have noticed the hood. I couldn't tell, though, from the, you know, without actually having the hood. <laughs> So heavy. How are you gonna do that going from this direction? Like, oh, I feel like that's harder than like yanking something. I guess you just have to get it up enough to then like, oof, you know. That was a good explanation. Tis hood. Hello, the dizzy rabbit. Ah, sorry. Oh, you're in a bathroom. Oh yeah, is he in the place now? My back hurts. I'm so tense. I thought I saw a face down there. Did you know manhole covers can weigh up to 200 pounds? Dang! Honestly, it makes sense, though. They're, like, chunky. It's kind of like like an actual weight, like it's like an actual like weight, but just as a manhole cover. Oh no. No. Oh, I got scared of his shadow. <laughs> this looks like my cousin's old house if you left the door open for like two years straight. I need to cough. <clears throat> I blacked out after this and didn't wake up for a few hours. Understandable. Jay was gone once I got back into Benedict Hall. Even if Alex was being held captive here, at some point he isn't anymore. We were lured out here but never warned that he escaped. We were lured out here, but never warned that he escaped. My medicine is also missing. It's probably stolen right out of my car by the person in the hoodie. I don't have any left. You don't lock your car, dude. You gotta lock your car. Hmm. Why is he eating his mic? <laughs> I need to continue where Jay left off as be best as I can. Good. Entry 82. Is this a long one? Yes, they're all like long from here on out. I've been without my medicine for quite some time now. If I don't get it back soon, I risk having a serious relapse. 
I also turned down the lights to make it more spooky. All I can do right now is keep going and hope that I get it back before it happens. The person in the hoodie who follows people around stealing their medicine, aka the medicine ghost. Medicine ghost can also solve crimes. Becca's voguing, 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 voguing. I am. I don't know what that means. I'm glad I am doing it. I don't care what it means. <laughs> I'm gonna assume it's a good thing. <laughs> I hope it's a good thing. <laughs> This guy has to sue the medicine ghost so he can get extra medicine. <laughs> I love this lore that the dizzy rabbit is making. Dude, you probably shouldn't be driving in your condition currently. You can barely get in your car. Guys, if you ever have to crawl into your vehicle, I'm gonna say don't drive it. Is that his vehicle? What are you doing? What you doing, Tim? Timmy? What's going on? <coughs> Laptop bag. Oh, is he, he's in... I looked around on Jay's laptop and managed to find the following footage, which I've never seen before. Peter. Someone in my neighborhood decided to play really loud music suddenly. I think it's coming from a car. I can't tell. So that's why Peter's barking. The date listed on it is the day before Jay came back to my house and attacked me. Who is playing? Can you guys hear it? It's so loud. Hi. So sad. He's, I swear, he's always posing for an album. Old Man Weather says, it's a dance move from the 80s. The way you were moving your hands when you came back from break looked like it. Oh, really? I didn't even notice I did anything. Uh, I have a lot of weird little... I kind of dance and sing randomly and I don't notice I do it. So I didn't even realize I did that. <laughs> this dude needs a doctor. Why did you just sound like Cosmo the space dog for a second? The space dog? The only Cosmo I know is Cosmo and Wanda. <laughs> or maybe do I know a space dog? Ugh, why are we there? I hate there. I hate that place. It's Slendy's little eating den. I don't feel like any entry we've ever had like a straight walk through this tunnel without anything bad happening. I think that's the first time I've seen someone actually just walk through the whole thing. I really wish they would go back to the way it was in the beginning where they would have Slendy just like hidden in places where they didn't see him. I'm gonna keep my eye out just in case they do that. I don't think they do it anymore, but I think that was just season one, but I missed that because that adds that element of like a feeling like you need to look around everywhere because you don't want to miss them. They are spoopy. I agree. Spoopy tunnels. 
secret <laughs> whoa dude you can't even walk come on now I think he kind of fell down like a little thing but still I still Inchy. Helping me, dear. That was a lot. Did I just see an inflatable duck in the woods? That's what I thought too first, actually, the dizzy rabbit. I thought that too. <laughs> uh, but then I was like, what is that? And then I was like, wait, no, it's not. It's just like a thing. Why was he just popping up? He was just like, hello, goodbye. He called Tim. Tim, it's me. I watched the tape I took from you. And now I'm at Rosswood trying to retrace Alex and Jessica's steps. I crossed through that tunnel. Secret but tunnel. But now I'm at that shack that we woke up at before. But that oh, layout is shack. wrong. It's completely wrong. We've never been on the other side of that tunnel. And when we left here, I know we didn't cross back through it. Rosswood has either shifted around or I'm starting to lose it. Maybe you went around it. Oh, oh, did I? <gasps> yes. Did I see him? Did they do it? I'm so excited if they did. I am so excited if that's him. You see that? You see that? You see it? Is that him? I think it's him. I'm so excited. I was just saying I wanted them to put the him in little places. Yep, that has to be, right? Because that looks like a suit and tie. Oh, so I love that. I love it. I want more of that. I want that. I, I want it. <laughs> Shifted around, or I'm starting to lose it. See him there. Yep. And it gets a little glitchy. Oh, love Listen, it. Listen, just call me. As Magneto soon as you get Alex. This. How are you? Welcome. I'm, I'm sorry. I know why you kept that tape for me, and we're not going to get anywhere like this, working solo. Right? So I'm going to come over at some point tomorrow. You should be working together. Then we'll figure out what to do next. Oh, no. Something's going to happen. <coughs> you you have a day off. Yay. Excited. I got to get out of here. Glad you could join. I'm starting to see things that I know aren't there. And it's starting to make me feel really sick. <coughs> I'm going back to boy lord. <laughs> oh. Oh. Dude, get out of there. Dude, go home. Oh, I'm nervous. But I'm brave. I feel like Jay is just, you know, he's gonna die. Oh, I'm hearing the glitches and it's making me nervous. Okay, hang on. Did I miss anything there? I just want to see. Was there anything? Nope, just a glitch. <gasps> oh, he doesn't look so tall there. Does he make himself shorter at times? He just looks like a dude there. But that's still pretty cool. I like when he's just watching it for some reason, like like when he's just like like when he just moves his head. Being super tall would be kind of not good if it's a small roof. But yeah, I kind of wish they would have had him tall and like leaning like 
through the little door thing looking at him or something. That would have been cool. I never received that voicemail. From what I remember, I didn't get any calls that day. Slendy was like, nah, no voicemail. He does seem to affect electronics. Jay's condition was much much worse than I thought. I pushed him to seek help, but I'm not sure that he ever did. Dude, you needed it too. That's like, (laughs) you know? I can only guess at what happened after the footage ends. Whatever it was caused Jay to go from being apologetic to violent. Hmm. hundred and seventy five or something screen movies no there's only six so far uh, <laughs> uh six just came out it is silent who is left to hear the secret your secret do you know i have for years i liked that that was cool arc awaits that looks sharp What do you see? Rubber duck. Regards. Unlimited rise, splitting power. No worries, you've actually not missed a lot. Oh, we've been live for an hour already. (laughs) I didn't realize that. There's been a lot of talking, so you haven't missed much. (laughs) Much. You haven't missed much. You haven't missed much. Entry 83. Tim? Tim Timothy? <coughs> Tim Timothy, are you crawling up the stairs? Should probably go to a hospital. <coughs> yeah. I win the nothing. <laughs> Chair. Oh, is th- is that where um, James? <coughs> Hmm. Look at those little indents in the wall. Maybe for lockers? It's a nice looking building. <coughs> As for abandoned, it's like one of the nicest places we've been in this year. Did Turning into a werewolf, yeah. Dude, all the coughing he's had to do in this series, I can imagine the actor was probably like, yeah, I permanently damaged my vocal cords. (laughs) Oh, it's all glitchy. Or like, not glitchy, but like, overexposed. Jay? JJ, J Bay. Jay. 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 Hello? <coughs> Hello? 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 It's me. <coughs> Who is it? <coughs> Look up. Oh no, I don't like it. Oh, is it hoodie? <coughs> It's like, here's your mask. There he is. I love how much Slendy we're getting, though. Sick. Run. Run. Where? Oh, you teleported. Dang. Is this the hospital? Oh, where are we now? We're on a street. Peter's darling boy. Where are we going? Oh, we're in the tunnel. Dang, this is sick. We're just going all over the place. <gasps> oh, we're getting beat up by Hoodie. Oh, we're oh, we're beating up Hoodie. Fire. Abandoned building hand. Brick. You don't belong here. Why did you bring me here? Oh, we're going everywhere. Oh my gosh. What the heck is that? Fire. Beating up Hoodie. 
so many things. Oh, he's a liar. Oh, we're just, we're going everywhere. We're going everywhere. We're falling down a hill. Oh, we're back in the abandoned hospital. Dang. Slendy is just like sending him everywhere. Ooh, that was cool, that like running. And Timmy. Your fault, your fault, your fault, your fault, your fault, your fault, your fault. Your fault. That was weird. That gave me like dark repair vibes. Your fault. <gasps> Jay? Oh, is that him after being shot? Jay! Jay. Are they both being teleported? <laughs> what? Oh gosh. Now this part's actually making me a little nauseous. Oh. He fall? That was cool. <laughs> Hoodie. Hi, Hood. Hi, Hood. Oh, chills. He's not even a person. Oh, we're in a field. Windy. Whoa, look at it. It's like his, like... Oh, that looks really cool. <laughs> Entry 84. I forgot to... Oh. We're still glitchy, though. He hasn't taken enough of his pills. Dang. That was weird. The chess-mounted camera has completely stopped working. <laughs> Dizzy Rabbit, there is a lot of funny and confusing in this, though, too. I've been well entertained. Um... Hope to appreciate the story more because he kind of organizes everything to help you understand. I do feel like this series is like, I do want to like, you know, watch this through once, you know, get a last chance. Interesting. A good sense of it, just as any other viewer would. And then, you know, start to dig into all the lore and appreciate it more. 
Um, but if you're watching this, you know, not you, Alex, but like someone watching this expecting me to fully understand everything, I don't think anyone does on their first watch through. You know, this is what was found on the tape. This is what was on the tape I found. <laughs> um, Alex Crayley's Marble Hornets auditions, day one of 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. That's a long time. Oh my gosh, he looks like a little baby. I wonder if they really filmed this way at the beginning. Or this is just me seeing him look somewhat happy for the first time in a long time. <laughs> Yeah, that makes sense. I mean, it makes sense that it would make sense. Does it make sense? <laughs> Does it make sense? It makes sense that it would make sense. Does it make sense? <laughs> Otherwise, many elements I'd still be confused about. Yeah, that's the thing is, I want to watch this through as like a first time viewer, get all the confusion. Um, but I also understand sometimes when you're watching someone watch something and you know all the answers, it can be frustrating that they don't get it, right? So I'm just saying that if you're frustrated, just remember what it was like when you were watching it for the first time. It's confusing. And I'm not talking, again, to you, Alex, directly. I'm just talking to the general populace right now that might get frustrated. Um, did no one come? Oh, my goodness. Oh, I feel so bad. He kind of looked like Mr. Beast there for a second. He looked like Jimmy. Oh, I'm so sad. Hello. Hey. Yes. Hey, Alex. Hey, Brian. Am I late for the audition? No, you're actually just in time. I was about to pack up, but uh, we can still fit you in. Were there Aww. a lot of other people today? Uh, there is some competition. Uh, if you just want to grab a script off the top there. And I would do seat. the same thing. Right here? Yep. Puts a table in right. front of and the it's door. Cold it's probably like today. a closet or something no one uses. So just scoot on up to the table Or a there. second door right that they just yep. never use. And say your name to the camera. Um, I'm Brian. Full name? <laughs> Brian. That is my full name. Are, are they doing a cold read? I know who you are. So, <laughs> so I'm going to be reading the other character's lines to you. Uh, you are, oddly enough, going to be reading for the character of Brian. Oh, wow, really? <laughs> That's like the one thing I am good at. So what Look I want Brian's you to do fit. is... Don't overthink <gasps> it too much. Just what I want is gut Alex. emotional reactions. You know what I mean? Just feel your way through it. Does that make sense? Yes. <gasps> okay, so Brian. we're just going to start at the top of the next page. Over okay. there. Brian, do you only wear right one outfit ever? Uh, yes. Okay. And just start whenever you're ready. Dude chilling in the background. Who was in the background? It's just not the same. Who was chilling in the background? Hang on. Sorry, I want to see who this was. It's like, so is that Tim? What I want you to do, oh, wow, really? Don't overthink it too much. Just what I want is gut Dang. emotional reactions. You know what I mean? Just feel your way through it. Does that make sense? Also, I really like Brian. Yes. He seems supernatural. Yeah, so we're just gonna start supernatural, but like he seems very page, natural right? in this scene. Like I forgot that he was right, acting. Yeah. It is uh, Tim, yes. huh? Right. And just start whenever you're ready. It's just not the same as it used to be. We were young, and we were so happy. I felt like, like she was my little secret. Now that time has passed and- I am so invested. It's not the case anymore. It's like she's no longer my little secret. It's, it's like everyone knows. Maybe she never was to begin with. Maybe what you really believed in was a lie. Yeah, but it felt so real back then. It was almost like... It was like for a while there, I truly believed in magic. There's still magic in this world, Brian. You just have to look in the right place. Well, wherever it is... Look to the camera. It's not here. Not anymore, at least. Great, that was really good. Yeah, thanks. Hey, did you write this? I did. Oh, wow. Good job, dude. Thank you. Yeah, man. Uh, so, just on your way out, if you would write your name and email address on that little pad over there. Okay, dude. And if you get the uh, part, I will be sure to let you know. Okay. Hey, you ready to I go? swear, that was the biggest yeah. reveal of this Who's whole that? series so far. Oh, that's my buddy, Tim. Uh, we were just I was genuinely out. shocked by that. Does he want to try out? Uh, I don't really know. I guess not shocked isn't the right now, word, but... Ask him. See if he wants to audition. Okay. Hey, Tim, you want to try out? Oh, no, buddies. No, I don't so. I don't really. Come on, man, it's easy. 
I can do it, you can do it. Come on. Okay. Okay. Great. Just have a Tim seat there. Timothy, Tim, 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 uh, Tim, 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 that script there. Oh, um, boy. I'm going to have you read for a different character, if that's okay. Right. Uh, I'll walk you through him. Uh, I don't have a name for him yet, but he's uh, Brian, the, the main character Brian, not that Brian's yep. best friend. <laughs> uh, I imagine him kind of cooler, more apathetic, uh, the kind of guy that always has a He's like, in his yeah, mouth. that's me. I'm yeah. cool. I'm apathetic. Uh, maybe some sort Whatever. Of facial hair, not like that I care, because I'm apathetic. Like uh, well, I, I already smoke, so I guess I'm already halfway there. Well, uh, before we get too far ahead of ourselves, let's just start with the reading. All right. So uh, I like that we're getting yeah, some right close-up acting from these guys. Real it's not often we have right a steady cam right Brian. in their face. I like the way Brian is just in the background. Like. Yep. So, and, hey, right there? Yes, okay. and you can read through it a couple minutes. Huh. Okay. Take a tour oh. of a place from the comfort Jeff of your Goldblum. phone. Jeff Goldblum. I'm looking at Brian right now and Tim. <laughs> ah, <laughs> sorry guys. Don't buy any of these brands. <laughs> Sarah, no, Unless their advertisements are on my videos. <laughs> no, and I don't want her to find out. You're going to have to face it sooner or His later. His eyebrows are fantastic, no, I yes. Really don't. Are you sure? Because that's Actually, not. You know, we can cut right there. Uh, I've heard enough. But that, that was fine. Okay. <laughs> it's like two lines. Thank you. Uh, and if you would just put your name under Brian's over there, uh, I will be in touch with you guys soon. Hey, Alex, we're gonna go get dinner after this. If you want to join? No, I'm fine. You know, I gotta, I gotta pack up all this stuff. I don't know how long that's gonna take. I mean, we can wait. Why do I feel no, like this is like a version of PewDiePie, uh, a version of Markiplier, and a version of Jimmy, Mr. Beast? Like I wanted to get some test footage, maybe some alternate stuff, versions. You know, you That's never, the vibes they each give me. Really a start on this kind of thing. All right, man, sounds good. Take it easy, Alex. You too. All right. Nice to meet you. Likewise. <laughs> I used to have friends. I used to film stuff with friends after school, and I would have them sign up and be actors and stuff. Again, I should show you guys some of my very cringe things. I, no, I'm not going to show it, but maybe one day. <laughs> I'll get for it far enough away from it that it won't be so difficult. <laughs> 305. Right. <gasps> was that, was that Slendy? <gasps> yes, it had to be. It had to be. It had to be. Oh, I'm so excited. I really like what they're doing in this. Yeah. Yes. I really like so far all of this. I feel like they kind of hit some really slow stuff in the middle of this series, but I'm really liking this last portion so far. I used to have friends. Dang. Is that what he said? I used to, dang, all the chat just came through <laughs> like at once. I used to have friends. Is that what he said? I was sorry. It was talking. Um, I have way more cringe things than you probably do. Hey, Alex, I watched your thing that you voice acted for, and that was really great. So I can't imagine you have that anything that bad. Uh, it's loopy. Just upon years of garbage in the internet to be seen. Yeah. Wait, I didn't read. Sorry. <laughs> Brian was one of the few friends I had back then. Hmm. Oh. He used to have friends. He was wearing the same hoodie that day during the audition. Yeah, see, okay, I'm way ahead of ya. Entry 84. I gotcha. But only because Alex pointed it out. I actually probably wouldn't have noticed. <laughs> I had no way of knowing it was Brian who fell from that window. I'm not sure what I would have done if I had known that beforehand. Is he okay? Because now I feel invested in Brian lore and I don't want him to be dead. That was recent. That is true, Alex, but still great job. At least three people would still be here if it wasn't for Alex. You have more stuff to do as Zane. Oh, sweet. Exciting. Feel free to send it to me. It was interesting. I'm not deep in the Star Wars lore. I'm pretty sure that was Star Wars, but it was still interesting to me. Uh, I know he's watching this. Dang. I'll be waiting here.
Entry 85. Brian is hoodie. Brian is dead. Is he dead dead? No. Tell me it ain't so. No. I'm invested. You can't kill him as soon as you make me care. <sighs> Yeah, dude, just throw away that mirror. It looks like such a crappy mirror anyway. You don't need it. I don't feel like he's just like retired. <laughs> oh, that's kind of fun. Lighters freak me out, not gonna lie. Like that kind. That's so close. That's really cool, Alex. Not sure, Dizzy Rabbit. I don't know what I thought was going to happen, but I figured it would at least be something. It feels like I've been here for weeks and no threats, no sign of Alex anywhere, just nothing. Or maybe he's waiting on me to do something stupid. Sip your tea. Seems like every time I feel like I understand how all this works, something else happens. <laughs> Same. I mean, I thought the safest thing to do would be to leave Jay here when I went off to the school and even that didn't work out. Why am I the only one that's still here? I don't want to be by myself again. This has been bad enough. I thought about buying a gun the other day, but I'm glad I didn't. I wouldn't trust myself around one of those anyway. Alex is probably out there somewhere right now watching me. Him waiting on me and me waiting on him. One of us is going to have to do something eventually. Of course, if he thinks I'm going to be in here, maybe I could be somewhere else. Yeah. Yeah, that'll work. I should have started talking to myself sooner. you doing, Tim? I decided to watch my house from down the road. That way, if Alex did show up, there would be less of a chance he'd catch me off guard. If he showed up at all, laughing at dizzy rabbits. <laughs> it 
everyone's talking wonderful lore in the chat and I'm just kind of reading along and then Dizzy Rabbit's just like shark and part of a jaguar yeah <laughs> hey <laughs> you haven't seen 79 to the end yet no hi ILS Yules. welcome I will be making a I want to make a full video of like my reaction to the entire series in one video like just put all the parts together so and then put some timestamps maybe so people can that sounds like a lot of work <laughs> I don't know why I always try to set up a lot of work for myself but I don't know I want to do it get to it eventually I have a little, like, a little bit of a cough. I'm not sick. Maybe it's Lendy. Water? Is the floor wet? Oh, I don't like that. Why is it all wet? Oh, I don't like this. Here I am! <gasps> oh, he's gonna burn it down. Where are you hiding? In the attic? He has a gun. He's gonna burn it down. That's so dangerous. The gunpowder could like ignite all that. This is all your fault. Why are you just standing there? I this man has me, a gun. Get out of the there. You're the reason any of this happened. Everyone is gone because of you. Oh. You left Jay, and you left Brian. Until you're dead. Yeah, stab him. So I'll tell you what. If you don't do the right thing and burn to death, you come and find me. We'll sell this. You know where I'll be. Dude, don't go in there. What's your end game? <gasps> Whoa, oh my gosh. That looks so cool. That's so dangerous. Did they really film that? Dude, you like walked in it and stuff? Get out of there. Did they really set a house on fire? Is on her scream arc. Ying, ying. Uh, if Alex didn't have a gun, I would have gone after him when his back was turned. I wish I did. I wouldn't have. He could have just dumped that all over you and then lit you on fire. House fire. Now my home and everything in it has burned to the ground. Wasn't that true in season one? Wasn't there like an, uh, something about an apartment burning down or something? Alex has destroyed everything I have. I don't care what happens to me as long as he has stopped. Alex gonna have to die is Jay dead too there's only one way this can end and he'll haunt me forever until it does yeah I have to find him we're we're gearing up for a boss battle I can feel it oh <gasps> guys we only have dang we only have two more I feel like this is the boss battle and this is the happy ending. All right, here we go. I'm nervous. I'm nervous, but I'm excited. Okay. Benedict Hall. Why does that look like it's like edited in? Like it looks like it's not real words in life. It looks, it looks like it's been added in. That looks like it's been added in on like After Effects or something. Was it like that before? And I didn't notice. Or is it just really there and it's just so glowy? Ooh. Guys, we only have 
15 minutes left of this entire series. Five and a half hours. Oh, there's no more videos from To The Art because he's dead. I'm probably going to be basically rewatching this when I edit my full reaction video because editing is always kind of like watching something like again in a sense. And uh, so I'll probably notice all kinds of things. I'm excited. Tim Timothy. Tim Tim Timothy. Sorry that I keep singing that. <laughs> Can't seem to stop. <laughs> Drink some water. Or don't, I'm not your mom. weapon you could have brought with you why why would you do that Ugh. you know he has like a gun right and you've got like a butter knife <laughs> I brought a knife to a gun fight <laughs> took the crown but it's all right All the liars are calling me. Nobody's heard from me for months. I'm doing better than I ever was. Is Taylor Swift's song about Marble Hornets? Conspiracy theory. It's a music theory. I don't remember there being stairs. <gasps> Sorry, the wallpaper scared me. Oh my gosh. Christina's just all knives. <laughs> Knife. Oops. It's just checking the poll. Looks like Thursday is people's favorite weekday. That's not Friday. Yep. I'm nervous. So very nervous. <gasps> Peter. You okay, dear? He's probably just throwing a tantrum because he's tired. Oh, hi, dear. Hello. <gasps> Sorry. Okay, hang on. I have a dog hitting me. Hang on. What? Thank you, Alex. Do you want to sit on my lap? Come here. Be my comfort. But don't hit the thing. Okay. No, I have to see. I have to be able to see. Thank you. No, no, no. No, stop with this gun, my dude. <laughs> Peter. Dang. Sometimes he just looks so good. Peter. Peter, dear. Ooh. Did he get shot in the leg? Oh, no. Peter's trying to comfort me. Oh, 
He's in the tunnel. Alex. <gasps> Alex, no, this isn't gonna fix anything. It's never gonna stop. <gasps> hard, Alex. Glad to hear it. It's tough out there, but I'm glad that you're Alex, setting yourself up for the future. It doesn't have to be We're like gonna this. talk about this in the midst of this. <laughs> it's not protecting you, it's controlling you. Thank you. Peter is adorable. We can fight it together. I know what it's like. I can help you. I've had to live with this my entire life, but I've learned how to block it out. I can show you how. If you kill me, then what's going to happen, huh? What's going to happen to you then? You must be a shell of a person just like Brian. I know exactly what happened to Brian. Dude got stabbed in the back. Huh? You killed him. And he died here slowly because of you. How's it feel to have one of your friends again? Oh, oh. 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 Oh.
You guys could see how cute Peter looks in my lap right now. He's like snuggling so cute. You see how it spreads? He dead. Is he dead? Really interesting. Okay, this is the last one. Whew, man. Peter is sleeping in my lap. Is Tim dead? Is he dead dead? This is pretty. Although this reminds me of that old car commercial, fake commercial thing where the face pops up at the end. From early YouTube days. Early, early YouTube days. Who's this? Tim? You like? Or is this before? I always get mixed up on time. Yeah. Tim Timothy, Tim Tim Tori. Why doesn't he just go live in the mountains by himself and try to avoid everyone so he doesn't spread it to anybody else? Confuzzled. Agreed. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. I can't it. Oh. <laughs> He's like, okay, I'm out of here. <laughs> His mask. Oop, whoa, dang, sorry about that. Okay, what's going on? What are you doing, Tim?
What are you doing? Everyone is dead. Who knew that Tim was actually our main character this whole time? I thought it was Alex, and then I thought it was Jay. Hey. Hello. Is that Jessica? You doing okay? Haven't been around in a while. Yeah, I'm fine. Why don't you stay they away from me? I got me on a new prescription, so I'm sleeping better. That's good. I mean, not great, but some. Yeah. Side effects? The ones you told me about. Yeah. Wish I could tell you they went away after a while, but... It's fine. You still carrying those around everywhere? Yeah, well, this, this one's Jay's, but he let me have it. How is he? Dead. He moved. Mm. Uh, I think he was finally getting over all this, and he just wanted to, you know. Start somewhere new? Yeah. <coughs> Where'd he move I mean, I get to meet him since you said he goes here, too. No, he didn't move. That's I guess what I would ask if I was in that conversation. Appointment time just didn't match up. Mm. <coughs> it's actually kind of why I stopped by. I wanted to let you know that I'm probably going to be leaving, too. This doctor? Just this area in general. Oh. <laughs> so that's why I wanted to stop by, let you know this is probably the last time I'll be around, so. <coughs> Alright. You, you said you are doing okay? Yeah, I'm fine. <coughs> Just remember everything I told you about. Are you okay? <coughs> Tim. Tim, are you sure? Can I to call somebody? <coughs> Everything is fine. Everything is fine. I'm... I have many thoughts. I feel so strange that we finished it because I've been watching this for like... Like six, seven months. So, it all began with a popular video. Alex making his Marble Hornet series. He didn't do anything really to summon Lace Lendy uh, or the operator, but it was all because Brian auditioned and then Brian got Tim to audition. Tim getting involved in the series is what caused all of this because Tim already had this weird supernatural attachment. Then Brian had to become hoodie. Tim was already masky at that point. Alex then is like, like negatively impacted by the operator, starts killing people, kills his girlfriend, Amy, random hiker. Dang. I didn't, to be honest, I didn't really care about Hoodie when he was just like, um, like, uh, what's the word? Uh, like a random person that I didn't really understand why they're sending all these cryptic messages and such. Um, this one's a little loud. Let me turn it down. And, um, but then as soon as I was like, oh, he's just a nice guy who showed up for the audition and like seemed to like, I don't know care and stuff like that I felt invested in then he was already dead so Jay died when he got shot taken by the operator 
hoodie fell off the window thing, died. Alex killed by Tim, dead. Dang, that's bonkers. That's a lot to take in. <laughs> but I had so much fun watching this series. There were some moments in the in the middle that got a little like, oh, okay, you know? And I really wasn't sure if I was going to finish this series, but I'm glad that you guys kind of pushed me to because um, I feel very satisfied now having watched it. Wow, I have so much editing to do. <laughs> I don't know what else to say, honestly. I'm very impressed by the series. I really thought for a little while there that it wasn't really going anywhere. It feels really well wrapped up. Like it kind of feels like, like I don't know if they kind of like made it work, but, and didn't actually know where they were going in the time, but it feels like they did. Um, does it make sense? Like it kind of feels like some things were definitely planned out from the beginning and they were just sort of lucky that it lasted that long. I really liked tonight. I really liked those that this last hour and a half of the series. Um, yeah. Thank you so much for joining me. And I hope you have a great rest of your Tuesday. Is it Tuesday? <laughs> and uh, let's end it off with the dance party. Let's do it. Thank you to all of my channel members. And for those who can't be members, thank you so much for being here and for just supporting the channel. Let's dance. One last dance for the many hours we spent on this series. And then it's farewell. Have fun playing GTA 5. <laughs>